Not, not. Not. Bottom. Hello. <laughs> hello, hello. Hope we're doing well on this <laughs> on this uh little Thursday. I know I'm getting abducted. Apparently, they said no. I don't want Comey. <laughs> they said no to Comey. <laughs> no thanks. That's me. I liked the I liked the first fortune redeem. Your psychic advisor calls called. They said she got them e girl nut clippies. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they do not want penguins. Oh my god, six percent. They like penguins are not useful for our for our, our goals. They do not. We cannot impregnate the pump the the penguins. I almost said pumpkins. My brain's mush. My brain's mush today. <laughs> How are y'all doing? I hope y'all are having a good day so far. I am. It's like I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm half awake. I'm like half awake. I cannot seem to to wake up today. That herb brain rot. Herb brain what rot. Ooh, twenty-two percent chance. Not. Nut. Also hi Doomface. And hello Pingu and hello I saw Jenna and Comey, of course. <laughs> because he's a nut. <laughs> Your psychic advisor called. They said because he's a nut. Because he is a nut. A nut because. <laughs> oh, <laughs> don't do that to your nut, or your nut will nut that way. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> that sounds like I like it when they I like it when the quote that it picks kind of sounds like something weird that like an advisor w- could in some universe say. <laughs> I think <laughs> that might be your doctor, not your psychic advisor, Doomface. <laughs> your doctor's advising you some things there. <laughs> it loves that quote, the Patrizio quote. That was from when we were playing the console game. Um <laughs> In the nut verse. The nut verse? Um. <laughs> starter nut check? Okay. <laughs> starter nut check. Um. What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah. The, speaking of console things, I did get the emulator up and running for, um, some possible PSP adventures for Sims 2 PSP. I don't know when. I don't know when exactly. I was kind of thinking about, like, trying out a Sunday stream. The PS2 game was too chill for stream, but it was, it has this effect where I genuinely want to play it again. Yeah, it was, it was, it was cool for stream. I liked it. I don't mind it when it gets a little chill, but it's just like, I think it was just so boring for me. It was a little grindy. Once we kind of, I kind of was hoping for a little bit more something going on. Yeah, it never ends kind of thing. But I think it could be a fun thing to mess around with on your own, you know, and take your time. Like toward the end, we were kind of grinding a little bit. Um, the music YouTube is doing the thing where it yells at me about my ad blocker every time it switches to a new song. So I have to refresh to let the ad blocker do the thing. So that's fun. <laughs> so that's fun. Yes, chill streams can be fun, too. But yeah, I'm going to. Tr- we haven't done the PSP Sims 2 one. We, we, I did the PS2 Sims 2, but I haven't done PSP Sims 2, which is supposed to be more storyline um, and lore. I don't know. So, yeah, I was thinking about maybe trying, like, a Sunday stream. Maybe this Sunday, depending on how I feel. Um, maybe we'd mess around with a, with a little console game on Sunday. That could be kind of fun. Hi, Dante's. How are you? I don't know if the DS version is the same or not. I'm actually not sure. You're dying. Oh, (laughs) I'm sorry to hear that. (laughs) I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you undie. I hope you are resurrected. I hope that all of Spectre resurrects you as a zombie and you become undead. (laughs) Yeah, but I think it'll be fun to to try it. I, I need to do herbs. I played it when I was a kid. I played it when I was a kid, but that's another one I want to play um again because like as a kid i didn't actually like accomplish anything because i had no idea what was going on you know herbs is fun and then i also want to do busting out i have a feeling that busting out would be the sec- next one after the psp version i'd want to try busting out because i have a lot of nostalgia for busting out i think busting out was the first like console sims game i played so hi morky how are you Herbs is also a bit grindy, but I like the style much more. Yeah, maybe the towny herbs are so cool. Okay, nothing out. We played Sim Animals. Yes, I I did. I think that was on Wii. Was that on Wii? I'm pretty sure I did play that as a kid. I think I remember something like that on Wii. I remember like not really thinking it was great, but I think as a kid, I was obsessed with animals. Anyway, like anything to do with animals, like I was the little animal nerd that was like watching documentaries for fun. <laughs> like, so anything that had to do with animals, I was there anyway. So like, yeah. <laughs> uh, you played Sims free play. I've never done free play. It's so bad looking back. Yeah, I, I never played the free play. Was free play only on mobile? That was like a mobile game, right? I never really did much mobile games. See, My Sims was one I think I might have had, but I kind of didn't really. I didn't really play it much. I know I have a friend that was like super into it. Did you ever get into those animal books that would be advertised on TV? Maybe? I don't know if I recall. I remember having these big giant animal picture books with like all kinds of different species on every page. I don't know if that's what those were. Played a little bit of free play, but it's so, so ugly, oof. Yeah, I've never tried it. I think I might have seen screenshots, but I've never tried it. But yeah. 
but yeah, today we're going to be trying out a little bit of early Pleasant View, some more early Pleasant View. Um, last time, so it's technically it's it's connected for those who are not as familiar. It's connected to our early Strange Town, and so we're calling it Early Strange View because of that. So this is a subhood. Our early Pleasant View is a subhood off of our Strange Town, and um. We're just barely starting actually playing the Pleasant View for the first time. We've only done one uh, household so far, which last time we played the Goth household, which was actually really fun. They were very interesting to play. I liked them. Um, but this time I have a feeling that we're going to have our hands full because we're going to be playing the Pleasant Oldie household, which is uh, Mary Sue and Daniel and Herb and Coral. They're all living together. And then there's also... Angela and Lil Lilith as toddlers. So <laughs> it might be kind of, I don't know. I feel like there's going to be, I feel like Danny and Herb are going to be fighting for, for ladies or something. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I played my Sims on DS, but I don't think it, I got very far. Sims 2 on the GameCube, I think I got pretty far, but never actually beat it though. Ah, it's the same as the PS2. Okay. Was Rainbow Animal Magazines? I was... Um, a ranger Rick Gorley instead. Gorley. Uh, I love me some My Sims, <laughs> even though it had horrendous loading times on Wii. Oh, did I didn't even know that. I imagine someone will die. Maybe if we're lucky. <laughs> Maybe if we're lucky, someone will die. Hi, Kaylee. <laughs> Welcome in. Also, hi, Hag Energy. Yeah, it. I don't know. I haven't. I, I didn't have a ton of experience with the console games as a kid, other than like busting out herbs. I I was really into my DS as a kid, so I'm surprised I didn't do more herbs. But I was like a big. I was a big DS enjoyer. Um, I think I mostly played the Nintendo Dogs. <laughs> I think I was a Nintendo Dogs enjoyer. And Nintendo was there a cat one too? Nin was it just Nintendo Dogs or was there a cat? I don't even remember. I remember doing that, and I remember some other little games. <laughs> Hi, Dreamy. Hello, your worst nightmare is here. Welcome. Welcome. You play a lot of Sims 4 recently. Okay. I go through, I've gone through phases where I just, like, feel like screwing around with it. And then I kind of realize, then I, for me, it's like, I, I had the most fun in Create a Sim in The Sims 4. And then once I actually try to play, I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm done now. And so at this point, I un 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 I uninstalled it, and I don't think it's worth reinstalling for me. <laughs> so I haven't had the urge because it's not easy to just open up. I have to reinstall, and by the time I reinstall it, the urge would be gone, <laughs> which is probably not a bad thing for me. Urban Danny <laughs> about to swap partners like they're in a Ao3 fanfic. Uncomfortable. <laughs> Uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm just playing Red Dead and getting the characters drunk and giggling. When they fall over, I need to touch grass. That's funny. I like that. <laughs> I do enjoy some Red Dead. I do enjoy some Red Dead. Oh, my music stopped again because of stupid YouTube. Gas and building are great, but gameplay is um, easy to lose interest. Yeah, in the bugs. Yeah, it's it's hard. Unless you're somebody who likes to play it like a dollhouse simulator. Oh, like literally, <laughs> what hags it? Sims 4 is the best doll maker and house builder, but gameplay is both stressful and boring. Yeah, it's like it's essentially like literally playing with dolls. I had somebody comment on a random old comment on my YouTube, um, where hi Poppy, how are you? But I ha I had somebody comment on um an old comment on my YouTube. Uh, I think I don't remember. It was like one of my info videos, maybe where I had replied to an original comment. The original commenter said something about, the, I don't know if it was my, my story progression thing, and they said maybe they, they liked being more controlled, whatever. And I think my reply was like, the, you know, um, Sims 2 lends itself really well to micromanagement. And then like months later, somebody commented like, um, actually Sims 4 is really good for that. <laughs> I was like, okay, <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> I don't really know what to say. It's just kind of sitting in my inbox. I'm like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> you can, you can, I mean, I think it is. I think it's just that it's different though, because like the Sims, the Sims 4 is very like, um, hi, Bubble Gamer Girl. Thank you for the raid and hello, oatmeal raisin cookie. Thank you for the, for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello, everyone. Uh, oh, you're paying Paleo Pines. Paleo Pines? 
That sounds familiar. What is that exactly? <laughs> is it, it paleo? Sounds like dinosaurs, but I might be wrong. <laughs> but thank you for the ride. Welcome, and I hope you had a good time. I'm trying to sit up straight. Hello, Foxglove. Oh, you got a honk. Yeah, I updated. I I fixed our olive oil redeem, so there's now a proper dinosaur farm simulator. Okay, okay. Also, hi, oatmeal. Okay. Interesting. That sounds fun. I used to be a dinosaur kid, too. Maybe I need to get on the dinosaur farm simulator. <laughs> um, oh, God. I, I feel like I was saying three things at once, and I've lost all of them. I've lost all of them. <laughs> uh, oh, one, I finished the olive oil redeem, the new olive oil redeem setup that I had to do. I finished doing it, so there's now... 18 variations of olive oil that can pop up so that's fun rather than before there was the last few streams i only had five there's now 18 um and then uh oh yeah i was talking about the micromanaging in sims 4 yeah i i feel like the diff big difference between micromanaging micromanaging in sims 4 and micromanaging in like the sims 2 is that the sims 4 you have to do everything for the sims whereas the sims 2 it's like you're herding cats like the sims are doing their own thing and you're like herding them together and like that's kind of the fun of it for me <laughs> that's that's I, I feel like that's the big difference like the sims are actually doing things in the sims 2 and the sims 3 <laughs> hi belly aches also hi bubble gamer girl uh it was like for eight hours a few crashes paleo and sims 2 back and forth all stream okay that's cool so you hopped back and forth that's fun I like a little, a little jump in between games can be fun. can be very fun. But thank you very much for the raid. Hope you definitely uh, go take a, take a break after eight hours. That's a long one. That's a really long one. Uh, Sims 2 Sims are like an ant farm. Sims 4 Sims are like pet rocks. Yeah. Sims 4 Sims are like playing with Barbie dolls. And Sims 2 Sims are like playing with uh, worms out in the, out in the yard. <laughs> Sims 2 Sims are worms. No. 18 olives is a good snack. True. True, true. <laughs> I hate the lack of accidental deaths and chaos is true. I installed a mod for my Sims 3 that adds more deaths. So I'm kind of excited about that. Kind of a little bit excited about that. <laughs> and the Sims you micromanage by really digging into their stories personalized. Yes, true. True. Um, yeah, because there's like memory, the memory system and the personality system and Everything is just so much more deep. And, and yeah. I'm having spiked mulled wine. Ooh. Okay. That sounds that sounds yummy. To be fair, Pet Rock Comeback 2024. One sec. Let me re I don't know, the music's being weird. It's just awkward silence because my music is being dumb. <laughs> to be fair, Pet Rock Comeback 2024 is on my bingo card this year. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> interesting pet rock comeback i got i got a drink Qui quivers and my mince pie okay not the mince nut i got a nut quivers and mince nut <laughs> butt spot please butt spot have mercy <laughs> there is a hidden graveyard full of more than 50 gravestones on my property in the sims 4 who all died of drowning burning and some slowly when insane and started it up. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Wowza. Uh, and waiting for this compression gear to start working. Uh, start doing things. My legs are angry. Oh. That sounds annoying. Um, I was thinking, I gotta get like a knee compression for my knee or a brace. I'm trying to figure out exactly what I need. Because I want to I wanna try to get back into the habit of taking Olive for longer walks more regularly. But my knee, I have one knee that bothers me if I walk for too long on it. I also don't know how uh, three and four don't have fears. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the the Sims 2 aspiration system works really well. I wish they'd add more drama in lore Sims 4. Yeah, that's the biggest thing. I was thinking about it. I feel like Sims 3 was this, the start of of the developers not giving a crap about lore. And then slowly we ended up where the Sims 4 is. Uh-oh, you're playing Sims 3, but game crashed. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm going to lurk and listen to Scram. Okay, Dreamy. Enjoy your, your drunk cowboys. <laughs> Have fun with your drunk cowboys. 
I have one back that gives me tr trouble. Um, if I'm working too long, if there's compression for that. Oh, like on your like your back. Um, uh, I think they have like back braces and stuff. But did someone say drug cowboys? Also, hi cursive. I don't know if I said hi. I saw you come in. <laughs> um, yeah, Dreamy was playing Red Dead and getting them all drunk and watching them fall over. <laughs> <laughs> that's what that's what was going on. Can I just remove my back? You you know, in our in this day and age, <laughs> I don't know. These kind of slip and slide around sometimes. So, <laughs> shake my head, get back here. Yeah, my I have one that like clicks and then it just like hurts after a while. Ah, oh, yes, a favorite pastime. <laughs> you can try a corset. Really, is there must be like almost like a medical corset that's like compressor. Dep I guess it depends where the back pain is, right? I am uh, envious of all the activities Sims 4 Sims get to do. Interesting. Yeah, I guess so. There is a lot. It's They're not too deep, but... I post a screenshot of Drunk Marston. Okay, <laughs> if you're curious. Now I'll just run my back. Okay. You can be, you can be like a, a worm on the ground. You can be a little worm. Dre dreamy the worm. Dreamy the Zelda worm. <laughs> I heard about a game called Legend of Zelda, but the evil princess that is supposed to be coming out on Switch. Oh, okay. I I mean, I know there's like, there was a new Le Legend of Zelda that came out. Um, That was like a big deal at the beginning of this year, I think it was. Sims 4 Sims are so boring and bland. The trades don't, yeah, I don't, I don't think the trades are super deep in the Sims 4 from what I understand. Are we doing just chatting? No, we are going to play some Sims. We're just, it's like a little, we're, we're just talking for some reason. <laughs> we're just kind of chilling. We can't, we'll swap over though. We'll, we're going to swap over in a sec here. We had the raid and everything and we're kind of just talking about stuff. We are talking about corsets. I put one on for my posture. Yeah. Okay. I need like, maybe I need like a posture thing. I don't know. I'd love to have a lot of activities for Sims 2 hobbies. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. More, more hobbies, more activities. Oh, if Sims 2 Sims could dip, my life would be complete. Interesting. Isn't there... I think somebody converted into The Sims 3. I don't know if... I don't know. If it's your neck, I don't know, man. But why not a neck brace? <laughs> a new neck brace. I mean, Sims 2 does take 20 years to load. <laughs> mine, mine actually isn't too bad. Mine isn't too bad. Oh, lost your copy of Tears of the Kingdom. I've never played a... Um... Oops, my thing's not picking it up. I've never played Legend of Zelda anything. TBH. TBH. Okay, I'm going to pause this music. We'll turn on the game sound. Okay. Here we are. In 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 the thick of it. Sims 2 knitting. Oh. Oh. Who, wait, who said they wanted Sims 2 knitting? Who said it? Wait, I just got if my Sims 2 could hack energy at hack at hack energy. <laughs> there you go. Oh man, I needed that. <laughs> oh nut, I nut that. <laughs> but but <laughs> why is that Sim naked? He was sitting on the couch naked. He's he's he just likes being naked. That's just a little screenshot from one of our other Sims in this hood. <laughs> uh, my game loads quite quick. Like in five minutes from launching to family, but Body Shop can take up to 30 minutes. Yeah, Body Shop takes a while. This, for me, clicking on the household takes the longest time, honestly. Okay, let's try it. Let's try and... We're going to try and zone in. I am I'm. I feel like I'm all over the place today. But we're going gonna to try to focus. <laughs> uh, Pleasant Oldie Household is who we're jumping into today. So we have Herb. His, his, his title is Sexy Senior. <laughs> honestly... That's pretty good for Herbie. That's pretty good for my herbal old spice. Correct, yeah. <laughs> like, okay. Coral Oldie, Family Rock, Mary Sue Pleasant, Bacon Bringer, seems correct. <laughs> Daniel Pleasant, Don Juan? What is, wait, what is Don Juan? Okay. <laughs> Angela, Miracle Might, and Lilith, Rotten Rugrat. Okay. Pretty accurate titles here. Foxy Grandpa. <laughs> I don't know why, but the initial boot up takes for forever. Okay. Five minutes of back and forth crashing. Oh, that's annoying. That's really annoying. Um, I don't know what. Yeah, that's. I, it's so weird how the game is so different on everybody's systems and everything. 
Don means pants, underwear, in Turkish. It suits him. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Don Juan means, like, having a lot of affairs. Oh, okay. So that after spicy Twitch rules update, I can finally stream Sims 4 with the Wicked Whims mod installed if I want to. Oh, yeah. I've heard that they might be adjusting some of it. Because the people are going, like, too far. <laughs> but. Another term for womanizer. Okay, okay. 2007, it took me 30 minutes, no complaints. In my old age, the five minutes is unacceptable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, I'm gonna read their little bio here. Mary Sue and Daniel seem to have everything under control. Both seem to have a very bright future. But now that their honeymoon phase of their marriage is over, and they have to raise twins, will they thrive or crack under pressure? And the oldies were invited to live with the newlywed, their newlywed daughter. Okay, Herb and Cole were excited to have something new in their oldie life. But will there be able to, but will there be able to find time for themselves while taking care of anyone else? Everyone else? Okay. Interesting. We, oh, oh. <laughs> Maybe the last time I was here, we had some, I might have had some pink flashing. Might have been when I was jumping around. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Things are a little... Things are a little crunchy right now. Hi, Arp Deco. How are you doing? Ah, oh, yes, Grammar. Yeah, I know. It's okay. I don't think... I think the, the person who made the town, maybe English isn't their first language, so it's okay. But I'm not, I'm not sure. Hey, I've died. I, well, no, you haven't. Oh, well, no, I haven't. No, wait. Actually... <laughs> Sims 3 is worth 15 minutes. 15 minutes. No mods. A gigabyte max, CC, three EPs, and it takes 15 minutes, blasphemy. Yeah, Sims 3 is rough. Sims 3 is rough. Um, have any pink flashing yet? That's good. That's good. Okay, so here's the thing. Um, oh, it's a little chonky because I haven't hit play to let everything sort of establish itself, but so there's, when you start up their household, there's a bunch of Sims already here in like a party. So that's why I was really interested in trying to play them. I think it's, I think it's the girlie's birthday party. Because we've got two cakes and a bunch of stuff. Like it's their presents, which is really cute. Have you ever auto not your own thoughts? <laughs> Honestly, I think there's some people who have started to do that. I think there's some folks who started to, to add nut voluntarily. <laughs> Voluntary nut. <laughs> this is the house. It's quite, it's quite grand, I would say. There's an extra house out back here. We got this. We got a really cute little garage zone. It's a little bit choppy right now. Let me just, I guess I could just hit play a little bit to let it kind of, oh, the garage door closes. I got to wait for the little BO thing to pop up. There it is. That, that helps yet. That should help us a little bit. Yeah. Um, we'll see if the lot continues to be chunky. I might have to get rid of some of the plants. I find that lots of, lots of active plants that have like life stages tends to cause choppiness for me we'll see how it goes um so how did herb burn down the granny house between this hood and the og that's true i guess i guess uh technically that's true you're right see because this wouldn't be here interesting i don't know I, we can come up with a storyline for that all my nuts are involuntary <laughs> okay dreamy <laughs> thank you for that very thank you <laughs> thank you for that thank you for that so how nut Herb burned down the granny house? <laughs> okay. So yeah, we've got this little zone over here, which is fun. So this is Coral and, and Herb's house. Like, did they, do you think they built this? Do you think they built this f for them? Or was it like here? Also, the wind outside right now is very loud and whistling. I don't think it's being picked up. But just in case you hear weird, like, sounds behind me, it's the wind. But we got very, like, old folks. I feel like Coral has designed... I sort of designed this. Excuse me, I had a hiccup. Um, it's part of the lexicon now. It is. It is. Um, but yeah, so we have a cute little garage. We've got a fancy bright yellow car. I assume that's Daniel. So then we got this like more chill little blue car. Um, yeah, we've got the pool out back. The pool's a bit smaller, I think. I think the original pleasant pool was a little bit bigger. But I really like how everything is set up out here. I really like the colors. And everything. Uh oh, my Sims just dived. It involved a child who had a knife. Oh. <laughs> oh. Um, but yeah, so we have 
looks like now how would they enter this oh okay there's a door here because oh, usually the door is like here so there's a little bit of a different orientation of mary sue's room i'm gonna have to just move this rug because the the shadows do a weird flickery thing on the rugs for me it's a little hap it's happening here a little but that's okay um so we got that going on that's kind of this is a nice little house so far um, I really like how everything looks. I haven't really had a close look at everything. Okay, so we have... So they come into here. Interesting. So we have, we have like... This is a really unique layout. They've got, like, this little walk-in closet. And then... So we have big bed and crib. And then... Cheaper crib? Is this, Lil is this assumed to be, like, Lilith? Is Lilith <laughs> got the cheap crib? Is she not the favorite? Is this Angela's crib? Is that what's happening? <laughs> I don't understand why Twitch unlocked 4,000 Pokemon emotes. I didn't ask for it. Ew, that's weird. That sounds annoying. Sneaks in with SpongeBob steps. <laughs> I could hear that in my brain. I'm a child of, of the SpongeBob era, and I can, I can hear them in my brain. Hello, tiny little tangent. <laughs> Welcome in. So yes, this is kind of an interesting layout of this zone. We've got a little bathroom with some duckies. Okay, this is Daniel's workout zone, I guess. That's kind of fun. I like this. He's got... Oh, he's got these the glasses. His super special charisma, charisma glasses. Okay, and then this is just like study room. Okay, I like this. I really like how this house is set up. Oh, and we've got like a pottery thing stuffed over here, but it's like nobody's used it. It's like old junk. Okay. Interesting. Maybe the fact they were having twins was a surprise, so they had to get another cheap crib quick. That's true. That could be it. I do like the purple room. And the bunnies, there's like... This is fun. It is very cute. So Lil, uh, this is Lilith up here. Let's read some bios. Um, I don't know if we have to fix hairs. I think mostly everybody's hair is okay. Um, Look at Herbie. Look at my man. I'm so excited to play Mr. Herbie. He's my fave. <laughs> <laughs> people who don't know the history on her me and herb are like why would that be your fave sim <laughs> like what the hell what the hell why the hell would you like herb <laughs> yes this is an early pleasant view hood yeah it's attached to my early strange town so they're all interconnected so we're, we're, we're starting the pleasant view side of it okay we got mr herbie got a little mr herbie what is your if being a crafty businessman, loving father, and reasonably reliable husband takes a lot of energy, then Herb Oldie led an exhausting life. Is is endless affairs? Has have we maybe he I think he's edited his bio a little bit. We we need a and, and also had about thirty girlfriends, maybe? I don't know. He wants to call up Aaron. Oh no. Not Aaron. Leave Aaron alone. Oh wait, I remember remember he remember the storyline with Aaron though? Uh I'm gonna lock in I'm not gonna do that. Go on island vacation. Ooh, that could be fun sometime. Yeah, we gotta look at their memories and stuff. But remember the storyline, so Aaron Beaker from our strange town, she aged up to teenager, and like part of Aaron's bio is that she thinks she's psychic. So we made her come to like strange uh early uh, no, sorry, let me try that again. We made her come to Pleasant View. And she... <laughs> the final vacation before they die. Actually, he's just started his... I mean, this is early early uh, Pleasant View, so they got some time. Miss Coral is actually an adult still. Um, but Aaron went to the, the Pleasant View Cemetery, and she thought that all of the, the Sims that she was talking to were dead Sims. Remember, we like made that little storyline? <laughs> and one of them was Herb. And she kept, like she thought Herb was was a ghost, and she was gonna try and make contact with Herb. <laughs> now he wants to talk to her. <laughs> he also wants kittens and puppies. I keep getting kitten and puppy wants. I don't know why. I don't know why. So what is your? Oh, you already read that. What are your memories, sir? Is <laughs> a world class empath exactly? Okay, so he's met lots of people. Um, met his grandch. Okay, I don't see. Moved out, moved in. Okay, Mary Sue, he got a promotion. He did retire after he grew up to elder. Got lots of promotions. Potty trained Mary Sue. Adopted Mary Sue. Promotion, got a job. Okay, did a woohoo. First woohoo with Coral. Kissed Coral. Made out with Coral. Very fist. 
very first kissed. Okay. So he hasn't had a lot going on yet. Interesting. So we, we're about to ruin this innocent man. <laughs> but story bottom of the you know final final decision. We're about to ruin this man. <laughs> Hi Dicky Bunny. Welcome in. I'm gonna take a shower and come back. Okay, have a good shower. Have a good shower. Okay, where's Miss Coral? Coral's looking cute. Look at Miss Coral. I think she's a cutie. She's got lots of want. She wants to flirt. She wants to learn to get a sewing badge. We could do that. Maybe maybe we should lock in and get a kitten. Maybe she needs a cat. I don't know if we need a cat in this household, but okay. We kind of get. Oh, Mary Sue went to college. Okay, I didn't see that in Herb's. Maybe I missed it. Okay. They've had some pretty um. Oh, she learned. That's interesting. She has one memory of learning couples counseling. Do you think that's significant at all? Could that have been? She also went to college. Wait, did Herb? Herb? Did we see that he went to college? Oh, he must have, right? Completed freshman and sophomore. Junior. Okay, he did go to college. Okay. That's interesting that she learned couples counseling. Yeah, she's trying. Maybe is it for her or is it for... Because this is already when Mary Sue is an adult and right before... Oh, no, is when she was a teen. Okay, so while she was a teen, she learned couples counseling. No, Mary Sue went to college and then... Okay, sorry, I'm, I'm mistaken. So, I don't know. Interesting. Interesting. What if Aaron turns into a cat lady? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if Aaron would do that. I don't know if that makes make sense for her. Oh, we've got... Okay, they went out of... Okay, okay. So when Daniel... Oh, I also didn't read her bio. Sorry. Let's go step it back a little here. Let's read your bio. Coral is the nurturing type of sim. She accepted right away when Mary Sue asked for her to help out with the twins. But surprisingly, Mary Sue built her a brand new house with all the comfort in the world. Now that makes a mother proud. Okay, so this is a newly built house for them. <laughs> I party. Hornet. So they literally built them a new house. Okay, we've got an old car out here. I didn't see that. Okay, so we got Mary Sue. Mary Sue's bio. Mary Sue is a very optimistic and confident young woman. She knows what's wrong with Sim City, and she's willing to change it from the inside. Of course, she's uh, giving up her pottery, but at times of urgency, there's no time for hobbies. Okay, so that pottery machine that we saw, like the pottery table we saw upstairs, kind of tucked away, is part of her little storyline that she's giving up her her love of pottery to to be in the politics career she's in the she wants to go up the politics ladder become the mayor r.i.p to the pottery okay had first kiss with daniel got a job so it's interesting they got married and then they went on vacation which is fun so they had like a little honey a proper little honeymoon touch taught daniel to walk coral and herb also, it's kind of funny that Herb already has the want to go on a vacation. He's like, w they just moved in to help out with the twins, and they're just like, oh, he's like, okay, I'm ready for a vacation now. I'm, I'm done. <laughs> Hi, professional party guest. How are you doing? How are you doing? Happy New Year. Okay, Daniel, look at this. I think Daniel might need a different hairdo. I think, I think. Uh, what is your bio, sir? Daniel was used to having every girl swoon over him, but when he met Mary Sue, she was hard to get. But that was what made it more fun for Daniel. With a wandering eye, not a wandering eye, I think this is supposed to say wandering eye, <laughs> not wondering. <laughs> He's got a wandering eye. Will he be faithful to Mary Sue, who's evermore drifting away? Okay. So Mary Sue is drifting away, and he is. Okay. The hair is so unserious, it kind of works for me. I don't know. <laughs> the hair is giving... Welcome to Ghost Adventures. I think this new hair is so rockabilly. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So we got little, little Angela. Little Angela's here. Um, I'm really excited to play all the Pleasant View Sims this, this way. It's really cool. Angela is considered the easy child. She dreams of being a fish. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
uh, for some reason when i was skimming that like i i was reading ahead as i was reading you know i don't know if that makes it like you see what's coming ahead and i and i thought it said flesh <laughs> it's like she dreams of flesh <laughs> she dreams of eating flesh me too angela me too interesting she wants to be a fish okay angela and her mermaid girl air of weight angela mermaid yeah mermaid mod okay i think she could buy that from the matchmaker i'm pretty sure <laughs> herb is tired i know how he feels <laughs> take care of two puppies and it is exhausting they're cute and adorable i wish they would calm down oh <laughs> lilith feels she has it harder than her twin sister which she knows isn't fair at least she has grandma to share her love of music okay so she's maybe got a bond she's not doing good aspirationally but she maybe is is more connected to her, her grandma so it's nice that the girlies have their grandparents okay let's hit play we've got apparently a party happening here um it's it's kind of i'm gonna turn the sound a little bit down um so we got mary sue and daniel here this is oh okay there's already something happening there's already something happening i just heard a, a boing uh we've got jennifer pleasant and john burb which is interesting so this is jennifer of course jennifer is daniel's sister and she, her name's Pleasant, so I'm guessing it looks like she might just be engaged to John because we've got a, a little engagement ring. The boing of uh ohs. Yeah, somebody, something's happening to somebody. There's, okay, this one, Parker Langerak. Okay. Now, I'm not familiar, I, I'm not as familiar with the Langeraks. I don't know if this, who Parker is exactly. He's into Daniel, whoever he is. Um, He lost his crush for Daniel. Is that what that he's supposed to have a crush and he just swooned to Daniel and Daniel said, Ew, no thanks. I think that's what's happening. It's Kaylin's brother. Okay. I get him confused, like who's the dad, who's the brother? Okay, he's the brother. Interesting. Parker is Kaylin's gay bro. Okay. Daniel's having none of it. Even though let's see, so Daniel already So has Daniel we looked I didn't look at Daniel's memories, but I know he Um Let's see, he might... Oh, he looks like he's got some interesting memories. So he grew up, moved out, moved in, met John, met Mary Sue, and then also met John Burb. Grew up well. Became besties with Mary Sue. Got rejected for very first kiss by Mary Sue. Went steady with Mary Sue. It's a negative memory. So it's interesting that he managed to go steady with her and then didn't get a first kiss. They mentioned that she was hard to get. Or whatever. Hi, Indigo Candies. How are you doing? Yes, a little strange, a little early strange view moment here. Uh, went steady with Mary Sue. First kiss with Mary Sue. Um, okay. And then got rejected for woohoo with Mary Sue during college. She didn't want to woohoo during college. Um, they graduated. Got engaged to Mary Sue. Fell in love with Mary Sue. Wait, he didn't fall in love with her until after they were engaged. This is just, like, a toxic relationship all around. <laughs> this is just... In Sims 3, Parker is Kaylin's brother. Okay. Yeah, I know Daniel... <laughs> giving giving porn stash Morty. But yes, Morty, Morty's got a little stash. I like... Look at how cutie. I like... I think Morty's a cutie. <laughs> okay. Jennifer went to college. Okay. Diane and Jeff, his parents died. He went on vacation. <laughs> He's like, my parents just died. I gotta go. I gotta go on vacation. So they got married. He got married, and they went on vacation. They finally woohooed. The first time they woohooed, they ended up having babies, twins. I'm sure that was kind of miserable for him. He potty trained Angela, got a promotion, then he had an affair with Grania. So that was when we're playing. So at this point, this is us that we've already played. He ended up um, meeting Grania on a, a community lot, which Grania is Cersei Beaker's mother in Strange Town. So he and she's like. All, all around town with all the manses. So she's, she, she, they're fooling around. Kiss Grania, woohooed with Grania. And then what's this? Oh, Bjorn. See, this is what I was going to say. I'm pretty sure Daniel's swings both ways right now. He's, he's turned off by Parker, but he literally had, had an affair with Bjorn Beaker, which is Loki Beaker's dad. We had that happen. Like Bjorn, I kissed Bjorn, first date with Bjorn, made out with Bjorn. Woohoo with Bjorn. <laughs> Kissed Bella for the first time. Had an affair with Bella. I, okay, yeah, we also had him and Bella. Him and Bella Goth had a thing. And also he met a cat. I think that's that's Cassandra's cat, Cinnamon. 
Okay, so he's having an affair with... He hasn't woohooed with Bella yet. Um, he wants to fall in love with Branya. Also wants to play with Angela. She also wants to play with Angela. They only have wants for, for Angela. Okay, let's actually play here a little bit. <laughs> I'm okay, not in the best condition, though. I'm sorry to hear that. Hope, you, hope it gets better. Wait, this toy... I just noticed this... Oh, God, it's lagging. Oh my god, my game's chugging because of all these sims. This one's all already- wait, these two are both already, like, dirty. Interesting. Interesting. Um, so we got Coral here. This is Tiffany Burb, who is John Burb's mommy. This is Darlene Dreamer. Look how cute she is. Look how pretty Darlene is. That's Darren's wife, Darlene. She's cute. She got- look at those eyelashes. Okay. Okay, Darlene. Okay, Darlene. And then we got Mr. Darren Dreamer here. Okay, we got Mr. Uh oh, these two are not getting along. Herb said I don't like these people. Um, and then we got Brandy. These two are jumping. We got Brandy broke, and this is Dustin broke, little child age Dustin. So it's interesting. So we've got Angela's about to age up, I think. Comes child in one day. I think we're supposed to kind of be prompted to like give them a little birthday. What I would like to actually do is delete these cakes. Uh, is it not gonna let me? Oh wait. The... wait. Mmm, I guess... Do I have to put move objects on? Oops, I don't know if I... There we go. Because I want to get... I have the, this one that, that um, does the cutscene no matter what. So you don't have to have a party to have the cutscene? <laughs> yeah, I know, it's so weird to see her in non-ghost form. Are these two, like, about to... Oh, okay. And then I saw I saw Dirk here somewhere. Oh, there's Kaylin. Ew, this feels so gross. Kaylin's walking around as a teenager. Also, this blush, ma'am. She's walking around as a teenager here. Like, it just... that's just, like... Then we got, of course, we got Mr. Mortimer. Ooh, Darlene thinks Mortimer's hot. And then this is little Dirk. Mr. Little Mr. Dirk is hiding over here. How did she- I don't remember how she died. Was it a fire? Why do I want to say fire? I might be wrong, though. Okay, yeah, we're chugging because of all the sims here. <laughs> we're all the sims. I think we saw everybody who's hanging out at our party. Wait, who's this? Oh, Ileana Langarak. So this is Kaylin's mom. Yeah, some of my- some of my girlies need their blush touched up. <laughs> Hi, Sandal. How are you? Darlene was fire. Okay. I didn't catch on the cake. Which cake did you choose? Um, it'll show the custom- so it's a custom- it's a mod. Um, I believe it's by Lo Limey Yoshi on Mod The Sims. Um, it's the cutscene birthday cake, I think is what they refer to it too, but it's a mod that's like a- it kind of like- I think it just default replaces the- the original birthday cake, but it- it's been modded to always proc the- the cutscene no matter what, so it's kind of cool. I think the only thing that doesn't work, there's not an actual cutscene for, like, for babies growing to toddlers. There's no cutscene, so, like, it doesn't matter, but everything else, it'll, it'll do it. Oh, good house cleaning day. There you go. I was vacuuming earlier. I was doing vacuuming. I vacuumed the stairs, which are all carpeted, and then Miss Olive Oil decided she needed to carry her bowl of dog food up the stairs and dump it everywhere all the way right after I finished vacuuming. So that was fun. <laughs> so that was that was what we had going on. Oh, oh no, he's running. Okay, these two are don't, not getting along. These two are poking each other. Dustin's crying about his mommy. Mortimer's trying to poop. Dustin, Morty's trying to go pee. Okay, there's so much happening here. Okay, um, should I should I have him? Maybe I'll have him age up. It's about to be six p.m. Maybe we'll have, let's have Angela. I have to have you bring Angela to cake, and then we'll wait and have maybe Daniel bring Lilith or something? We'll, we'll go ahead and, and make it happen. So I guess we don't have to deal with the toddlers for too long, so like, not a big deal. Yeah, see, it's, ch it's chugging. Oh, Coral will grow up in just one day at 6 p.m. Also, nobody has traits either. I've got to do traits. I'm playing the cowboy game. <laughs> Rootin' tootin'. What was the... Oh, my... Whenever I would play, I had a friend that used to 
Oh, what did they? It was back when Red Dead first came out. Rootin' Tootin' Cowboy Shooting Game. Or so, I can't remember what they called it. Rootin' Tootin' Shooting Game. Game told me to get on my horse, and I did. Oh my god, look at everybody. Look at all the Sims. There's so many Sims on the lot right now. I went to get on my horse, and I did, and my horse accidentally ran over the NPC I was supposed to protect, and he died, and I failed the mission. I hate games. <laughs> You're making me want to play Red Dead. I love being immersed in the Red Dead world. I'm gonna turn the sound down, because the cutscene's gonna be noisy. Oh, the, the balloon popping over here? <laughs> that was goofy, that the balloon just popped. Yeah, I have Red Dead on PlayStation 4, but then I bought it on PC because I don't ever mess around with my PlayStation 4. Oh god, she's trying to- look at the- there's a wall of bodies. She can't- please just put the baby down. What if I move the cake? Set her here. <laughs> she's trying so hard. <laughs> she's trying so hard. <laughs> Bring to cake- okay, maybe I need to put it back? I don't know. What if we moved some junk out of the way here? Like I put some stuff over here. She can, you can go here. And, and uh, 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 <laughs> she's struggling. She's trying so hard. Oh god. Okay. Did we finally? Okay, she finally did it. Let's see, I, I don't even know if the what if the cutscene doesn't even work now because of the goofing. Okay, there we go. We're going. We're going. We're in a wall, though. <laughs> Why? There we go. <laughs> okay. Uh, found some new places? No, thanks. That was for Herbie. <laughs> okay. Now we gotta bring... We're gonna have to give her a little makeover. I like her little pants, but... There's just people who are... Uh, what is he? Is he? Oh, he's hugging his his sister. I was like, "What are you doing, Danny?" How about how about we try to bring? It it was mentioned that Lilith had a connection with with her grandma, so maybe we could. Oh, everybody's dropping trash everywhere, y'all. Where are you going, Herb? Okay, okay. We we are struggling to get to the cake. Bring Lilith to cake. Can you get up there? Danny just showed attraction to Tiffany. Also, there's so much happening. What is this? Apparently Mortimer and Tiffany didn't, are not on good terms. What is going on? He's like, no, I, I will not talk to you. I'm going to take a screenshot. <laughs> what? Look how cute Morty is. I love how I can't get over Mr. Mortimer. I know there's a lot happening in this room. She shoved him a little. Okay, I feel like everybody's gonna leave by the time Lilith gets to the cake, and I feel like that's on brand for Lilith's life. I know, Morty's kind of dramatic. Look at how ch see how laggy it is? It's because there's 20 sims here, and they're all fighting over routing. See how their bubbles are, like, spamming? That makes my game lag really bad. So much to it back here. <laughs> Brandy's like, I'm not waiting for the other damn kid. I'm getting my cake. Oh, Johnny's got the nasty bird. Nasty bird? Nasty bear. Johnny's got a nasty bird. <laughs> that sounds like a it sounds, it sounds like a I don't know. I give her the mod love poppy. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Chuggy, laggy, potential Calicundia names. True. True. <laughs> Look at everybody fighting on the stairs. <laughs> they're, they're fighting for their lives on the stairs right now. <laughs> Boys, sort it out. Sort it out. <laughs> Nasty Bird. <laughs> Maybe that's what Big Buster just got to name her kid is Nasty Bird. Okay, come on, so we can sort out this this mess. Okay, she's blowing out the candles. Okay, now can you sort? Can you manage to put her down? That's the next feat. Okay. Oh, 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 oh! Nothing's happening. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the way the way that 
that Coral's arms were just like. <laughs> that was funny. Oh no. Honestly, that was great. That seems like it's a good indicator. Uh oh. And she's literally immediately peeing herself. Is this Lilith? Poor Lilith. Look at this is a this is an explanation of this these girlies. Look, Angela's on the toilet using the toilet and Lilith is like waiting outside peeing herself. After she just grew up in her Grammy's arms. <laughs> Poor little Lilith. Okay, we need these we need everybody to leave. Cause this is this is bad. <laughs> okay, somebody tell everybody to leave. Daddy Daniel, where are you? No, you don't need to go pee. Say goodbye. Ask to leave everyone. Woof. Woof. This is bad. Goodbye. Get the hell out of my house. <laughs> yeah, Lilith is struggling. The, sir, why are you just thinking about a cow? He really wants this cow. Okay, yeah, there's balloons popped. All our balloons popped. All our balloonies popped. Daniel. I mean, Darren. <laughs> Thank you, Rip. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta clear this out now. Thank you very much for the prime, Rip. Hello, hello, how are you doing today? I'm just gonna be a cheater and delete these, because I can. We don't need these baby toys right now, I guess. We can leave this down here. That's fine. Why don't I turn on... or turn off snapping? I don't know. This this area feels really empty now that I took everything away, so like, I may as well just throw some stuff here. I may as well just throw some stuff here. There are no thoughts in that little Herbie head. It's true. Okay. The girlies are jumping on the bed. Should they keep their little hairdo? I kind of like them. I kind of like the concept of them being like forced to dress the same as kids, but also maybe not. I don't know. Let's let's do a gussy up Change everything. I'm also going to just save just after that chaos. Just so we don't have to like do that again <laughs> if something crashes while I'm doing makeovers. Maybe they're allowed to dress a little bit different, but I feel like they wouldn't yet allow Lilith to be like an emo girly. Like I feel like she's still just going to be like a hopeful child. You know? We got we to gotta load her up here. Hopefully, I have a feeling that also my game's gonna be pink flashing in this household. <laughs> so. Okay, we're taking a minute to, to load her up. We'll take a minute. She, it looks like Lilith wants to make a friend. We've got, I know we've got Dustin and Dirk. I don't know what other kids we've got hanging around. Um, I'm gonna look at the every, the full body outfits because they're easier. I like that Daniel and Mary Sue give Lilith dark clothes as punishment, but then she reclaims that for herself. Interesting. Interesting. So this is Angela. See, the hard part is I'm not going to be able to tell them apart unless I dress them a little different. I could give them different hair, I guess, too. I like their little bobs, though. Their little bob cuts. What's she going to wear? Like, I feel like this feels Angela core. Is this Angela or like this? This is very... They've got money. This household's got kind of like money. Like they'd have fancy clothes. I'm going to add this one. I also really like this one. I don't think it's as, like, Angela coated with the color. I always think of pink with Angela. Maybe maybe she doesn't need pink. I mean, her room upstairs is pink. These are all, like, the... Uh, she could be... She could be... She's the next child president. <laughs> yeah, I do kind of like the little bob cut, so I think I'm going to leave it. It's growing on me more. We've got a fun little. I'm gonna add this to cart just so maybe I can use it for like a, a uh, like an active wear. We have like a little ballet outfit. Oh, there's also I like this little dress too. This is a fun little dress. Also, wait, I kind of actually the yellow with pink is is nice. Maybe we'll add a couple of these. Let's see which I'm gonna pick from a few of those. We have full. 
Pink and green or yellow and pink. I feel like I want to do either of these two. Hmm, I guess maybe the green and pink. I don't know. I'm going to try it. Deal with that. Uh, what is this? Swimsuit? I don't really care. That's fine. I could have probably picked a pink thing. Is that what she has for a... Here, we'll just add a random one. Make sure she has a pink one. No, she's got some weird outfit. There we go. I guess I should have picked a, a good pink swimsuit for her, because they do have a pool here. Here, we'll do this little sleepwear. Bum, 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 bum. It really, wow, it has been an hour already. <laughs> I do have Plat Asp's hair defaults in right now, I do. Yeah, I really, really like them. Highly, highly recommend. Highly recommend. Um, let's see, is this, what was this, gym clothes? I'm also going to add these. I don't remember if, okay, I do have these available. I'll give her that one. She's got a little ballet outfit. There's a cute short hair with a bow. Oh, maybe I will look at, see what's available. Underwear? I don't care about her underwear. That's fine. When does a child actually dress in their underwear? I guess if they sleep in underwear, is that an option for kids? I feel like for me, it's like I see them in their everyday in their pajamas and maybe their outerwear. We'll give her a pink outerwear. We'll give her a couple options. Dude, these two are just slowly fighting over the bathroom between each each part. I like how much they look like um, Mary Sue. Oh, that's not her face. Oh, she should have a couple of little little studs, little little things in her ears. I'll grab a couple of different. I don't think there's like a pink. So, Let's see what I don't know what I want to have. Zip, 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 jib, 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 jib. <laughs> Move. Move. My game is not going to be happy with me. I did default, I deleted thumbnails a while ago. And so there's a lot that are still needing to be like reloaded. Um, I do need to run an ad too. Um, that's kind of cute. I, m I might stick with the bob though. I guess the downside of the bob, oh, we already got some pink. Oh boy. Also, why are these not defaulted? That's cute, too. This is actually really cute. Bum, 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 ba, da, bum, bum. That one's kind of weird. This one's got like a, a... I don't know. I guess it's not too bad of a hairline, but it's got like kind of a weird hairline. <laughs> got a weird hairline? I'm going to run ads real quick while we're... While we're doing this, because it's going to take us a little while to pick through some stuff. Oh, there's a bow right here. Okay, I was looking for the bow hair. It's unfortunately like a weird blue color. Not a fan. Hmm. Also, this is kind of fun. <laughs> what about like this little do? She's trying to be different by tying her hair. She's trying to grow out her bangs. <laughs> She's got them pinned up. That's kind of fun. Like you could, it looks like their their baby, their little baby bobs are are like growing, <laughs> and her hers is growing out. And I, I might try that one. That one's so it's kind of interesting. <laughs> that should be Lilith's hair. True, I could do that. Maybe maybe Angela's is this. This is like a little bit of a groan. She's she's starting to part it rather than it being a perfect little chop. And then maybe Lilith could have the pinned up version. I kind of like that. Like we're actually playing out their hair growing. Okay, can you gussy up? Change into every day. So yeah, I hope my game does not crash as well. Angela is very upset. Look at her face. I mean, not Angela, Lilith. Lilith, come go here. Okay, the the oldies need to just, like, go home. Like, it's nighttime. I'm going to make them tired. They just need to get out of her hair. Sleep in pajamas. Leave everybody alone here. 
Yeah. <laughs> that should be the list, not butt spot, no. <laughs> okay, buddy, you gotta go here. Go here. Let her go here. Swap, swap. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Let me let her take a shower, just so- oh, <laughs> not her coming through the floor. Oh, they can't use this shower. It's put a little bit wrong. I think it's that way that it needs to be. There we go. There we go. She can take her shower, and we'll give her a makeover. You should also be tired, too. You're watching TV. It's 10 p.m. I'm gonna make you tired and have you sleep in this bed. Maybe Daniel wants to be in love with Grania. Maybe he needs to go out for the night and go, go out on the town. Mary Sue can go sleep. She wants to... She still... She has a want for the gold pottery badge. But I feel like her storyline... I think that's just popping up because she's, like, has one nearby and that happens for Sims. But, like, I feel like her storyline is more business. Like, she's focused on her work. Um, oh, where's their house? Where's their bed here? Um, I'm gonna make her tired. Okay, we're gonna make her tired. Just have her go to sleep. And when Lilith gets out... Do that. I've said it before when playing other Pleasant View, but L Lilith... I don't like the name Lilith because it's, like, hard for me to say. I feel like I eat the word. I eat the name. <laughs> Maybe it's just like me. <laughs> Maybe it's just like how I pronounce. Uh, Gussie up. Let's see. Uh, we'll do change everything. Could also be like she still wants it, but she pushes it to the back. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay, what is our girl Lilith gonna be? Lily. Lily Lilith. She could have, like, this little look. <laughs> Maybe we could let her have a little goth girly moment. <clears throat> Isn't it? These, one, these ones has, like, boots on it. It's like the public, the, they're the private school. There's also, like, a little black dress. I feel like she needs, like, black or purple. Her room's got purple. Should she wear purple? <laughs> I can see Mary Sue spending her free time obsessed with the podium reward. True. Maybe I need to see if I can get that for her. I like this, like, I dressed myself, I'm not like the other girls. Maybe maybe Lilith goes through, like, a tomboy phase. Maybe she's, like, tomboy. Maybe she's not so girly like her sister. Maybe that would be kind of it. You have to avoid- you have the power to avoid goth Lilith by not making Mary Sue and Daniel trash parents. True. That's why I'm like, maybe I shouldn't jump to L goth Lilith as a child, like she still has some hope. I wear pants under my skirt. Isn't that an actual song? Or is it- it's- I wear sneakers- no, I wear Converse with my skirt, or I wear Converse under my skirt. I don't remember- there's like an actual, like, goth song that's- that- that says something like that. Like, I'm not like the other girls because I- <laughs> I wear sneakers with my skirt. Hmm, I don't know what- maybe I'll look at the t top and bottoms. The separate tops and bottoms. I feel like maybe purple. What about- what about like this too? This is kind of cute. This is like a maroony purple. Converse with my dress. That's what it is. <laughs> In the family memories, Lilith was a goth girl as a child. Oh, okay. Okay, in like the original. Interesting. She's wearing Converse with her dress, and they're purple. Uh-oh. She's not like the other girls. <laughs> She'd totally be a tomboy, especially because she's trying to differentiate from her sister. Yeah, that too. Oh, she's got more Converse with her dress. All these dresses have Converse. <laughs> this is... Hmm. I might look at the top. Let me look at the tops and bottoms. I'll pick out, like, some... Like, yeah, she could have, like, some little cargo pants or something. Or some shorts. Oh wait, I like these little baggy pants. Wait, what if she had these cute little camel baggy pants? <laughs> wait, I kind of love- wait, can I make these work? Let me grab- wait, the little camel baggy pants? And like a sweatshirt? 
<laughs> she came out with raccoon eyes. Look at <laughs> is this is this baby Lilith? <laughs> Maybe this is baby Lilith. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Let's see what else. If there's anything else good, but I kind of, I kind of like this little moment. Oh wait, she did mention she mentioned loving music, and that's how she gets along with Coral. Maybe she's got this little band, generic band T-shirt. <laughs> I like the little generic band T-shirt. I wish it tucked in, but like that's okay, I guess. Or I could have different bottoms. Let's see if there's anything in these other converted. Oh, there we go. We got like this. This is like some dude doing something. I don't know what. <laughs> I don't know what. She's a gamer. Maybe she's a gamer. Or she has the one with the angy face on it. <laughs> I like this look. <laughs> I'll grab a couple of these. I don't. I think that might be it. I think that's what I'll do. Let's see. See what I can do here. I like the angy face. A little camo. Uh, swimwear. What's she gonna swim in? Is she gonna swim in with a full outfit? I don't think so. I don't think they'd let her go that far. Oh, she could have like a cool scuba suit. I'm gonna get another one that I can give to to Angela that I think matches her her like color scheme a little bit better. I usually move Lilith in with her grandparents so she can live the life she de deserves. Yeah, I've heard of people doing that. I'm just gonna grab some random stuff that kind of works. Do that. A little goth goth dress. Um I've never done that myself, but I like the idea of it. Oh, I've never seen this. What the heck? Why have I never seen this pajama? I must have downloaded that and not like why why why? Why did we make it a s I'm confused. <laughs> I'm confusion. Is it, it must be a rep yeah, I know it's a, like a replacement, but like, when did I download? I don't remember downloading that. The original has design, but their pants, yeah, maybe with big, like, obnoxious... Aren't they the ones with the big obnoxious shoes? I don't know, maybe I downloaded it with something else and I don't even realize it. Uh, gym clothes. You're gonna work out in... Um, these are all terrible gym clothes. I don't know. She'll just have like maybe she does sports. Sure, <laughs> sleep CC shopping. I don't know, man. Maybe I downloaded it without realizing like it was the variation that I was getting or so. You know, like V one and V two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was a default, but like sometimes I I just don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> sometimes I simply have no idea. Also, I haven't downloaded defaults in ages, so I guess I just haven't noticed it. Oh, this is underwear. I don't care. That's fine. You can have whatever you want for underwear. Um, outerwear. We'll get her just this dark one. Dark like her soul. I can remember in high school a kid actually saying that, like, very seriously. During, like, I got paired with this random kid for... I don't remember. some Something we had to do... And we had to like pick colors, and he's like, "I want it to be black, like my soul." <laughs> it was like some some like freshman kid. I was like, "Oh, oh, okay, buddy, okay." <laughs> and he was like full serious. It was very serious. I was like, "Oh, okay." I mean, in this version, Lilith and Angela like each other. That would be see. That's the thing. I don't know what's gonna happen. It'll be interesting to see. Like, I don't want to force them to hate each other. Um, let's see what we're gonna we're thinking about the top knot so should she have her little top knot i kind of like the little top knot on her what if she, should she already i don't think she i don't know if she should already have makeup on but like that's hilarious <laughs> but like but <laughs> clown core angela maybe they just let her they only let her use eyeliner but she just goes nuts with it <laughs> Where can I download this hood? It's from a creator called Guto Simmer. I think if... Let me see. I think my early... Did I... That has a link to the early Strange Town. That one, but it's the same creator, so you could probably find the early Pleasant View there, too. Um, if you look at their page. Maybe only for formal wear? Maybe. Can I actually do that here? Or am I not... 
Maybe I'm not able to yet. Oh, she's cool. No, well, what do you think? Like, are there any fun, like, face paints that I could use? Are there any, like, oh, God, the tears? These are the Vidkin emo kid tears. Oh, the Murphy stash. <laughs> the little kissy mark. I don't think we need kissy mark. Why are there? Oh, no. Oh, they're layering. I was like, why are there so many? Daniel needs a little kissy mark. Oh, wait, a little kissy on her forehead? Maybe her grandma kissed her on the forehead. <laughs> it's her little, her grandma's lip. That's Coral's lipstick. <laughs> grandma gave her a kiss. Got a little, she's got a little, uh, little zinc on her nose. Mime. Okay, that's good, Dreamy. <laughs> she's ready for, for war. I kind of like this for no reason. <laughs> Or needs kissy marks, yeah. Grunt core. I w I love I'd love to <laughs> burglar core. She really idolizes burglars. She's going through a kind of a phase right now. Oh God, look at that! <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna actually do any of them. I think we're gonna let her be. <laughs> Calicundia is invading early Pleasant Butte so soon. <laughs> oh, no. I was gonna have you change real quick, actually. Okay. 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 That's a uh, look at her. Oh, she looks good. I like her little outfit. She wants a cat. She wants to learn to talk. Um, <clears throat> um. <laughs> Get the poor girl a kitten. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know what's funny is Coral wants a kitten. So like, the fact that Cor and again Coral and apparently Coral and Lilith are the only like. Coral's the only one that Lilith gets along with or something. I don't know. So it'd be kind of fun if they both got, they got like a kitten. Um, I'm just going to turn on all lights so I can see. Or actually, let me, well, auto lights this room. I like some rooms to be auto light and some rooms to, like, in, to, you know, be always on just so it's not always dark. Okay, um, you're here playing with the dolls. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. <clears throat> I think you need to go on an adventure. He has a fear of having another baby. Also, we haven't done traits. Uh, should we do some traits right now? <laughs> hey, gays and theys, I've arrived. Glug. <laughs> Welcome back. I hope, you're had I hope you're all squeaky clean from your shower. Uh, let's plop this down. Add missing traits to Lilith, Angela, Daniel. I'm just going to let it choose. If there's anything that's really not, like, correct, we'll go from there. Okay. Give everybody all the traits. Oh, that's true. I could grant it. Is it still there? Uh oh, it went away. Okay. Well, I could have. <laughs> I could have. Okay. So what, what traits are we are we getting here? I wish I could play while looking at their inventory, but that's okay. Excitable mooch. Commitment issues. Good sense of humor. Over emotional. I think those could work for little Herbie. Oh, I spell like mango. Okay. Okay. Very nice. Um, coral. Star quality. That's interesting. Easily impressed. Clumsy. Unlucky. And shy. Okay. I don't, I don't mind those. Mary Sue is mean, eccentric, unlucky, evil, and star quality. I don't know if I feel evil for Mary Sue. I feel like I should get rid of evil and do, like, business person. Right? I don't know if I feel evil. Y'all ever feel like Mary Sue is evil? Yeah, I don't know about mean either. I wonder, but for me, because she's like a politician, I think mean like ruthless, like she's a ruthless politician. You know, ooh, disciplined is good. I like disciplined. Maybe we can replace mean with disciplined. This one, right? Yeah. We could do that. I don't know about eccentric either. Like, how do we feel about eccentric? More an opportunistic, yeah. Ambitious. Ooh, workaholic is good. Maybe instead of eccentric, I'll do workaholic. 
See, I'm, I'm okay with sw swapping some of them around. I don't know if I might want to change herbs a little bit, Mr. Herbie's, because I think herbs is... Maybe he could have, like, irresistible or something, or flirty. Um, let's see. I was doing workaholic. That's probably at the end, right? Yeah. There we go. I like that. I'm going to take this out and put it back in because it annoys me when, like, their traits are broken up. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Daniel dislikes children. Okay. Good start. Absent-minded. Okay. Light sleeper. Socially awkward. And hydrophobic. I don't, I don't know about... I think I might get rid of this one and this one. What, I don't know about absent-minded. Maybe? Let me see. I feel like he needs commitment issues. I feel like he needs commitment issues. Uh, like flirty. Right? Like, I don't remember how many I got rid of. I feel like he's more suave. Commitment issues. Yes, yeah, same brain. <laughs> Little olive oil. Uh, yeah, dislikes children I think works. I feel like daredevil. I usually will do Daredevil and like athletic, because I feel like he's he's he gets he gets off on like the cheating by because it's like the risk of it. You know what I mean? Like he likes that, the rush of the risk, and then like athletic. I feel like because he's like in the athletic career and stuff. I assume he is. Yeah. Maybe I'll get rid of this. Let's see. So what do they, they normally have? Five as adults. So I guess he could keep hydrophobic for some reason. The three X's in a row for him. <laughs> the three X's in a row. Right, did I want to... Oh, whoops. It, oh, it messed up her, her thing. So it, oh, it reorganizes them. That's kind of dumb. That's okay. One, two, three, five. Yeah. Is there a going to hell trait? <laughs> Mary Sue or Angela could should have proper mage, maybe. Yeah, maybe Angela. Oh, Angela got unlucky evil and photographer's eye. Interesting. I might get rid of evil. <laughs> I don't think she needs evil. Also, unlucky doesn't feel... I feel like she should be lucky and her sister should be unlucky. Yeah, Lilith is unlucky. Why don't I leave this out? We'll get lucky. Period. Read her. <laughs> yeah, and... Who's it going to hell trade? I definitely have that. <laughs> What else would she... We said proper, right? So you think she should be proper or... Or what about, like, diva? I feel like she could be diva. I feel like she could... Maybe she could be diva in proper. Or something. Or neat. That's true. Is she, like, actually neat in the game? What's her, like, personality? She's actually sloppy. <laughs> She's active. Maybe she inherits her dad's athleticism. Ooh, snot. Oh, social butterfly is good. Although she's actually not. She's shy. But. Diva is too posh for Angela. Interesting. I feel like proper is too fancy. Maybe. Maybe we could. Well, let's see. Um, is she a horse girl? Maybe she's a horse girl, equestrian. What if she? What if she inherits her mom's born salesperson? Sometimes I also like them to make sure, like, get their parents' traits too. Like, what if she got born salesperson from her mom, or disciplined from her mom? Maybe disciplined. <laughs> she's a thousand percent a horse girl. <laughs> says 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 Dreamy, who's playing the the horse girl simulator game. <laughs> You think Diva fits, though? Hmm, okay, maybe we'll put Diva back, though. Sorry, I'm, like, all over the place with it. I'm, like, all over the place. Um, what else? What else? Maybe I could do social, but what was the other one that was uh, snob? I like snob for her. I think we'll do snob. Get rid of this one. For a girl who uh, will be dating Dustin, she's e easily impressed. True. What did you get? I erratic. Never nude. Angler. Well, we're going to get rid of Angler. 
We can do... I like. I don't mind erratic. She should probably have rebellious or something. Ooh, well, Lilith could be virtuoso. Maybe instead of erratic, she could get rebellious and, and then virtuoso. Like that. I think that works. I guess now that we've um, been re-choosing re traits here, we could just... I don't know, how do, do we feel okay with, with... I feel like Herbie... I like Mooch for him. Excitable? I don't know. Over-emotional and good sense of humor seems right. Like, I feel like maybe instead of this, like a flirty romance sim thing... Oops, wrong button. Hmm. I think Herbs are good. I think I might just add, like, flirty... What's this one? Is this dramatic? Oh, dramatic. What if Herb is, like, inappropriate? <laughs> Herb is irresistible, you think so? <laughs> we could do- we could do irresistible. What's this one? What if he was- what if he gets inappropriate, though? That'd be interesting. Like, in this timeline, Herbie is- he wants to be a romance sim, but he just doesn't have the suaveness of, like, Daniel. Childish trait? Okay. I could see that. Definitely inappropriate. He's the embodiment of inappropriate. <laughs> Maybe, um, do we have like a horny trait? What is the horny trait? Because <laughs> that's just her. <laughs> horny and inappropriate. Let's see, we'll do this one. Um, and also thank you for the hydrate. I, I, we need to... He is a romance sim. He is. He, he is here. He's cold, too. Why are you cold, buddy? I guess just a combo of flirty. Yeah. What should I... Over-emotional or good sense of humor? Maybe maybe we'll get rid of good sense of humor. I don't know if over-emotional works. I think I'll just do that. I think that's fine. And then I think... I guess corals are okay. The only one I don't know about is star quality. Like, maybe, maybe she should be family-oriented. <laughs> I think that works. <laughs> Coral knows damn good she ain't no star. <laughs> family-oriented. Yeah, I think that works for her. Okay. Okay, you, these two are asleep. Um, auto lights this room. We'll do some auto lights. Um, where's Danny Boy? Mr. Danny Boy, I think he needs to call up one of his ladies. He needs to call up a lady. Get this out of our way. Please rise for our national anthem, the cowboy song. <laughs> Please put your hands over your hearts for our national anthem. Uh, let's ask out on date. We're starting out strong. It's a Monday. What, you gotta work? He doesn't have to work tomorrow. He doesn't care. <laughs> Star quality could fit the top of the politics, though. That's true. For, um, for Mary Sue. Yeah. Uh, we need our girl Gran. Yeah, he needs her. He wants to fall in love with her, so we're gonna get her out. Go to a community lot. Um, we'll take a car. No, we're not bringing anyone with us. I would stay in Pleasant View. May or maybe downtown. I'm afraid downtown's gonna turn my game into pink soup disaster. That's why I'm like... Boutique. All your food, reading, and entertainment. Maybe the pool? I don't know. I'm just gonna go hang out somewhere. Angela is older. Oh, maybe I should have gone to the saloon in Strange Town because I fixed that saloon. I think. I also think I fixed my issue with, um, where when my Sims talk they get an error. I'm pretty sure I fixed it. Tammy, when Angela is older, she should have angler because she wants to be. A oh, that's true. You're right. You're right. You're right. She wants to be an. Ang she wants to be a, a fish. <laughs> she, we really we got to do mermaid storyline for Angela. Well, to be fair, Mary Sue does get fired at, like, level two of her career. Oh. I don't know what level she's at right now. It goes to Strange 2 to avoid seeing one. Yeah. Oops. 
What happens in Strange Town stays in Strange Town. Yes, yes, yes. Let's see. Um, I guess they'll just they'll meet up here for now. Maybe it's just late. <laughs> it's late enough so they know, like, maybe nobody will be out. I don't know if we'll do that. That'll be like when they're when the kids are, when the girlies are teenagers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Daniel, what do you think Daniel's excuse is for being like, I'm not I'm not gay, bro. I just I just like a little bromance from time to time, you know. You know, I just like the feeling of a of a man <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> I'm not gay though, bro. <laughs> like what why are you walking so slow? He didn't say that when he was with me. Yeah. Well, he's literally had relations with the men of Strange Town, so like I just feel a very die. <laughs> oh, who's who's seeing this? Rachel Abrams. May look look away. She does not get she's staring. These two are, are very compatible, I think. She wants to woohoo in a hot tub. Do we have a we don't happen to have a hot tub here. This feels like the kind of lot that would have a hot tub, but I guess maybe not. Unless I'm oh, unless I'm missing it. I guess not. It's kind of chill here. We might go to a different lot. I don't know. Very attracted to this man. No homo. <laughs> no homo. <laughs> like opposite day. It's not gay. It's in straight. No, he's like it doesn't count. Oh, there we go. We got our want. That was easy. He's like, it doesn't, the people of Strange Town are not real. <laughs> They're just a hallucination. <laughs> it doesn't count. But those Strange Townians, they're not human. Yeah, he's sitting vehicle. They want to woohoo in the car. He wants to woohoo in the car, at least. I guess we can lock in the Angela want still. Can I ask? Ask to join. Get on in, Grania. Maybe he keeps his socks on. <laughs> does that does that make him not gay? <laughs> There's something in the Strange Town waters that's turning the friggin' people's gay. <laughs> Strange Town man hit different, yep. Yeah. Let's make out and then woohoo. There we go. Mirage in the desert, exactly. Strange Town invented queer people. <laughs> it's a tap water, yeah. It's been it's been siphoned through all of the sand. Alien nut. Yes, of course. Oh, there's a there's a vampire entering the scene. The vampire. Okay. Alright. Oh, she fell in love with us. That was that. That was what that's all it took. That's all it took. So he wants to uh, kiss or like make out with three different people. I think he's got two under his belt. Cause then <laughs> almost you're a little early <laughs> little early are they gonna do it okay there they go <laughs> daniel's so potent it happened before the woohoo even happened i could see daniel leading a double life one with mary sue and her kids the other with um, with a man sometimes i pair don i've seen don and daniel together in people's like storylines i think that's interesting okay but he's oh no he's okay he made out with Grania. he made out with bjorn did he not? Has he? He's never made out with Mary Sue. So he's only ever he's made out with two people: Grania and Bjorn. Weird. Okay. He doesn't want to make out with Grania. I guess we could just do it from the car. It's just a car date. They just came. He just they they they're just cruising. <laughs> they're just they just dr driving out into some random place, parking, and just fooling around. <laughs> I could see see Daniel. Oh, I already read that. Yeah. Um, uh, so highly charged that they both just find each other attractive. Donna Daniel. Yeah, the double D's of Pleasant View. <laughs> so he just impregnated Mary Sue. That's uh, something. <laughs> yeah, I don't think he he has. We haven't in, impregnated Mary Sue. Mary Sue, one hundred percent kisses with pursed lips. That, you're right. You're so right. We're already having a great date, and we like haven't done anything. Maybe we need to go somewhere else. Can I go to another lot and not ruin our date? Let's go to Strange Town. Let's go to the diner. Oh no! Is she leaving? Oh, I ruined the date. Well, we got our we got our Okay. 
He just said, okay, now get out. Bye. He just abandoned Grania in the middle of Pleasant View at, at 3 a.m. Daniel. I hate that. He just kicked her out. <laughs> he just kicked her out. Just sit in my car, baby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she got paid, too. Wait, she got paid? He said, see ya. <laughs> He's like, I'm hungry. Get out of my car. I mean, he he got what he wanted. I mean, he still has wants about her. I guess he'll re-roll new ones, maybe. He wants to meet someone new, too. Maybe we'll find someone new here. Oh, he found a rock. Danny, Danny boy found a rock. Okay. He's looking at that rock thinking, I bet I could screw that rock. <laughs> I bet I could get it on with a rock. Hello, AJ. What are you doing here? It's 3 a.m., AJ. I guess you can, like, you wanna... I don't know. Let's see who shows up, if there's anybody good. There's, like, only kids here. Oh, I think I have a visitor controller thing situation. Maybe he'll just go home. I don't know. Let me see. Um... Let me spawn the adjuster. I think I have age. No, I guess not. It's just teenagers showing up. Let me just hit um, age, ban all, allow all. I don't know. I just, I thought, because there's only kids showing up right now. I thought maybe there's something going on with that. Nope, here's, oh, there's Willow. Willow is swooning. Okay, Willow. Hi, Willow. Hello, Ms. Willow. Let's greet Willow Nigmos. <laughs> Danny's just standing in the shadows watching who walks onto the lot. <laughs> True, it's where all the teenagers go when they sneak out. Who who just who is this? Um This is Dustin Langerak. Sir? Okay, buddy. Where did she go? Oh, she's standing in the bathroom. We gotta greet her. Oh, who that? Oh, that's Gundren Beaker. We can get, we can get it on with Gundren. She probably she probably like us. Why is it so dark in this bathroom? We're meeting at a dark bathroom. Okay, he just wants to woohoo with Grania some more. Oh, he's admiring her. Okay. Also, it's quiet in here. Interesting. Does he already know? I think he already knows. Yeah, he already knows Gundren. <laughs> yeah, I know. Get, oh, Philly's gonna have a new sibling. <laughs> uh, dark bathroom? That's why the teens are there, probably. Look, all of these three in the dark bathroom. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, Indigo. Oh my gosh. They're all just standing here. Try a charm. <laughs> Thank you very much, Indigo Candies. I appreciate it. Congratulations, you got your- you got new emotes and a little sub badge and all of that stuff. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> He's getting so much love today, yeah, I guess. I, it's, it's, it's a- it's a, a weird little Thursday, but I- I appreciate the, the you know. <laughs> oh, she- did she turn him down? I think she turned him down. Who else is like a good- I feel like, does he have a cell phone? Wait, maybe we need to invite someone here. Maybe he needs to invite Bella here. Because he had a thing going with Bella. Do you have a cell phone, sir? You sh Oops. I'm gonna cheat him a cell phone because he, sh he should have a secret cell phone. He should have a secret cell phone. Uh, ask out on date. Everybody's swooning. Is she not? Even she's swooning. Is that not a teen? It's called Miss Bella. It's his burner phone. Yeah, exactly. His his burner brick. <laughs> I love this default. I like it just having it in all of my Sims, all my Sims hoods. <laughs> the, the 80s phone default. Was it an EP Olive? Invite his gay lover. True. Maybe that's. Maybe we need to push the storyline more of of his. Oh oh. Oops. <laughs> I just read the message that popped up. <laughs> EP Nut Olive. Thanks a lot for waking me up. Bye. Oops. Okay, Bella. Push the gay. <laughs> does he need? Does he, look at she? He has three bolts with Grania. Who who else does he have? Okay. Can we? How about we scope the room? 
Let's just see who shows up. I think this might be a teen. I mean, no, not a teen. She might be a, a, an adult. I don't know. She, the, she was acting like... Okay, she's into Gundren. I assume. Gundren is hot. Can I, can I talk to her? Oh, she's getting up. Why? Oh, she's leaving. I guess we might go home. It's already 5 a.m. Well... AJ just got chonky. Wait, <laughs> AJ just got up and got chonky. <laughs> He's a thick boy. <laughs> he had too many steaks and fries. <laughs> he had too many boogers. <laughs> he chonky. <laughs> he chonk. He do a chonk. <laughs> okay, who's that in the bob? She's serving face Boba Banks. Yeah, that's that's Gundren Beaker, who is Loki Beaker's mom. Her, Gundren and Bjorn are married, and they have Aaron Beaker and Loki Beaker as kids, but they also have, like, an open relationship where they just, like, fool around with anybody and everybody, like, in front of each other, and usually it's okay. I think last time we had a little bit of an issue with it, um, her getting jealous of her stuff, but, yeah. <laughs> They've got a very unique situation. This beer gut, he's a teen, he shouldn't have a beer gut. I also forgot I had a coffee thermos sitting here. I don't know if it's still warm. Daddy Daniel's gone all night. Hopefully nobody notices him. Why am I? I'm getting a pop-up. Let me pull it over. What's the pop-up? Why am I? Okay. I... I don't know. And she wants to earn money. I feel like... Oh, get it. Oh, she wants to get the girls into private school. I'm going to lock that in. That seems right. I was thinking about that, that we'd probably want to do like a private school thing. Also, I don't think I fixed like the day of the week. I just realized that. Is that we're supposed to start on like, I, I completely forgot about my usual setup. We usually start on Saturdays for every household. Um, How about we just do a set? We'll start on Saturday right now. Um, I'm going to change model. I like changing it to a little flamingo. There you go. Um, alter time, day of week. Make it Saturday. Hopefully that doesn't screw up our this. I don't think it will. I think Mary Sue should have shoe. Mary Sue. Why did I say Mary Sue? Mary Sue should have a fling. Interesting. Yeah, she's too busy with working and stuff. Maybe I feel like they need to hire a maid. Do you think they already have a maid for this house? Well, I guess Coral is here all the time. Does Coral work? She doesn't work. Um. Where's that? Does does he have any supposed possible interests? He wants to be friends with Aaron. That's not a good start, buddy. She's a teenager. He's got two bolts with Bella Goth. Oh, he only has one bolt with his wifey. Okay. Interesting. He wants to j get another job. What are his life? What's his lifetime wish? Have six grandkids. Reach golden anniversary. I think we need to change his his. Let me see. I'm going to turn... For some reason, I feel like... Oh, I guess I, I I didn't need to do that. I forgot about my shortcuts. I've been playing Sims 3, so I'm used to typing it out. Daniel's, Daniel's thing for maids could start now, yes. Perb, come on! <laughs> Perb, come on! Um, I don't remember... Uh, let's see. I have to write it out, because I don't remember my thing. Is that not right? We'll pro oh, I, I did it wrong. Oh my god. Uh, I'm just doing this because I feel like... Make sure that's off. I'll turn snapping on. I feel like my... The, this mod thing that I've been having a little bit of issue with, which is the one that chooses the aspirations... Uh, or not the aspirations, the one that chooses the lifetime wants. I feel like... I feel like it maybe sometimes goofs up when like certain testing cheats are on or something like that. I don't know though. What is hers? Become mayor. Okay. His? 
have 20 lovers. Okay. And the kids don't have any yet. So I'm going to change Mr. Mr. Herbs. I guess we'll fast forward through the night a little bit. Someone who is sciencey, tell me why I'm hungry and full at the same time. You're, so you're not hungry, but you're hungry. You're like, you're hungry in your mind, but you're full in your body. <laughs> is that what his carbs? <laughs> yeah. Emotional hunger. <laughs> Emotional hunger. Master? Look, at, he, These are his options based on personality. Car mechanic. So I guess Herb is a tinkerer. Have many lovers. Job hopper. Good vacation. Master of robotics. Repairman. Woohoo, many different sims, obviously. Let's see if it wants to work. Yes, it worked. Okay. I f okay. L L L L L Lilith. I think I need to take a picture of Lilith having a meltdown, just for the sake of... Something about insulin. Oh. Yes, no. Feeling snacky rather than hungry. <laughs> Look at her. Girlie is mad. The her her easy bake oven got left face in the wrong way and she is angry about it. Oh, that door is blocked. That is a blocked door. Maybe it shouldn't even go here. Maybe it... Where should it go? I'm just going to delete some of these toys that I don't need. There we go. Yeah, Lilith, just gets to get used to it. Oops. <laughs> I was controlling Herb. I was trying to get Herb to use the Easy Bake Oven. No, we'll have you do it. Um, She wants to get a good grade. She does want a kitten. I think we definitely need to do the kitten thing. Oh, you two are up. Up early. I feel like, I feel like, you know what? Wait, I kind of wanted her to, wait, put this down. I want her to, she's going to like serve breakfast for everybody over here, I feel like. Serve some, she's going to like serve everybody breakfast. Oh, Daniel's home just in time. Daniel's coming in just in time. Nobody's, even Coral isn't going to realize that he just came in. <laughs> Maybe. Vanilla? Uh-oh, she even burnt her cake. Or her muffin. <laughs> Insulin resistance, Mama. She's resisting. <laughs> um, I just baked a vanilla chiffon cake. Ooh, speaking of carbs, that sounds yummy, though. That sounds yummy. Where are you headed? No, you're not going to go stomp on those. You're going to come here and sit down and wait for your food. I hear you being awake. How about you come down and sit? What are you doing? What are you doing? Get cereal? Okay. Just a very impatient little character. Very, very impatient. <laughs> Thank you for the burger there. I'll be wanting to make five million more sims in free so right now. <laughs> They're fun to make. <laughs> What is that pop-up burglar? You mean the the burglar in the picture? Um, the, the little burglar picture that pops up is the default uh, burglar in Pleasant View, I think it is. Isn't it Gordon? I think his name's Gordon something. Okay, the girlies are being impatient. Your grandma's making you pancakes. She's not even done with the pancakes yet. <laughs> Mr. Gordon King, yeah. I assume he's probably in this hood. He might have a randomized name. Hi, Danny. Can I help you? Sit on down. Danny says, I'm waiting for pancakes from from Mommy mommy Coral. <laughs> what if Danny and Coral had a thing? Imagine if imagine if Danny, Danny and Coral had a thing. That would be creepy. That would be weird. <laughs> that would be weird. Also, you know what? I need to... Oh, she burned the pancakes. <laughs> the most dangerous thing you ever said. They're not related. <laughs> Car bloating after woohoo, I guess so. Where she's taking them. She's taking them outside. What okay. I can see that this house with the multiple uh, Herb Herb's already serving burnt pancakes at, what are you two doing? <laughs> I can see okay, so so here's the storyline. <laughs> so here's what's happening. Here's the storyline. 
Coral and Herb think that they have moved here to help with the twins. In reality, Coral and Herb have been convinced to move here because both of them are starting to show signs of dementia. <laughs> and they are they need to be supervised. <laughs> and this is this is this is their normal morning. <laughs> That's the storyline. <laughs> like she saluted the dish of burnt pancakes. Yeah, yeah. They always do that. I'm a bit surprised Gordon King um, is in a playable family here. That's true. He's one of the first townies I, I made playable after Kaylin. Okay. I like that. Okay, Danny's gonna go to work. She's gonna go to work. Alright. It's Saturday, though, so the girlies don't have to... Girlies are gonna be home with Grandma and Grandpa. Okay, yeah. yeah. Um, I can tell that, like... Because of the way this this household is set up with two homes, the yeah it's burned. One's both of them are burned. I can tell tell the way that it's set up that maybe these will be an issue. Like maybe I need to get rid of this. Maybe I need to get rid of this this table because I don't. Why did she favor not? Why did she favor this table not this one? You know. Girls had good sense to eat cereal. Yeah. I'll turn move objects back on. I think I'm gonna remove this even though it looks cute. Here, we'll, like, leave a couple of chairs out here. Also, somebody kicked over our trash can. I'll leave it for right now. It's just gonna... Oh! <laughs> Did you hear the sound Herb was making while he ate? <laughs> <laughs> he was going, ooh -hee, ooh -hee, ah, while he's shoving pancakes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that table nearer than the other table inside the home? Yeah. I guess. I don't know why. Sometimes it's weird to make... I don't know what the, the choices they make. Eat your grandma's burnt pancakes right now. <laughs> lick, lick. <laughs> lick, lick. <laughs> she has dementia. That's terrible. It's terrible. Well, that's the thing is there was... I guess, was it... Because couldn't she have served? Cause, so, so you can see she put two pancakes here. Because they were sitting... What? What am I hearing? Let me t I think I need to turn the sound up a little bit. What did I just hear? What are you doing? Where are you? Oh. The sounds he's making? Guito. Guito. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! <laughs> I love that yeehaw transcends the the simlish language. Why is that so funny? I guess I just don't hear the elders dance. I hate it. <laughs> okay, buddy. <laughs> okay. He keeps wanting to be friends with Aaron. <gasps> he wants to go and ask a sim on a date. I'm gonna still lock in the this because I think that'd be fun. He wants a cell phone. He wants to go buy a secret cell phone. Maybe he's gonna go on an adventure to a community lot today. While Coral stays with the girlies and does girl girly stuff. I don't know. What do the what do the kids want to do? She's gonna like come in here and like watch them or something, you know? But what if I do what if I do macro clean? I'll do macro clean for Coral. Oh, I don't know what I just hit. Mac, oh. There we go. Uh, we're gonna have you... I need your everyday. Actually, you should have taken a shower. Hi, Mal! How are you doing? Welcome to the early Strangetown chaos. Um, like the hair she's wearing right now, the clay. Yeah, it's worked really well. Her, her little clay bun, this one. What are you doing out here, girly? Can you pick up these? No, you can't. Um, yeah, I'm really ha This one's part of Flat Asp's um, defaults. Groaning, I don't know how to spell. Just <laughs> the verse, the visceral groaning, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Gabby. <laughs> the cowboy song. Um, what is this little gremlin gonna do? What, what, what does she do? 
she's gonna come do stuff maybe she'll like read i don't know stuff read a book read a read a mystery book just do stuff do stuff but i'm doing good gabby i hope you're doing well hope you're doing well the sound of Sue's making when they special dances on hinge yeah yeah <laughs> it's funny Hubert song Hubert song i downloaded a bunch of the the um the, the sims that i know you made Pingu, and then also i think i know crystal beth made some and i downloaded a bunch so i have them in the game i gotta decide how i want to inter add them i don't need too many right now so i don't know when and how but i did download them so that i have them i don't know the word visceral so i just googled it up and i can regret it oh no visceral yeah flop era nut nut fee nut this this natural <laughs> okay butt spot yeah early pleasant view has been fun so far i'm excited to keep kind of exploring it um okay buddy why did he why did he change in why why is he in this <laughs> he he got out of the tub wait also i had him take a shower can he not oh he might not be able to get in the shower might be facing the wrong way i think it has to face this way <laughs> he got out and changed into his underwear, sir? I need you to get dressed. Herb Herb does everything he can to make things difficult. Um, let's go somewhere. Uh, we're gonna go on our own. We're gonna stay in Pleasant View. I'm gonna have him... Let's go here. I'm gonna go shopping real quick. Real quick. Thank you for the follow, Tazza. Welcome in. Maybe it's you're right. It might be a, a right um easily pronounced name. I think it might be part of inappropriate. That's true. I did forget about that. He's ready for action. Dun dun dun. <laughs> uh downloaded a bunch of two thousands photo skin CC for two thousand eight realness. I love that. Two thousand eight two thousand eight uh <laughs> machinima realness. <laughs> I love your visual. I appreciate that. I recorded a video last night for um for the custom hood showcase thing i looked at it i only ended up doing two hoods for it but it's, i looked at them a little bit more like in depth it was really fun i'm excited about that i plan on editing it on friday and having it out like sunday or something we'll see how it goes but yeah um yeah the first one was really fun i'm excited to this one's really cool it's uh i don't know how long it'll end up being because i ended up like looking at the, the hood a lot more in depth because I got really fascinated with figuring out the storyline. <laughs> understand. understand. Okay. I'm gonna have him have buy some stuff. To build our, credibility. Our, reputation. our reputation. Do we not have... Wait, is there not... Oh. I thought there was a... Uh, a place to buy a cell phone here. That's why I brought him here, because I thought he should buy a cell phone. I guess this is just base game, so it makes sense. Maybe I'll just, like, buy one and plop it down. Um, what would it- is it- what is it under? Maybe electronics? There we go. I don't know where to plop it. Where shall I plop? Where shall I plop? There we go. I'm gonna give them some money back because they don't need to be losing money from that. Or I guess I could just sell it back after we're done using it. I don't know. The Veronaville Shopping Center. Yeah, this is the exact same as the one in Veronaville. The Pleasant View and Veronaville sh share some lots. Share some community lots. Um, I love them. It's either they're painted on or the mesh has <laughs> the mesh vanished fifty years ago. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's funny though. I'm very into like the Ma Maxis clothes or like improved or edited Maxis clothes. I like that kind of vibe. Okay, so he got himself a little secret cell phone. He wants to be friends with General Chip. Okay. Interesting. Maybe he'll go on an adventure to Strange Town. He wants uh to ask Sim on date. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know who he will do that for, besides his wifey. 
Um, I guess, should we hang out here and see who shows up? William Bradley. Oh, Marion. I forgot about Marion. She she got a bad makeover. Poor Marion. <laughs> Poor Marion. <laughs> she just kind of looking like that. Who's that? Henrik Brooker. Oh, it's Miss Bella. We gotta greet Miss Bella. Go greet Bella. Um, the effort people put into custom hoods boggles my mind. Mine just sits there unplayed and empty with like three sims and dreams of one day building it up. Yes, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's wild. Now, is this, I don't know, this looks like that, is this clone Bella? I think this is clone Bella, because I remember clone Bella's got the goofed up eyes. I don't know why her eyes look like that. I don't know if I should be concerned. Clone Bella's eyes are a little, she's got like a cross-eyed thing going on. Yeah, see, there are two different Bellas. Bella Goth and Bella Goth. Okay. This is this is Clone Bella. We only have one bolt with Clone Bella. Um let's chat. Let's chat with Clone Bella. We also that's right, you know, we changed our playable Bella's outfit the last time too. True, invalid Bella. <laughs> Strange town gayness strikes again. Back in the early days, I prefer playing a new neighborhood from scratch, but I couldn't bother decorating and making storylines either, so I can relate. Yeah. You are conjuring a cursed... Oh, yeah. I, I, wait. Herb and Chip Romance. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I don't know. Maybe he'll go to Strange Town and just see if he can find him. Oh, I think I think she just did something to him. AI hey, I'll turn yeah. Maybe that's why her eyes look like that, because she was made by AI. Oh, the way she looked right at me. I hate that. <laughs> I hate that. I hate that. Oh, you renamed her to Bella Bachelor since she has no memory of being married. Okay. That's cool. Zero out of five stars. Zero out of five stars. But yeah, one of the one of the hoods that I looked at um, last night, uh, I mentioned it on Discord, but I really, really fell in love with it, and I kind of want to like play it. And my my plans are, let me see if I can. Let's. Do you think she'd take a, f a f charm? Also, am I able to? I think. Oh, he's got nine points to spend. Oh, we gotta give him this. Maybe he should. Maybe he should have like. I'm gonna give him the needs tree. Look at that, he's got enough for two trees plus a secondary. What should, I don't know what his secondary should be. Pleasure? I feel like it should be pleasure. Belagoth is a well-known missing sim, yep. Belagoth is a synth. <laughs> Belagoth is a synth sent by the Institute. <laughs> a general working man, the only thing they share is the same haircut and their forbidden love. <laughs> this summer, watch Buzzcut Lovers at, at a theater near you. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Pleasure and romance. I think that works. My my man herbal. My herbal man. Uh how about we go? Let's go. He's thinking about Chippy. I don't know why he's thinking about Chippy, but let's let's go for a visit. Oh, charm. Oh, he's gonna try and charm her. Oh, that worked. It, oh, maybe we oh. Maybe we sh maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should hang around a little. Maybe we should Smooth talk. Uh, the more I say it, the more it'll be true. <laughs> Hi, Comrade Opossum. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> it's now canon. We must do it. Please, their love tour needs to do this. We'll have to see. We'll see what... So currently, I'm trying to think the world that Mr. General Chip lives in. I think... He's got he's got the alien kids. His, his kids' names are Burp and Squirt. <laughs> He's got a couple of aliens. They're named Burp and Squirt. Um, <laughs> um, more on that <laughs> at eleven. Um, do we? I think he has got. I don't know if he had another one. I know they've had two. I'm trying to think like where he's at. He's he's at later on in his life. Uh, why are you interacting with these randoms, dude? She wants to play kicky bag with us. Okay. Why, where are you going, bud? <laughs> Not a great combo outside of Sims. I, I hate that. 
<laughs> I hate that. Um, okay, these two, we'll see, I don't know, we'll see if these two can get kind of get something going. Everybody's trying to interact with him, I don't know, I guess because he's irresistible. Do you think she'd peck? I don't think she's gonna peck, I don't think I should do that. Um, admire. Maybe a back rub? I don't know. High heel hacky sack, true. High heel hack nut sack. Oh no. <laughs> hack nut sack? I, I realized what I always said after I said it. <laughs> Sir and madam, you cannot play a kicky bag in here. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, I talked about it before that I am interested in starting a fresh... Oh, I hit a button. <laughs> a fresh let's play this year. And I can't decide. I'm, I'm, I'm now conflicted. I thought I had it planned and now I'm conflicted about what I, what town I want to play. Because I know that there's a lot of folks that don't the 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 live stream thing doesn't work for them and and i do like the idea of still making like edited videos each week um and having that going on on my my youtube um <laughs> i was browsing that you were browsing the discord server and you heard him say nutsack and i have to switch back <laughs> you know it, when 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 in oh okay she's into us though okay Oh, I don't think caress is going to work. What if I just do, like, macro romantic? Ma'am? He's found love in a, in a, in the local video game store. Also, I got to roll dumb ads. I'm sorry, we got to roll ads. We're going to just be trying to maybe build up this relationship. I'll try not to do anything important. Um... Is an alternative Veronaville? Yeah, that was one of my options. And now I'm confused. I don't know. I, I might be smarter for me to stick with, like, a pre-made hood. Because the reality is, is a lot of folks really like the pre-made hoods. Um, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hopefully you didn't get stuck behind a dumb ad. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, my original plan was I had I had alt Veronaville set up um, with Berry Burry as a subhood. And that's what I was going to play as my my new let's play and i might still do that i gotta i gotta just think about some things oh the way he's chasing her the way he's chasing her sir oh oh <laughs> bella just like she just teleported did you see bella last second she went into like <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh oh no the pink the pink the pink I don't know. Should he go home? I guess it's 4 p.m. Let's go home. <laughs> Please, we will watch it all. Yeah, I'm just, like, so torn. I don't know. Because, like, this other hood that I was looking at last night, that I was doing a review of last night, really drew me in. And it's, like, very... Uh, oh, we had the, oh, we got, we got the icons here, which are not supposed to be here, but I gotta get them to stop showing up on these lots, but, um. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Papa, give us the custom hood snacks. Yeah. I, uh, it's just a really cool hood, and it was like, it had the right, like, I love the chaotic vibe. I like when Sims 2 is chaotic and goofy and like that's why I, I just love our Calicundia so much because it's just so weird like I love the weirdness and this hood was weird and I really liked it okay he's off lot for a while okay she's here she's doing some cleaning we're, we're a little bit oh no we're not we're not gonna actually if anything I'm gonna save real quick If anything, I'm gonna uh, sh 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 shave real quick. Calicone is very normal. What are you talking about? Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ma'am, that's not that's not doing what you're supposed to be doing. Okay, I'm gonna have you do some some things for me. Let's call service. I'm gonna have you call a service. When I played my community time, I was sim stay out for like 15 hours. And did you, so you, like, the Sims were not gone for 15 hours, but you, they stay out? Because if so, then that's, like, probably a conflict. Um, obviously it makes them stay away for as long as they were away, obviously, but, like, if 
that's not what's like actually happening. Yeah, there's definitely a conflict happening. Oh my god, look at this man! He's got a gas mask on. I forgot I have this default. That scared me. Roach roaches don't stand a chance against us. Oh, they go out for 15 hours. Okay. Okay. We're also gonna hire a maid. I know, you're traumatized by the little cocky roaches. I think April Black just made a video about the community time mod glitch. Oh. Okay. Um... That's cool, though. I didn't- I did not know. Uh-oh. There's some pink flashing in my little preview. Wait. Are people... Yeah, we're gonna... Okay, we've got some folks here. Um... His little glasses are pink flashing. I'm gonna save and reload the lot real quick. Never had that glitch they were showcasing. Okay. I don't know. Maybe I'll have to look at it. I think because I play so much Sims and I make so much Sims videos and, and stream and stuff, I don't tend to watch Sims stuff, <laughs> you know what I mean, in my free time, unless I need to to fix something. We're just going to re reload. This is such a big lot. Hoping it only happened to me when I, I did a marriage on a community lot and someone was added to the household. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, I've heard somebody mention about the, the corruption myths video. That sounds cool. <laughs> we chugging. Oh god, the flies. I think we should also adopt a cat. I don't know what kind of- I don't think we have any kittens available. Should I- should I get a little kitty maker? A little pet maker? Pleasant Oldies, that's true. Pleasant Oldies could be a name of the 60s themed radio station, yeah, or even like just like a, a retro station. Oldies sta an oldies station. <laughs> I didn't know Oh, here comes here comes the man, so we gotta check him out. Okay, so choose parent one. Who's gonna be Hakuba Goth? Oh. And then I didn't know that these cats were here. Menelas and Hakuba. Mips. Ooh, wrinkles. We should get this one's a little that's a little hairless kitty. Okay, hairless kitty. And maybe one of the goth cats or something. Mips is cute. Maybe I'll do I'll just do a couple. We'll see what happens. It's a it's a girly. What is what is Miss Coral Oldie gonna name her kitty? I'd like she's gonna name it like Precious. Precious or uh, Pearl is good. I like Pearl. Petunia is cute. However, my game has exploded into a fiery ball before. Interesting. Uh, but thought the ones I didn't know were very true was an eye opener. Okay, so that's cool. Hello, this is your host, Coral of Pleasant Oldies FM. Your home for the best music of the past. <laughs> Oh, that's true. Angel is close to Angela. That's true. I like Patu. I like Pearl. Hmm. Cause Coral and Pearl. Oh God, look at Herb. Look at Herb's picture over here. Oh no. Am I gonna have to reload my game? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Corn dog. That's a good name. I might do- Rose is cute, too. Rose is easy. Patricia? Wait, I like Patricia. <laughs> Patty. Just little Patty. Hmm. I'm spending too much time trying to choose. I'm gonna do Petunia. That's fine. It's just a kitty. They, they'll probably get more. It's a little baby. I think it got the wrinkles, but then it also got stripes, so it's kind of weird. Look at that little baby. Look at this little baby. Okay, it's kind of a unique little character. Patty the Caddy. Yeah, like a little snow leopard. Oh god, this poor cat. The first thing he sees is this. Look at this guy. He's just having a blast. Good baby. That's true. It looks like a, some kind of wild cat of some kind. 
I love this little default. It's funny. <laughs> Why are you no? <gasps> him, not him spraying our child. <laughs> he walks in with all the. Oops, sorry. <laughs> he walks in with all the gear, and he just walks over and he starts spraying Angela. <gasps> Wait, this is when Angela becomes a mermaid. This is how Angela becomes a mermaid creature. <laughs> she gets sprayed with <laughs> with stuff. <laughs> this is how it happens. Angela's superpowers. <laughs> Mermaid lore. <laughs> okay. She's got the flu. She's very sick. <laughs> now spraying her, intoxicating her. Dispose. Somebody needs to dispose of these. Okay, Angela. You got a kitten, though. You, don't, you guys aren't happy about the cat you got? Why can't I? I want to grant the kitten. It won't let me grant them a cat. Taking care of your pest problems. Okay. Why? What? Why are we? Why are you showing me him? Okay. Um. Ichabod was here and we didn't say hi to him, unfortunately. Uh, I don't know what I just saw. Jenny's leaving. Um. Oh. Was that a witch? Was there a witch that just went by? Okay, I swear I just saw, like, some kind of witch broom. I'm confused. Yeah, it's humongous. It's massive. I'm a little bit afraid. <laughs> it's a little bit... It's There's a lot. Oh, our maid showed up, by the way, and our maid is a man's. Who, who's he? Okay. Hi, mister. Hi, mister. I like his little hairdo, like he's pulling his hair up out of the way. Oh, he's chunky. <laughs> Look at his chunky... He's got a belly. He's a chunky guy. Unfortunately, I don't think this is the the hot, sexy French maid that Danny was hoping for. Darcy Rollins. He's a chunky boy. <laughs> That's where he stores his cleaning cleaning supplies. Yeah, I really like this maid default. It's it's simple, but it's like it works. I just I like it better than the French maid costume. Like the French maid costume's funny. <laughs> <laughs> and I have, I have like the repository version of the French maid costume, so like I can dress them in it if I want them, want them to. But yeah. Okay, you're playing with the kitty. Also, we didn't buy any cat stuff. You, I saw the broom too. You're not going crazy, okay? I was like, I saw something. I saw. I'm wondering though, because we had an issue with Astrid, the the witch child being invisible like was she also here because all of the visitors were leaving and there was only two what if there was a third one that was invisible um <clears throat> what pet hairs are you using i think i think they're by somebody called kit i might have to i might have to look open up my folder it's like kit something i think is what they call it i don't know if anybody else is familiar with with the pet hair excuse me um, I think it's called Kit something. I'll just get this, like, cute little bowl. I think that works. Um, the kitten's gonna have to stay down here, so... Why is there a... Why is this... Why is that there? I think I'm gonna get rid of that. Yeah, let me... Let me see. I can open up my folder. Um, downloads. I have a pets section. Oh, Ka Kalina? Actually, okay. Let me write it out for you. I think it's... It says Kalina Sand M. And then it's cat furs and dog furs. I don't know if... I guess I think maybe I used to have the Kit W or maybe I use... I think I use Kit... Oh, I have some Kit W custom patterns. But I guess Kalina is the name of the other ones that I have now. I might have swept, swapped some things around. I recall getting rid of the base game made outfit started my CC journey. That's fun. That's really cool. That's kind of a neat little little thing. Um, mm, I don't think I like that. Oh, you know what I want? I want that the this one. I don't know if I need to turn it. Can they get into that? I don't know. Or can they get into it diagonally? I, w I, w I would like it to work diagonally, but I'm not sure. Thank you for the follow, Octome. Octube. Welcome in. Um, oh, 
We're spinning. We're spinning. I'm getting very close to my 800 follower goal, to getting 800 followers. Kind of wild. I'm only five away, according to what it says on my end here. I'm at 795. Which is kind of wild, because I think I only just barely hit 700 at, like, October or something. Or November. It was kind of neat. Um, the blue. Hello! I really like your YouTube videos. First time catching a stream live. Very cool. Welcome in. I appreciate, I appreciate it. Uh, we're trying to buy some kitty stuff. I guess I gotta get a litter box. I'm trying to remember all the things that cats need. I also don't have, like, my quarter tile on. Oh, did it not? That might help me a little bit. I think I'm just gonna squeeze it in here. I think I think. Carrying the Sims to industry on your back. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. We could do like a little scratcher post in here somewhere. There's not a lot of space. This is a very small... For such a big house, this, this living room is very tiny. You know? Maybe instead of this toy, we'll do the scratcher. Maybe, maybe. Oh, the furs you have are hers too. Interesting. I think... They, I don't know if they have... You might have to look and see if they have different options. Different ones that they've done. Hmm. I'm not, like, crazy about the recolor, recolors of that. I guess I'll do that one. Or I could use... I really like this, this other one from the Pets stories. It's kind of neat. It's got, like, recolors. This one's from pet the Pet Life stories or whatever it's called. I think that's everything I need. Somebody's got to fill the bowl here. Okay. We're spending the day with these two. What are they getting up to? Look at Herbal. <laughs> he looks. He looks very mysterious. Yeah, I like the. I added the Sims One build by mode stuff in. It's really nice. Really nice. Um, oh, we got we got Herbie's pension check. She keeps taking baths in here. She wants to be friends with Lilith. I think we need to have a little Lilith moment. Where's Lilith? Lilith's out here. What are you up to? She wants to make a friend. Can she, like, call somebody over? She knows little Dirk and little Dustin. Should she call Dustin? Should, should she try and make friends with Dusty? Why is she crying? Maybe the... Is it the bugs? Let's call a sim. See if he'll come over. Mm hmm. Moan, sweet bug cat. <laughs> but still swoon on other cats, both online and offline. <laughs> Why is Perma Pink go through? No, no. He's off the lot right now, and the lot we were on had pink flashing. <laughs> so he's a pink flashing nightmare right now. I think he'll re. I think when he comes to the lot, hopefully it'll fix it. <laughs> But he's off lot right now. So he's not a ghosty. Um, let's call a little Dusty. Right over. The cowboy game definitely took pity on me because I was doing so bad. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, Danny Boy's back from work. Hello, sir. Oh. Okay, how about you just go to sleep? Ugh. No, you're not gonna sleep in that bed. You gotta sleep in your own bed. Gotta sleep in your own bed. While we figure out he wants to go on a date, he wants to be friends with Willow. Willow has a history of fooling around. Even though she's kind of a, a you know, a traditional family sim, she has a little bit of a history. Her first child, Ophelia, is actually secretly not um, Creon's kid. It's he, She ended up having it with Vidkrim Loner instead of Creon, her husband. So, <laughs> yeah, pink ghost, the pink flashing ghosty. Look at him. What am I seeing now? Oh, Dustin. Dusty's here. Gotta shake hands with Dust. Great Mr. Dust. Great Mr. Dust. <laughs> Not him thinking. <laughs> Why are you thinking about the guy? What, what are you thinking about him for? This, this man is plaguing us today. <laughs> the pink rave. <laughs> let's let's leave Perman as pink rave then. Yes, that's, that's funny. Um, 
I guess I could just do like macro socialize friendly and just have him go at it. Uh, we're not gonna save right now. We'll leave. I'll probably regret that. We'll see. Okay, you're just gonna watch television. I want you to interact with Lilith. Where's Ms. Lilith? Lilith's here. She's going to take a bath. It's 4 p.m. and she's like tired. I'm gonna make her a little happier. What's what's she gonna do with Lilith? What if they play? Here, you know, they can swing around. Get up. Oh, I forgot I turned off testing cheats, so now I can't drag their needs. I'm I, this is miserable. How ca I can't live it. This is barbaric. I can't drag needs. Okay, he finished cleaning. Okay, they're they gotta. This is not the right space to. Okay. She's very hungry. Okay, that didn't work out. Okay. Alright, that's alright. To be fair, who didn't get with Vincrim? True? True. Because he was spraying Angela? True. True. Are we gonna- should I actually make her a mermaid because of that? <laughs> She's currently sick. Maybe she'll be sick for a while and then she'll turn into a mermaid. <laughs> her mermaid era. Okay, that was the maid leaving. Who's walking on? Calvin Marriott. Oh, Flamenco Caliente's there. What if what if um, Coral leaves Herb once he starts cheating and she figures it out and stuff? And then she gets with Flamenco or something. That'd be kind of cool. I have the mermaid mod. I have it in the game. Locked and loaded. I, I don't know how it works with kids, though. Um, if you cheat needs with Blender or <laughs> Manipulator, I won't- we won't tell. Okay. <laughs> I never use it that. I, I guess I don't ever think about it. Here, I'll try to be hardcore. I'm gonna try to be a hardcore professional simmer. Oh, also you're back, but your thumbnails are goofed. Okay. How about you come, like, take a nap? Wanna go take a nap, Herbal? I could just sleep. That works too. God, look at this. Oh no. You better not set that on fire. You better not start a fire. She burns everything. How does she not know how to cook? Ma'am? Uh, yeah, I think you're right. I think the bat box does. Let me see. I think I can drag it out. I'll put it, like, up on this mantle or something. Generate portraiture? No. Oh god. Stupid expressions, tans and burns, flashing blue. I don't know, stuck SFX, I don't know. Oh, wait, what are you doing? Oh boy, she's getting old! Oh, oh, honey. What is this? She's in her comfy girl era. Okay. Coral is now elderly. We're not going to do anything. <laughs> she says, I'm old and I'm hungry. Okay, also somebody's going to answer the phone. Oh, she's... Miss Mary Sue's headed for it. Miss Mary Sue's headed for it. Angela, I'm sick and kind of thirsty. Water seems appealing right now for Mermaid area. Uh, is Lilith available to talk? Why is she- Jennifer's calling for Lilith? No. Mary Sue says no. She wants a promo. What? Are they getting along out here? Yeah, I guess they're buddies. I'll, let, I'll, I'll have her stop. She has the insatiable urge to dive into the pool. What are you doing? You're taking back- they all love this bathtub. They're all just flocking to the bathtub. Butt spot. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> that was a pretty good one on Butt Spot's part. <laughs> yeah, I kind of want to. Um, I want to edit the hair a little, maybe. Who's this? Oh, Mortimer. Mortimer's mad. Oh, I remember because Mortimer saw Bella and Daniel fooling around. Mortimer knows. Mortimer is aware. You know what would be funny? Is if Sims who steal newspapers 
if it appears in their inventory when you go to play them that would be really funny like if if you you just like open your sims inventory and they have like 20 newspapers because they're just a jerk stealing everybody's newspapers hi trombone gal how are you how are you doing how are you doing um like a little bit laggy what are you doing oh she's gonna go to the oh my god this child is miserable why don't they run to this toilet why I'm getting some weird lag on this lot. I think it's just such a big lot. It's hard with big lots like this. With having a lot of sims and stuff. I wonder if when the kid, when the girls are teens, if we might have, like, Coral and Herb move out. Or something. I don't know. Oh, Dustin's just here chilling with Coral and eating some burnt hamburgers. And boogies. I'm tired, but good. That's, that's good. I'm also tired, but good. <laughs> when I'm in a try not to scream mother challenge and my opponent is Mary Sue with slick back hair, I lost. <laughs> not clickbait. She does look very good. I like this hair on her. And this outfit with this like deep open chest moment. Wowza. Wowza. <laughs> Look how your game looks. Yes, I do use, I have a, a list. Let's see, did I? Let me do this. Um. I meant to, to f create a command that links directly to my lighting stuff because a lot of people ask about the lighting specifically. Yeah, one of the portraits pink flashing. <laughs> it is. That's a link to what I use for lighting stuff. Um, but yeah, there the he he got he was on a community lot. And he ended up with pink flashing. It's kind of... Nothing's really happening here, though, so I'm kind of just cruising. <laughs> I'm just kind of chilling, you know? Okay, can I... Let's see what you got, like... If I say plan outfit every day, let's see what you got for your everyday wear. What you got? Yeah, it's kind of a fashion statement at this point. Oh, okay, Coral. Wait, look at this one. Wait, maybe Coral... I think Coral needs to wear this. This is fancy grandma. Look at her little, her little handkerchief thing. I think I'm okay with her hair. I think her hair is fine. Let's see. Yep. Let's let me just plan like your pajamas. Let me make sure you don't have really cursed pajamas. Yeah, you do. Okay, there we go. We'll do that. Now you don't need to change into everyday. Do we think does Coral need different hair or is she okay? I don't know. I think I think it's probably okay. It's a fashion statement. It is. I was. Oh, I was playing the Pleasant House. Um. Excuse me. I, I burped. <laughs> I was playing the Pleasant House. Hold as well. Um. A few generations further, a burglar came, and uh, set fire and burned to death. Oh no! Also, police burn. Man burned, and my old lady. It was wow. Holy crap! That's funny. Everybody burning. Yeah, I think. Burp and squirt. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> can I get a can I get a ban on Dreamy the Lizard, please? Can I get a can I get a sixty nine hour timeout on Dreamy the I'm just kidding. Don't <laughs> don't don't do that. Okay, do you wanna sleep? So she need she wants a promo. I mean she doesn't need need any skills, interestingly. Oh my god, everybody in everybody's way in this house. Everybody's in everybody's way. Where's the kitten? Sleeping. Okay, he can use the diagonal. <laughs> I'm a good bead. I'm sorry. No, you're all right. <laughs> Jimmy sends a message to me in chat. Please, I'm in jail. <laughs> oh no. Um, you. I feel like I feel like Coral needs like a hobby right now. She's gonna come and sleep. Oh, actually, she wants... Oh, I'm an idiot. Literally have I have the sewing want locked in. Does she have... She does. She literally has... Dusty's in here just dancing in Coral and Herb's house. <laughs> I'm in jail. <laughs> oh, wait. You wanted her to sit... Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm in jail. I'm in jail. Look at these two. Sleep in... She doesn't know that he's a terrible, disgusting monster. Or maybe she does. She needs to knit her feelings away. Yes, hello, Braddyful. 
<laughs> she does. Oh, Danny Boy's waking up. Okay. 10 p.m. His his natural clock says, okay, time to go get some. Look at his abs. He's got abs. Abs. He wants to kiss Mary Sudo. Okay. Maybe I'll lock that in. I think he, he just really likes the idea of having lots of lovers. I think he... What should he do? Is he going to get in trouble if he tries to call Willow? Because he wants to be friends with Willow. I don't know. Where's Ms. Willow? There she is. I'm just going to talk with her. Maybe he should have used his secret cell phone. Maybe that's what I should have had to do. How early did early plays of you start? I think we're this is this is my very first time playing this household right now. All of Pleasant Early Pleasant View. So like um this household specifically and then any household I play. So like this is kind of where it started. The girls are children right now. They originally started as toddlers. So like that kinda if that gives you an idea. Um I think it's supposed to be like the nineties, roughly, is when it starts. Um But like in this household, Angela and Lilith were uh, were ch toddlers. Coral was still a, um, an adult. Uh, she only just barely aged to elder. Did I get you? This stinky little feral kid farted on our our bedroom couch, <laughs> and then he just. <laughs> what are you doing, buddy? Washing your hands? Okay, Dustin. Dustin's Dustin's mom does not care where he is. <laughs> I don't understand. Can we ask Dustin to leave? Come on, pink soup man. Mr. Pink Soup. You stop. Let's schmuscle. Yeah, okay. He wants to take a bubble bath. You know, that's that's not a bad want. He wants to be besties with Bella. I'm gonna lock that in. I still want him... I, I don't know. I'm torn because I really like the, the vacation want for him, though. And I like the go on date because that's just, like, easy. He wants a bubble blower. <laughs> How is Mary Sue going to feel if her father goes and buys a bubble blower? What is? Ha what are we doing? You're playing with the dolls and Lilith is choking on a rotting burger. How about you You come in here and just like clean some stuff up? My god. <laughs> my god. <laughs> oh my goodness, thank you so much for the sub. For three months in advance? Oh my god. I'm a mom. Thank you very much, Lispeed. I really appreciate it. Enjoy all your, your badge and emotes for three months in advance. That's wild. And you also helped me hit my goal, the 50, 50 sub goal. Very cool. <laughs> OMG free Comey. <laughs> oh, <laughs> pinned by Comey. It's actually Dreamy who's in jail. <laughs> it's actually Dreamy who's in jail. Comey pinned it, though. <laughs> it's kind of confusing how it shows. Yes, thank you, thank you. Why is Herb in our tub? Okay. <laughs> this is the hard part about having them, like, living together here. But also, like, it makes sense a little bit that, like, Herb would be in the way. Also, apparently he didn't finish... He didn't, like, make friends with Girly. Ms. Willow. That's okay. Yeah, thank you, thank you for the 50. We're all, we're only four follows away from 800 followers. That's really cool, too. It shows a bit weird. <laughs> Dreamy t instead typed, in jail. <laughs> Love Dreamy. <laughs> I've been wrongly imprisoned. <laughs> Perb Moldy. Thank you for the save game. I, sh I should. Why don't we do that? Doing great. <laughs> Doing great. My first stream, not in jail. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. But yeah, um, I feel like there was something else I was going to say. I feel like there was something else I was going to say. I can't remember now. Um, okay, Herbal, I need you to leave this room. Why are we all awake? Play a computer game. Is there a computer here? Have we a computer? Oh, we do. Here. Herb's gonna play... S <laughs> do you think Herb is gonna go play Second Life? Wait, is that... That's him thinking of Herb? Why? Why, why are we... <laughs> what are we... 
really weird. <laughs> um, why? <laughs> this is just her pink flashing hair. <laughs> yeah, the what happened is yeah, the community lot it got pink flashing. Sometimes it 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 survives a while, but um, we'll probably do like a. That's a good screenshot. Oh, true, I should have screenshot it. Oh, that was a little pink flash there. <laughs> You okay, buddy? You all right? You going through something? Well, what are we gonna do? How about we have you come up and just like work out or something? Like you like to work out. <laughs> his mini faces, yeah, yeah. <laughs> his pink, his full pink over here. Um, I uh probably am gonna do. We'll do like a little halftime. We'll watch a machinima for like half time and I'll reload the game while we're like getting ready to like we'll do like a BRB and then like watch a machinima and like reload the game or something um question do you have any CC furniture or clothes on this lot yeah I'm probably, there must be well the, the 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 lot I don't I think was I haven't built anything on this lot this was all designed by by um the original creator I think unless I don't know if there's anything here that I would have put in besides like this the debug thing. Um, there's some creators have like twenty by twenty. Okay, that caused pink flashing for me. Yeah, the one thing that I also probably am gonna get rid of are these hedges because sometimes hedges and lots of like plants cause issues for me. Um, so eventually I might clear those guys out. I have the plastic hedges. Maybe I should just go ahead and do that now while I'm thinking of it. Um, because I have the actual like the fake hedges that are better. Uh, maybe we'll do that. Yeah, I think the reshade is a big one for me. Um, I find that, because another big thing for me right now is I had to delete my, um, I had to delete my, I think I have that default too for the, for the hedge. But, um, it, I don't, I don't know. I think it, sometimes it's nicer just to have the plastic ones. But, um, the, what was I going to say? Oh, I had to delete all of my thumbnails. So all of my thumbnails are like regenerating whenever I need, whenever like I pull something up. Like when we, we were changing both Lilith and uh, Angela's outfits, all those th thumbnails were regenerating. I had to delete them because of an issue with them. Um, uh, so that's a big thing right now for why mine's getting pink flashy. Um, Cause whenever my, whenever it generates thumbnails is when it like gets all pink flashy for me. Um, so I, d I don't delete my thumbnails very often. Which, like, you should... I mean, you don't have to anyway. But we'll have we'll have those. I don't know if... There's just, like, a, like, there's a lot of trees happening. Like, I'm looking at, like... I might do a little bit of clearing. We've got lots of bushes, you know. Might cut back on... Maybe we'll, like... I'll fix the terrain, too. Maybe we'll just, like dinner out a little bit. I think that might help. These are kind of a lot. This is kind of a lot. Um, maybe I could just... Oops, I was going to leave the tree. I was going to say I could just have the trees be here. Oh. I mean, just that. Do something like that. Yeah, it'd be nice if there was a way to kind of manage the the sizing and stuff. But I don't think Rishade contributes to pink flashing because it's post-processing. It doesn't interact with what causes Sims 2 pink soup. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like there's lots of different opinions about different things. <laughs> you know, like... Uh, I think I'll leave that. Maybe we'll get rid of it. I feel like these bushes are a little extra. And then I'll just... I'm going to clean up any weird spots. Well, I guess this one they were using. What were they using? I'm not sure which one they were using. I don't really care. I'll just do this. I'll leave that. Like, we've got multiple trees inside of each other here. Even just... Mm, I think I like one tree there. I don't need this tree over here. I 
That maybe could just help a little bit. Be a little bit more lightweight. Um, pink soup baffles and confuses us. We need professional research. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's interesting. Try to reshade it. It makes the game look much better. There are many times I saw pink soups, and when I wanted to uninstall reshade, the pink soups showed up less. So I think reshade might be related. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Um, it really, yeah, it just really depends on... Actually, I might get rid of these guys. They're just, like, kind of out there floating in nowhere land. Just for my personal kind of preference. I might just go ahead and get rid of these guys, too. I might just kind of cut things down a little bit. I don't like things too incredibly cluttered anyway, so... I, it depends on the theme, I guess. I, some things I like clutter, and sometimes I don't. Sometimes it can just be too much. Okay, we'll try that. We'll just do a little bit a little bit less going on. Also, for me, a time that pink flashing will show or disappear is when lighting changes. When it, like, re, re, readjusts the lighting. Maybe not. I couldn't, I couldn't bother finding the root of the problem. For now, when I see pink soup, I quit the game, delete some cache files, and then reload the game. Yeah. I don't know. I don't really... Well, I guess for me, I have the... I have... What just happened? Somebody's... Oh, something bad happened over here. Oh, God. Look at Herb's face. He's like, oh, I said the wrong thing to this little gremlin. Herb is not being a good grampy. I don't know what just happened. Oops. They don't have, like, a memory, do they? Uh, <laughs> she said something. I don't know what just happened. Okay. Um, she wants to get a good report card. <laughs> okay, she's sleeping. I said up to you. Apparently, he likes tinkering. I don't know. This Her Herbie can be a, a big, big, strong mechanic man. Okay, you're gonna eat up. She's the baby's eating up. Okay, I don't know what to do with you, child. You're not tired. Um, that's right. Herbie was playing. Oh, Angela has now found Herb's Second Life account. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! OMG new vids. Oh, the um, the pop up, <laughs> the little pop up video. Yeah, I have that one. Um, that one's some Calicundia Sims, and then I have another one with Calicundia Sims. That's the audio from the Ghost Adventures show. <laughs> it's like there are some things in this world that we they can never understand. That one. I don't know if there's. I'm trying to think if there's anything other new ones that I haven't. I haven't thought of. We'll have her draw, I guess. There, oh, oh, there we go. The <laughs> doubled audio. <laughs> we want answers. Grab a drink here. We have worked years to build our credibility. Our reputation. <laughs> our reputation. Hi, Antisocial Elf, and thank you for the work, comrade. Or Casey. See, it didn't say Casey again. I don't know why it keeps resetting. Honestly, do people play Second Life? I think I think they still do. I mean, I guess tech. What what does play really mean? I guess. <laughs> uh, runs out of GPU RAM. She can uh, use per session, so it stops loading assets. The biggest contributors: CC object, CC quality, reshade only interacts with your GPU and doesn't care about Sims Two load limit and research. Okay. Um, I might make a bunch of times for my custom, but it feels like it'll be a bit of a pain. Yeah, it's fun to use, like, the random methods and stuff that are out there with Body Shop and, like, randomizing faces and things. That can be a really fun way to goof around with it. Um, there's also options out there of people who have made pre-made townie pools. I don't know if you're familiar with those. They're, like, pre-made. You can, like, it's like a, it's like a subhood or i think also sometimes just like a household i think it's usually a sub hood that you can just like add on to your it's just an empty like stealth hood type thing that you add on to your 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 hood um your base hood and then it just essentially injects all those townies into your into your hood and then you can like delete the sub hood and they stay there kind of thing um there's some really nice ones out there i think most people that do have probably have it for 15 plus years now yeah yeah 
Second Life is still around. Yeah. I don't even know how to add subhoods. Yeah, it's um you'd have to might have to look up a tutorial for how to install them, but they're just added through the the business like the shopping district category. Sort of like the way you add Blue Water Village or the downtown one. Yeah. Um, so I do enjoy the Pokemon, so I'm a little worried about the time commitment more than anything else. Yeah, that's true. I get that. Maybe using the the template faces that you have and then maybe messing around with, like, mixing different separate template pieces and just kind of having a quick way of making some more unique sims could be kind of cool. Or hitting, sometimes I like to just hit the randomize button and then just see see where we go. I go from there. <laughs> That's true. Names are fun. I love going to the fantasy name generator site because they have a bunch of cool name generators. I named a kid Schnozbert. <laughs> Very good. I'm just kind of I'm just kind of letting the Sims do their thing. I think I do need to restart the game soon though. Um, so I might do a BRB a little bit. And ugh, you're sick too. The illness in my game. It's because of the stupid bugs. Okay. Well you're you're pretty happy. How about Oh, she has she has this over here. That's kinda interesting that Coral's got this. Like she actually cares about the babies or something, you know? Um oh she has the ability to make all kinds of crap, dude. Wait. I didn't realize oh she has a gardening badge and a sewing badge. Oh, she has a silver sewing badge. What should he? What should she make? A curtain outfit? <gasps> Let's make an everyday outfit. I don't remember. I might have a default for this, so we'll see what it is. I don't know what it is. If I need to make quick counties, I pick a template and then do the right click to blend templates. Yes, that's a good way to do it. Thing on a few of a few others to remix it. Yeah. Oh, oh, we get to choose. What's she gonna sew herself? She's gonna sew herself a new look. Ooh, what about like high roller? High roller coral. She could have a fun little outfit. She could have like this little outfit. Um Boss Babe? Boss Babe Coral? Oh Coral said I need to surprise my man. <laughs> high roller coral in black, you think so? Or we could uh she could be wholesome little old lady coral. Wait, I kind of like little with the apron. I like this one with the apron. I think I might do that. That feels right for Lilness Coral. Let's see what else I have. See, it's like generating little thumbnails right now, I think. So it's taking a little while. Um. Oh, yeah, the I was just reading the reply to that. Yeah, the the GPU stuff with the, the pink flashing is, is, is a lot sometimes. It's a lot. Let me just see if there's anything else fun. Ooh, wait, she could have one of these cute little sweater looks. Maybe she sews herself a little sweater. That You're lucky to not have pink soup. Yeah, you're definitely, you're very lucky. <laughs> I like these little sweater outfits. Hmm. Hmm. I might, I think I might stick with this. For some reason, I like this little pink, this little um yellow. Customized clothing. Here lies your customized clothing. Born of a creative mind and fast fingers. Fresh fabric and nimble needles. Wear it proud. Corals. Cool clothing. Clothing. Uh oh, I ran out of letters. <laughs> Corals cool clothing. <laughs> Great cottage core grandma, yeah. Uh, oh, oh, she got... She got She's sad that she got sick. Oh, she wants to serve. I'm gonna lock that in. Serve food. But actually, no, I want her to... I, I'll keep these two. Um... Okay, so Lilith is sick. Oh, I wonder why. I wonder why Lilith is sick. <laughs> her father is, is hacking up on top of her. It's literally vomiting in her face. <laughs> she just stares. The way she just stares on. <laughs> this poor child. <laughs> this poor child. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Everyone got sick. Yeah. That's, 
Somebody kicked over a trash can and that was it. There's even more bugs still friggin' out here. I think we're gonna have to encase our trash can. Oh, I missed some hedges. Yeah, we're gonna delete these and make this our trash can zone. It's gonna be our professional trash can zone for trash cans. She's now a carrier of every, every disease known to man. I know. He's he's picked up a lot from his ladies, I'm sure, and his man's is. Oops. Somebody's gotta pick this up. Danny boy, I'm coming to make you pick this up and clean up. Hey, why would Lilith ever think her parents don't care about her? I know. Can you imagine? Where are you headed? Swing around. Oh, he was. Oh, he promised her that they were gonna go swing around, and then he's like, "Nope, I changed my mind and left." Okay. She wants to jump rope. How about you just jump rope or something? How about can you change into your like every day? And then I don't know. Just do a jump rope. Do an easy little jump rope. You're not having a great time. You're kind of just the, the little working lady. You gotta use the bathroom. Have some cereal, I guess. Herbal. Why is is everybody embarrassed because he's walking around in his undies? Is that it? Is it everybody gets the embarrassed face by him? <laughs> everybody who's around Herb just goes, "Ooh, ooh, ew." <laughs> I think is it just because he's walking around in his undies? Because this is what he changed into after his bath. He changed into his undies again. He wants a bubble blower. Should we buy him a bubble blower? Maybe he deserve does he deserve a bubble blower? Here you go, Herbie. I'll we'll blow some bubbles. <laughs> oh, the the doggy was oh was there the doggy that went by? I think I saw. Someone once said in school to me, ginger <laughs> As someone once said in school to me, gingers don't have souls. Oh, that's so terrible. That's so terrible. Yeah, because of the inappropriate trait, right? <laughs> it's so funny. Grandpa's walking around in his undies again. Ugh. Are you smashing bugs out here, dude? I'm gonna have him... I guess he's gotta eat. You have to work. It's Sunday. Yeah, he's gotta work. Have a... I don't know. You could have... Have an instant meal. Sure. Just something quick and easy. Quick and easy. Uh, Don Lothario is no longer a family friend. Coral, look at Coral happily sewing away in her little nighty. She didn't get dressed. Okay. So he's got to work at 9 a.m., so he's going to have to go too. So the girlies are going to be home alone again. Oh, Coral's healthy. That's good. You know what I'm going to do? We're going to do the thing that I've been doing in Calicundia is health, make immune to sickness. So that she doesn't get freaking sick again. Okay. Herb's having a blast. Yeah, this is slowly getting a little bit more chaotic, I guess. That's that's the thing. Since we're just barely starting each of these households, like we might not get we not might not go get as as full blown as we, we will want them to eventually. <laughs> I know grandpa has dementia, but can we put some clothes on? You know. He still wants to be besties with Bella. Maybe he needs to call her on his secret phone. The fact that Herb <laughs> is the only one in this household with this, with this, with the pink flashing face consistently is just correct. What's, who's stealing our newspaper now? I'm gonna call this Bella. It's just, what if he invites her over? Do you think he would, I don't think, do you think he'd be stupid enough to invite her over? He is inappropriate. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe he needs to get some clothes before talking to Bella. Maybe Bella loves his his undies. He's like, Bella, I got new, I got fresh undies on. Come over. You gotta see. You gotta see. They just wanna be besties. They don't wanna like kiss or nothing, you know? He's not that stupid. Also, I gotta lock this. Now that I fixed this, I forgot to lock it. Household only. She's just morbidly curious. She's got a thing. Okay, I didn't see who took Oh. 
Yeah, it's Mortimer again that stole our newspaper. Okay, Bella's coming over. What are you up to, child? Not these bugs. Can I, like... Okay, you need to leave the bugs alone. I hate the, the Sims' obsession with bugs. Here, you want to play on playground? Go for it. Go for it. <laughs> Victoria's secret hall. <laughs> Herbie's secret. <laughs> Herb herbal secrets. Herbal secrets. <laughs> Where he really just doesn't give a shit. He just he's just hateful. Oh we got look at we got anxious subject walking on by. An icon. Mr. Anxious Subject. What are you doing, bud? Hello. Hello, hello. Oh, our queen is here. Coral's too busy sewing. She's never gonna notice. Oh, <laughs> as I say that she finished her outfit. <laughs> as I say that she just finished her outfit. Never greet Bella. Okay, she finished it. Okay, and she's immune to sickness too. I'll ever make something else. Which let's make a teddy bear. Sure, little bear boo. Sure. <laughs> iPad kid coughing out here. Maybe she needs to not play on the. <laughs> Maybe she needs to. Oh yeah. Should I make her a... Maybe... Should she be a, a mermaid? I think she might need to be a mermaid. Where's my... Where's my... Oh, right here. Um... There we go. Mermaid Angela. She's... You can see she's a mermaid because she's got fishy legs now. She, her dream of being a fish has come through true. And the other into a normal kid. <laughs> Look, she's a fish. It, I feel like her her parents are so absentee that they're not even going to notice. <laughs> this is um, from Midge the Tree. Um, this one's the Custom Supernatural Transformer um, by Midge the Tree. And so, yeah, so... Midge the Tree has a ton of supernatural mods. They have like a, a really nice guide and like everything's all listed out on their Tumblr. So highly recommend Midge for supernatural stuffs. Herb is a plant sim true, Mr. Herbie. Yeah, let's see let's see what happens if she jumps in the water. I don't remember how it works. I've actually not really played. Oh, oh why is she naked? <laughs> why is she naked? What happened? Isn't she supposed to get into? Oh, she what? What? <laughs> she changed out of. She ch <laughs> wait. Now I wish I'd watched as she jumped in. So I think what's supposed to happen is she's supposed to change into a, a a mermaid outfit. Um, something uh something goofed a little bit. I don't know. I thought I had a good mod for kids, but maybe it's not. Maybe it doesn't work. That's okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have the tail. See, now she changes into, like, her little... I don't know. Is there any way I can... Gussie up? Wait, is there anything from here that I can do? Mermaid. No. I ex I have ex nutted that. <laughs> I have expected that. Yeah, I don't know. I thought I did. I mean, there's literally a mermaid costume for kids, right? Plan outfit. I don't know what, like, technically what outfit, if it's really anything I can change, you know? So I might have to just wait till she's a. I can just let her. I like her having the fish skin, though. Like, she doesn't have to swim ever. She can just be in the fish skin. Hey, Herb, is Mary Sue available to talk? No, she's working. That was Flamenco calling for Mary Sue. What is this? What, is there any connections there? Not really. Interesting. Flamenco, a, a suave guy? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay. Um, I really, I'm going to do a BRB. We're going to pause. I do have to go use the bathroom real quick. We're going to do a little BRB.
I like how as I do that, the message pops up that I'm like, okay, it's almost like an hour. It's almost time for me to... Um, I'm going to do a BRB. Yeah, I know. Mr. Bella slash Herbert. This is Bella clone. This is clone Bella. Look at... Wait, she's... Clone Bella's talking about real Bella. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go... We'll then take a BRB, and then maybe when we come back, we'll watch a little machinima. A little machinima moment. That could be fun. Uh, let's see. Hopefully the music wants to play for me this time. It was being troublesome. We'll see. Okay. Uh, the game is still loading. I did a little reload. Uh, also, yeah, the, the intro to this song was kind of like, what's going on? <laughs> what exactly is going on here? Um, let's see, the game's still loading up here. Uh, okay, looks like it's... Let me just... Let me get... Let's get her, get her loaded and ready to go. They're locked and loaded. And then we'll watch a little machinima moment. Um, I think we should continue watching the one that we were watching last one of the other times. Remember, there's that the one that's like, for some reason, there's just like a bunch of teenagers and like one house is the boy's house and the other house is the girl's house. 
I have opera background music. I almost thought you accidentally muted stream before leaving. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. Muting sounds sound like ambient music that plays. Oh, interesting. I guess I don't have that on mine. On my opera. Maybe I disabled it. Okay, we're gonna let that load. Um, so yeah, so last time we were playing, um, we watched, I think we watched The Accident. Remember the girl he went missing? Yeah, we did watch, I think we gotta watch episode three. The first one, it was like some kind of weird, we, we can't figure out if it's like supposed to be a dorm or if it's supposed to, like what the deal is. I don't know if it was, it was the Wattpad coded Sims 2 series. There was a funky implied... Okay, nothing great in this one. It's very... I don't remember if we watched this one. It's called Life is... Who is the father? <laughs> okay, pause. Oh, that's right. So you even got like an intro. It's definitely pause my music too. Do you even got like an intro? <laughs> Life is who is the okay, uh my life, Sims 2, Sims 3, who is the father? So it's episode three, uh season one. Okay, that's right. There was a there was a kidnapping and stuff going on. <laughs> Hello, Crystal Beth. Yes, you have you have joined in time. Halftime machinimer. Halftime machinimer, yes. While well, my game reloads because Herb Oldie broke my game. Herb Oldie made my game go pink soup. Okay, let's try. Let's see. <laughs> we got Roxy, Connor, Connor with the skinny jeans. We got the brunette, Alex, Ugg girl, other emo boy with skinny jeans standing on the. I can't get over him standing on the swings. The way he's just on the swing set. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, yeah, also, I want to. Walk over to my correct screen here. This is my machinima watching screen. Machinima watching screen. This is like the longest running Simpson machinima, I think. Okay. I think I remember us talking about that a little bit, maybe. <laughs> yeah, impeccable balance. Okay. Fang. Raven. <laughs> her, her, her name kind of blends in. Kendra looks scared. Why is Kendra scared? My, it was the father. Oh, that was quick. Oh, my. Okay. Okay. That, that was quick. Okay. Things happened really quick. Um, Connor, we have to find her. Oh, I forget how crunchy she is. <laughs> She's so crunchy. Is the swing set really large or is the boy really small? Good, good question. <laughs> Raven the X vampire. Yes. The running. <laughs> okay. Can I just, can I just, okay. Because this was really quick. Three, who's the father? Okay. We have to find her. This place looks promising. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is this? This looks like it's made out of chocolate. Why is this house made out of chocolate? This chocolate house. <laughs> Jumping right in with four locos running. This place looks promising. <laughs> this random place in the, in the neighborhood looks ominous. Imagine it's just like an innocent person's house who just has like a unique house this looks promising like that does is that how it works is that what you it's locked it's somebody's house connor no we will never find roxy <laughs> what is happening wait okay it's happening fast do i have like fast forward on are we at normal we are at normal speed okay i don't No, she's freaking out because the door is locked yeah all teenage girls can be found in houses not while I'm alive. He, yeah. Okay. He kicked the door in. <laughs> he kicked. Okay. I, I feel like I need to just. So he kicked the door. Okay. 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 He, yeah. Okay. Door kick open. Who the heck are you? Your worst nightmare. <laughs> okay, Connor. <laughs> Get lost, you stupid kids. Connor, what the heck did you do to Roxy? Hi. Yeah, we found her. <laughs> <laughs> this this picks up nine one one. Hey, we found her. Hangs up on nine one one. Uh, ma'am. <laughs> I know. I don't understand why it's so fast. I don't think the other ones were that fast. 
shoot they found me shoot <laughs> shoot gosh darn it <laughs> Ooh, a seven stream streak crystal math okay okay oh my gosh roxy i'm so glad you're alive Marks, are you okay? I'm gonna effing kill that stupid son of a... Yeah, I'm okay, but I don't know what the heck the guy did to me. Okay. <laughs> I don't... I think there's some weird things happening. There's some st some questionable things. I remember last time. Jeez, what is going on? Are you sure you're okay? Okay, we get it. We found Roxy. We're hugging her. Yeah, I'm fine. I, I'm glad you're alive. Wow, that was hard to read. She got abducted. Yeah, it's... She got a, she got stolen and like, yeah. Now let's get the heck out of here. It's not a grape. It's not. Gr it's like trafficking <laughs> a little bit. It was it was a little unexpected. It seems like that part's over though. And I'm curious where we're going. Mo wait, I'm just seeing move to Florida. <laughs> okay, so wait. Okay, so they okay. Yeah, got, uh, <laughs> those are. Glad you're alive, Roxy. Yeah, all thanks to you guys. Okay, they just run off into the night. They're running. And then we just get this. <laughs> Raven has moved to college for a few years, and Kendra moved to Florida. This is really fast moving. A casual loss of clothing with an adult. Yeah. <laughs> a, a, a word that rhymes with great. Yeah, it's not qu I don't think it was supposed to be. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's what it was supposed to be. Raven had her vampire bit. That was that. Yeah, pretty much. Kendra moved to Florida. R.I.P. to Kendra. And yes, they did say goodbye. <laughs> and yes, they did say goodbye. And now Sarah is leaving? Question mark? Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> Question mark? Okay. Oh, now you're going to let me sit and read something. Okay. Hey, guys. I know this is sudden, but my mom asked for me to visit for a few months. Oh no, that's okay. I'm sure your mom really misses you. Bye, Sarah. I'll really miss you. You too. Is that Ro wait? Where's Roxy? Roxy's not here, right? Oh no, that is Roxy the, in the white shirt. Okay, they're saying goodbye. Bye later, guys. Wasn't this a teen? Yeah, it was. That's what the confusing part was. And then it's also because like we were thinking, is it a dorm? Why are they all a bunch of teens living together? side by side and because but then in that that little card it said somebody raven went off to college so like i don't know unless it said another college connor visits the girl's house <laughs> this is what kind of finishes <laughs> visits the girl's house watching out for roxy in case psycho derek shows up <laughs> but roxy is hiding something from connor okay so we're just they just we're getting like it's like time jumped, I guess. I don't like why did we need that little in between scene? Well, Alex, looks like we're the only girls left for something. What wait, what did it say for now? Okay. He's looking out the window for Derek. <laughs> Psycho, yeah. Fisco? <laughs> Fisco? Is this a cult? A boarding school? What where are these kids living? I know. But like the, maybe a boarding school? Please don't remind me. I could have been the last girl if we have it, we haven't saved you. Oh, please. So wait. I could have been the. Oh wait. I see what she's saying. Okay. She's. She said I could have been the only girl if you weren't still alive. If we hadn't found you in the chocolate house, that one of the emo boys kicked the door in for us. True story. I mentioned it. True. Sorry. I mentioned it. <laughs> Connor, are you still worried about Derek? I love the spelling of Derek, too. Like, the CK is wild. <laughs> Nutsiv. Oh. Yes, they did say goodbye. <laughs> I like how Sarah got a whole scene about her leaving, but they they said forget about it with Skip Raven and Kendra, yeah. That's kind of a stuff to say to her. I know. She's like, if it wasn't for you, I could have been last, and that's the most important thing. Heck yes. I almost lost you, Roxy. I would have never forgot forgiven myself. Oh, Connor, it's not your fault. I should have been more careful. <laughs> Thanks. Something. Are you okay? Is something I said? She's throwing up. Because she's a pregnante. 
the the filthy toilet with the cut wall that had the wall over here is is down <laughs> okay <laughs> they know each other for a week yeah <laughs> they've known each other for a nut right yeah pretty much <laughs> pretty much both of those statements are true they like went over to each other's house and then like woohooed her hair physics is wild wait did y'all see those physics watch her hair watch her ponytail It's like the bottom half is like all over and the rest is stiff. <laughs> Look at it go. I'm fascinated by her ponytail. Okay, I'll clean this. Something's going on. He's like, oh, you threw up. She's like, okay, clean it up for me, housewife, male wife. I think this isn't how Gregante works. <laughs> Next gen physics. The wall? Oh, okay, can we... Oh. I'm fascinated by the ponytail. You want to tell me about what something? Um, are you sick? I think I'm pregnant. What? Did Derek do this to you? Who's the father, bro? I don't know. <laughs> but who's the father, sir? <laughs> oh, this is like the end, sir. You're. You, the two of you fooled around, <laughs> remember? <laughs> I like how he immediately jumps to Derek. It's like, actually, do you remember that the two of you, um, I think I'm pregnant as I'm wearing a, a tight, a skin tight corset shirt. Yeah. <laughs> has it been like a year? Is it, has it? I don't even know. <laughs> to be continued. Okay. Oh, oh, it just replayed. Oh. Uh, we could watch episode four. <laughs> that was only four minutes long. Yeah, I thought there were there were multiple time jumps. I don't know. I don't know if any of any of the comments are going to help us with that. I kind of want to know <laughs> longest four minutes of my life. Time has no meaning in this. I kind of want to. Maybe we'll wait and watch the next one at the end of, of stream. <laughs> Maybe we'll leave. I'll leave this open, and we'll like watch the next one. Now, how did now? How does my display capture not? Oh, because I'm on the other thing. There we go. Okay, we gotta gro go back into this household. <laughs> back to this wonder, wonderful. Mr. Pink is the yeah. ad. It does this whenever you like reload the lot. At least for me, it does it whenever I reload the lot after a Pink's incident. All right, my stupid thing is sliding around. <laughs> Family pork nut. <laughs> my 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 chair. I don't. I don't. I wish there was a way to lock them in. This this new chair has sliding like adjusting armrests, and they just slide out a bunch. Okay, here we are. Back in, back in good old. Okay, things are happening between these two. He wants to be besties with her. We'll just do, I'm just going to do, oh, there's not a friendly because they're already friends. That's annoying. You think she likes dirty jokes? Um, let's gossip. Uh-oh, she doesn't like the dirty joke. Oh, Coral finished Boo. Okay, so Daniel's sick, Angela, and Lilith. I didn't see if somebody else was. Pork nut. Is that Bella? It is. It's, it's, this is clone Bella, though. This is not the oh, is imposter Bella. Yeah. This is imposter Bella. Bella's hor horrified. Okay, what else are you going to make? I feel like it's a little quiet. I'll turn it up. Uh, how about a quilt? Let's make a little purple quilt. She's disgusted by him. She's horrified by him. Lilith is, is surviving. Lilith is in here surviving. Girlie, you already got a kitten. You already got a kitten. They keep wanting kittens. What are you gossiping about? This random man? I don't understand. 
Um, um, can we do like a friendly hug? How do we? We gotta make besties. Angela, you gotta stop. Angela needs to stop. For some reason, she wants to learn physiology. If you if you really want to, little gremlin. I don't think they know. I don't think they know. I swear to God, if you're about to no, stop. I think we need like an instrument or something here for her to like play with. Also, I can get rid of these cribs. The girlies also need like. Um, one of these. Wait. Can I get this to show up here? No, I gotta, I gotta do it this way. I'll we'll put it under. She's throwing stuff under. <laughs> there we go. Um... So, I don't know what Angela's- he'll just delete that. I don't know what Angela's, like, hobby is. <laughs> She's a what? Mer we made her a mermaid. The- we were thinking- so she has- in her bio, she says her lifetime wish is to be a fish. Or her lifetime, like, goal is to be a fish. So, uh, we decided that it was a good idea for her to become a mermaid. But we- we did- what happened was she was squishing bugs outside. And I think Coral, or Mary Sue, I don't remember who it was, ordered the, like, had the exterminator come. And so the exterminator showed up and immediately, like, walked to the bugs that Angela was on top of and just started squirting this noxious gas all over Angela. And it was kind of rude of him. And we decided that it gave Angela superhuman powers that of the mermaid variety. Um, and that's the lore. Angela's now... Angela's now a mermaid. <laughs> well, okay then. <laughs> Angela's now a mermaid. <laughs> what should she? Maybe she should have like a little synth. What are like little kid? What can little kids play? Maybe a violin. I feel like they'd let her have a violin. Where'd the violin go? Isn't it right here? Right here. I'm gonna do quarter tile, I guess. Not me just key smashing. Here we go. I was asleep. I have to come to the streams on time. You, you're late. You're late. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're going for dinner. Maybe back later. Okay, Arp Deco, have a good dinner. Have a good dinner. We gotta get rid of some of these baby toys too. Um, I don't know what Angela's like interests are. Does she have like a hobby? Oh, she has the mermaid. Became mer person. <laughs> Look at this pretty little picture. Um, I need like a, I need a, do I have a sim blender here? I'm going to make one of these a sim blender. Mm -hmm. Um, bum bum bum, traits. So let me check Lilith. Hers is music, which is correct. Hers is sports. Oh, I accidentally hit games. I think I accidentally changed it to games. I'll get put it back. I, I don't mind sports. But I guess what it like. I don't know that there's an indoor sports thing. Maybe she can. Can she do ballet? Doesn't count as sports, right? That's like music and dance, right? I kind of want her to have a little ballet bar, though. Maybe she should be into dance. Maybe they could- maybe she can be into dance. That feels good- doesn't that- that feels okay for Angela to be dance. It's- it's technically called music, but it's music slash dance, I think. Do mermaids eat fish? I don't know. Like, she's attacking- do you think Angela feels weird at going fishing now? Oh yeah, indoors can- I can watch sports on TV, that's true. I wish there was like a different- or fitness? Oh, excuse me. I might, I'm gonna give her a dance for right now. And then she can- because I gave her like a little ballerina outfit. Oh, she's gonna go- that's right, she's gonna go study. Actually, I'll let her study. Stop, I told you to not do that. I'm gonna answer the phone. Little gremlin? 
little gremlin. <laughs> Show Crystal and Angela's scales. I love that you're so dedicated to Angela's fishism. She got scales on her skins. This is she got scales. She's scaly. Yes, I require proof. Oh, is coral available? Yeah, sure. Let coral talk. Scaly pin. <laughs> she, she got eczema. She got some eczema. Honestly, same. <laughs> Honestly, same. Daniel's on the brink of recovery. Oh, Angela's healthy. That's good. I'm gonna do the immune thing again. You need to come upstairs and practice on your silly little violin that your mommy bought you. <laughs> Eczema! She's a child, you can't call her bitch. There's a CC mini trampoline you can get. Ooh, I think I have seen that. Maybe I need, need to get that. I think I've seen that before. Dag, dag. I think these two are fooling around. Are you are you talking on the phone in here? Do they have a phone? They must. Oh, she has a phone out here she can talk on. Okay. Oh, he's he's ACR in her. Oh, he's charming. He's not even ACR. This is just autonomous charm. I do. I am gonna have to gussy the girl up and take off this blush because that's a little bit much. I'm not crazy about this default dress though. I like the shoes though. I think that's why I have it. It's because of the shoes. I don't know. My eczema isn't as cool looking. Same, yeah. God, I had horrible eczema as a kid. I've got. I feel like it's gotten better as I've gotten older. Yeah, the dress just. I don't know. I love her little cross eyes. <laughs> Maybe we need a new dress for her. Um, actually, I'm just gonna hit none. There we go. I feel like she needs like a nicer red lipstick or something. Ooh, this like deep red. Ooh. Uh, maybe I should kind of like. Let's see. Not not Herb inviting her over and then saying, "Hmm, let me buy you a new dress and may do your makeup." Look her looking at me. Okay, hi, girly. Oh, apparently it didn't work. Maybe they gotta do their thing first before she'll. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll take out the default that changes these, because I'm just not happy with it right now. Um, Why are some everyday clothes? There we go. Um, Marisol and Daniel are so neglectful, they don't realize their golden child is scaly now. Yeah, honestly. Do you think she'll hide it from them? Ooh, you know what we should do? We should have her buy new clothes. What if we, what if she convinces her grandma to take her to the clothing store and buy new clothes to cover them up? Oh, I clicked change into, oops. Probably, yeah, that makes sense. I like this one. I just, there's something about this dress that's really cool. It's like, it's like Bella 2.0. I like I like the concept of Angela being like the vampire roleplay girlies, sitting in a class hoping no one notices my holographic scales. <laughs> That's funny. Butt spot. <laughs> Mary Sue would definitely be like, um, Nutry Sue. <laughs> Not Nutry Sue. Coral knows. Yeah, I feel like Coral's the cool grandma that knows. New name. <laughs> New name. New name just dropped. Oh, we do have this. I don't know if I love this. I wish it was strapless. I might go with the first dress. She could be she could wear a little maid outfit. Maybe that's her excuse is that she's a little maid. <laughs> Let's see if there's any other good, just like basic red dresses hiding anywhere. I don't think that there really is. Yeah, we could. We'll have her. I'll have Grandma drive her to the store. This is kind of cute. That's a red. But I also still want it to be like a little bit classic looking, like classic Bella looking. Also that. That's not bad. I'd ha I hate the shoes on it a little bit. 
Looks like they might be tweaked a little, though. The texture on the shoes is kind of weird. Juice comes back for full mermaid. Wait, but that could be... Oh, wait, this is kind of fun. Look at that. That's, that's like toxic red. Look at that. Oh, that's hard to look at. <laughs> but not... Please leave me alone. <laughs> but spot. But spot's fixated. Yeah, that's true. If that's if Bella goes to Tweaky Island. Um, like, what if that's the whole thing is like she she dresses like a mermaid so her parents think they're just painted on <laughs> maybe maybe i like the sweater dress uh and the one with shoes you don't like okay <laughs> yeah we might we'll try let me just see let's just choose what i've already got here let's go from this um let's see we've got this one. Oh wait did i not oh i didn't add that other one maybe let's see what this looks like in game oh my god it's like hard to look at. <laughs> like you can't even see the details of her body. <laughs> Why is it like that? <laughs> is it just my reshade? Oh, look at that's my reshade off. <laughs> oh no. Um oh, oh, they're kissing. Oh. I didn't even I did not have them kissing. I did not tell them to kiss. Oof, for real. <laughs> Oof. I'm gonna give her this for now. I think that's fine. It's it's Bella Core. It looks it's actually got a pretty nice texture. <laughs> Dreamy. I love that little set of emotes. <laughs> I feel like you have to give her toxic red lips. True. Uh, autonomy. Okay, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna let that one through. <laughs> yeah, it's very saturated. Okay, well these two have kissed. Um, I would like to go ahead. We're going to have Coral. Coral's on the phone with some random guy. Oh, that was what, what the pop-up was. We're going to go somewhere. We're going to take Angela with us. And it's, and this is the thing is it's going to make... It, Lilith is going to think Angela's getting special treatment. Um, but... We didn't steal art. We credit creators. I stole it. <laughs> I stole it. <laughs> credit at yeah, Every time you use that sp specific set of emotes, you must at dreamy. <laughs> credit at. <laughs> Where's the clothing one? Fashion. There we go. Fashion. More fashion. More passion. But, like, Angela's, I mean, Lilith is going to think it's, like, Angela's getting unfair treatment, but she doesn't realize, like, Lil Angela's going through something. I don't know. Maybe Angela, do you think Angela's going to admit it to her sister? Probably. Fire, eye, mouth, eye, fire. Why did he drag out the second eye? Eye, fire. <laughs> fire, eye, fire. That, that was almost like a jump scare. Oh, my God, that one's really good, too. I, there's something about the little eye and mouth emotes that's fun. Oh, I forgot that she was getting immune. I guess I could just leave it for now. There are things in this world that we will never fully understand. Aye? Aye? We want answers. We want answers. We have worked years <laughs> this is my default state. Okay, here we go. We're puttering off the lot. I like how the car moves. <laughs> Oops, I, no, you're okay. <laughs> we got, did, oh, did it, did it, um, overlay? Middle was finger, there, like, one? I, mouth, I, middle finger. Crystal Beth. Crystal <laughs> Beth. Thank you for the biddies, Dreamy. <laughs> all have covered the video. Oh, okay. That's all right. I think, well, I mean, I feel like it's the audio that's really it. <laughs> but, I mean, the video is good, too, obviously. Honk is supreme. <laughs> did Honk, did, was Mr. Honk there? Mr. Honk. I'm going to have to dig up some more new pictures of Ms. Olive Oil. All right, I gotta go. I'm gonna go digging and see if I can find like the first picture I took of her because I can remember. Well, actually, I think the very first one I took of her isn't very good because it's just like a blurry picture of her in her crate because <laughs> she was a scared little baby. Um. Okay, let's have you. No, she can't purchase. Grammy must purchase. Chef hat? Oh, I missed the chef hat. I didn't even see. He's got. He's working two jobs. He's he's a he's a single mom who never stops. He got he got a he got a job at the diner in Strange Town at seven. He gets off his shift. Oh. Okay, we gotta buy we gotta buy the little clothes. 
Let's see what she's going to buy something that's high coverage. Full coverage outfit for Angelina Jolie. Mm, maybe a dr like I think there was like a dress with like leggings. Oh god, this. <laughs> Angela's just going through like a medieval phase right now. Oh, there's these leggings. I think I was thinking about the arms. We need Ooh, this is pretty full coverage. Soul mermaid <laughs> with two kids. <laughs> Zuma. <laughs> He's a survivor. <laughs> He's a survivor. The Holly and Reaver are the only country girlies we like because they support yes. True. Um, I feel like this is kind of a this looks like she put the, it together herself hastily. Let's just see what else there's full coverage of. Um not this one. This one's kind of fun. I don't think that would quite cover the assignment here. Oh, the the Mormon the the hippie Mormon dress, the New Age Christian hippie dress. <laughs> that one's actually pretty good coverage. <laughs> um, I don't know a lot about the Dixie Chicks. Oh, we got sweaters. What's the season? It's like summer currently. Mm hmm. Mom, do you like my outfit, Mary Sue? Yep, I twitch. Yeah, I know. Mary Sue probably just does her best. She's probably, I feel like Mary Sue is very perfectionist. Maybe that would have been a good trait for Mary Sue's perfectionist. I don't think we gave her that. This. <laughs> I think that's going to be the best. I think that, that other one is going to be the best choice. I um plan outfit every day after it wait, we gotta wait until your your Grammy buys it. Oh. I guess it's just maybe it's, maybe we just missed the memo. Maybe we just like missed the, the memo of it's that it's like goofy hat day. Like maybe it's just special hat day, you know? Maybe it's us. Maybe we're the problem. Who's this guy? Fred. Hi Fred. Who are you? Gordon? G Jesus? I almost called him Jesus. <laughs> I almost called him Jesus. <laughs> okay, now you can go plan outfit. Um, there we go. Full coverage, girly. There we go. Now she, now you cannot see her scales. They might, you might be able to see a little on her chest. That's the only thing. You guys, you can see a little on her chest, but she hides it. She tries to distract with the necklace. What is on the shoe exactly? The shoe are fascinating. I'm confused about like what, like what's going on with the shoe. Like it kind of looks like a chunk of flesh. It looks like a messed up. That's what I'm thinking. Like what? Maybe the tan is supposed to be invisible. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> I walk all days. <laughs> Confused texture? I wish I had shoes like that. Okay. Well, uh, Darlene was going to talk to us, but I guess that's good. We're going to have her just maybe go home. I think that's all we needed. Who's here? Asha Barber. Randoms. Who's this little child? Andy Mata. Who are you? He's probably a... Is that supposed to be a... That's one of the, like, default townies. Um, he does have a bald spot. He does appear to have a bald spot. He's been renamed, though. Looks like a grunt. I think it's Orlando. Yes, Orlando. That seems so loud. <laughs> Thank you very much for the Prime, Fifi! <laughs> thank you very much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. That's the Sims 3 Let's Play that has Pete's. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> wait, wrong game. <laughs> you want the Pete's to transcend. Yeah, I think it's I think it's Orlando. See, they again, they all got randomized names. I still would like to try and be able to fix them, but... Well, actually, technically I could, right? Could I... Um. Oh, wait, Bella's here, but also at her house right now. Okay. I could use this little... I can do this real quick. Here, we'll hide it in here. Oh, 
Where did she go? Change first name, it was Andy. There we go. Skipping through the daisies. Yes. Yes, yes. My god, I can feel the air coming in in this window next to me today because it's really windy. Orlando, Florida. And Santowski. Santowski. There we go. Now he's got... And this guy, I don't know. Park, Dustin, we're going to play the Langorax eventually, but he needs his hair fixed. Okay, let's go home. It's raining. We got our new outfit. Uh-oh. Coral. Oh, Coral got, like, blocked in or something. Uh-oh. Fred's having an error. Everybody's having errors. Um, drive home. Who's this random teenager trying to talk? Andre? Leave us alone, Andre. Does Dustin know his future girlfriend is a fish? I, I don't think so. <laughs> He's gonna cast a spell. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Angela, get in the car. I'm afraid you're gonna turn into a fish out here. <laughs> Angela, please. We're playing with fire. Angela. Everybody's gonna know. <laughs> your your, your fishtail's gonna come flopping out. Please, get in the car. Get in the car. <laughs> oh no, clear! <laughs> It'd be funny if, like, that happened even when they go out in the rain, it just, like, they change. They, they can't help it. I think the main places that they transform is swimming and the bathtub, I think. I'll have to double check the mermaid mods for, like, child age stuff and see if I got something goofed up. Okay, so it's just Herbal and Lilith here. Herbal is still with his lady friend here. Oh, he went to Kiff. He's been ballsy. Uh, you gotta pee? You know what? I'll do that. Kiff the clone. This maid knows it all. She is so into him. He wants to flirt with Bella. He does want to go on a date, but I don't really want to commit to that right now because of them being here. I think he needs to do it, like, on another lot. He's gonna make out with her. This is really just kind of... It's kind of the romance. I didn't really push it. It kind of happened. I, I got him talking, but I didn't... <laughs> it's Lilith stomping bugs. No, she's up She's up here. Although they, they are still sick, yeah. I don't hear your music, Lilith. I guess it got bugged out. Um, does the Sims 3 trait mod? Yes. So it, it does. It depends on the version you download. You can download just the little pictures of the traits and it doesn't actually do anything on its own. Or you can download all the mods that are like linked to those traits. And it's like a whole bunch of different mods that affect different things. They're, they're kind of subtle. Some are more subtle than others. Some are a little more obvious. Um, like for example, Herb has the inappropriate trait and he keeps changing into his underwear when he should be changing into his everyday because he's inappropriate and he doesn't care, apparently. Stuff like that. Herb, you are not squishing bugs. These bugs are driving me nuts. I think we gotta call the exterminator again. Um, but yeah, there's different traits that do more obvious things than others. Oh, he wants to woohoo in bed. Um, casual, woohoo, bed, go. He likes his body to be able to breathe. Yeah, he's like, I, I must have air. Are they gonna go woohoo in his bed? Oh god, they're gonna go woohoo in Coral's bed. Coral in his bed. She's got, we got 37 minutes, I just almost just called him Hank. <laughs> I got 37 minutes, Hank. <laughs> Hurry up, Hank. Still more meaningful than Sims 4 traits, probably. <laughs> The salsa music play. Make Bella selectable? You think so? Look at her outfit. Okay, Bella. I see you, Bella. I see you, Bella. 
Oh, she wants to woohoo too. Oh, she's in love with Morty. Even though she's the clone. Interesting. She wants to woohoo. In in interesting. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Oh no, it's like they're, they're broken into the... <laughs> he was like clipping into the, the bed. <laughs> we got the broken cutscene. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Oh, you got me! <laughs> you got- that was perfect! That was really good. It's even paused. It's even paused and I still- I was like, oh. <laughs> got me. <laughs> also, I gotta delete this mod object. <laughs> I thought she's pregnant too. God damn it. That's funny. Did they do it again? Oh, he wants to woohoo with three sims. I'm gonna lock that in because that's actually his lifetime wish. Not dates, you know. He got his pension check. Okay. I'm gonna make unselectable now. <laughs> Someone clip that, please. We can also do exclamation point clip. Um, if you type exclamation point clip in the chat, it'll auto clip 30 seconds. I mean, it might not catch it by now, but um, might be good for future reference. Who knew <laughs> this was bound to happen again so many years later? True. True. There you go. You got a little something. I don't know. I think it's only, like I said, only 30 seconds. Okay, Coral's back and she just doesn't even really know. Oh, oh, and Coral let, let Ms. Angela have some cereal over here. Once got a broken alien cutscene with Sinjin Balani from the PSP and the cutscene um, just played on without music. No sim aside from some of the cult leaders wandering around the scene. Sinjin got a Bella Goth situation where he was never returned by the UFO. <gasps> That's so cool. That's weird. I got one once that was funny because um, I remember it was I placed I had I had I think it was either I think it might have been Pascal Curious. He was alien pregnant and he had the baby that he had. He had Tycho already. Or I don't know if I actually named him Tycho, but the Tycho baby. And then he had gotten pregnant again, and I moved him to a different lot. And, like, as soon as he was on the lot, I don't know, it. he immediately gave birth, like, on the spot as soon as play, as we hit play. And so it went right into the cutscene. So he was holding Tycho while the cutscene. So it just looked like a man being terrified by, like, terrorized by an alien baby as he's holding his baby. Because <laughs> it was just spinning around him while he's just, like, <laughs> he's holding his baby. It was funny. Let me save. But it, it, <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember if it like just reset the baby on the ground afterwards or not. Okay, saving a lot. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I wish you could see your face when baby chimed happen. <laughs> I can always, I can always go back. <laughs> maybe it'll be, maybe it'll be worth it to to do a clip, a little uh video i don't know maybe i'll have i i wish i could i just wish it was easier for me to like sort through and like have moments that i can make little compilations of and stuff but it's it's such it's it's a lot of work to like dig through a full stream a full six hour stream you know i did start making um a like compilation video of just like my my TikToks that I thought might be fun for those that don't use like that don't use the mobile app so they don't really necessarily watch shorts as much or don't use TikToks um and so I was going to just like I was making just like a compilation of a bunch of different ones so you just kind of it's like a video normal a normal YouTube video that you can watch that's just, excuse me that's just a whole a whole bunch of them <laughs> oh thank you I've been enjoying editing the shorts. It's been kind of fun. I got a whole bunch edited um, on Monday and Sunday. Sunday and Monday. I still have some more I want to do. Sir? Also, you're Daniel's home. Um, I really want Mr. Daniel to... What does he, like, want? He wants to kiss Mary Sue. He wants to invite someone over. Is he going to be ballsy and invite 
invite her over? He wants to be friends with Willow and he wants to woohoo. Maybe, I don't know. He. I'm going to have him call Sim and see if we can get. Wait, he's going to go. Wait, I got to wait. I got to let this happen. There's something that's about to happen. He's going to go admire clone Bella. <laughs> this gay lover. Over. Oh, he's following Bella around the house. He's like, wait a minute, ma'am. Actually, kind of this this dress is growing on me a little bit. He's trying to he's trying so hard. I'll just do it again. <laughs> he was trying to admire, so I'm going to let him. Um, what would you recommend to someone who wants to start creating content? I don't know. I guess uh <laughs> uh to just to just do it. <laughs> My first ever like YouTube series was um I made a strange town series back at the very beginning of 2020 before even like covid started and stuff and it was terrible it was it was a terrible series because all of my my the technical side of things was was all screwed up um i kept like <laughs> i guess that's question sammy blue screens no the um i'm gonna have him call again like all of my technical stuff so like the, the all of the footage was like choppy and like weird and my mic was terrible and like it was just awful and like but i still like edited it and tried to put it out and stuff and i still had like some people watching i got like five views a video or something <laughs> but like then eventually i actually i stopped making videos for a long time because of like covid and like everything got chaotic at work and stuff and then at the end of 2020 i started strange view um and then I just kind of, I just kind of kept making videos. I was just kind of inspired by other creators. Kind of used them a little bit as an example or an inspiration, I guess. Um, but also tried to do my own thing at the same time. You know, it's like a balance of that. Um, and yeah. Oh, you should try coming back when Willow isn't at work. Oops. Oops. I wonder if maybe he would also like, I'm going to lock and invite someone over. And woohoo, maybe? I feel like maybe, maybe he, did he woohoo with Bjorn? But yeah, I don't know if that's helpful, uh, Thicky Bunny. Um, I feel like, yeah, just like getting st started and, and jumping in and finding your bearings and figuring out where your angle is, <laughs> you know, <laughs> and you ate. <laughs> well, you know, I, I try, I try to eat. I have a snack from time to time, you know. <laughs> Okay, so Mary Sue, did he, he woohooed with Bjorn, Granya? Bjorn, he did woohoo with Bjorn already. Who else should he, um, who else should he try and invite over? Oh, well, yeah. I think also for me, when it came, I, obviously it depends on like what you're interested in making and doing and stuff, but like for me, starting on youtube and then transitioning into trying to stream was really helpful because i already had like a definite uh like a, de a definite handful of folks like my very first attempted stream was on youtube um and i think i probably had like like 10 15 maybe at some points 20 people hanging out which was pretty good for like but like my my tech again my internet was horrible i had to I had to stop after like 10 minutes or something <laughs> but like you know it was helpful to build that up in that way yeah it's weird i wish i think there's a lot of folks that would like to have watch sims 2 stuff and it's like it's just like a fluke about whether you really happen to like find the audience or not um yeah that's definitely hard with 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 an older game like that but it's like at the same time the sims 2 has a really dedicated fan base like the people that are there are like really there you know so but yeah i know this hairstyle is ridiculous so who should he call like let me go by chemistry so Bella, he didn't. I don't think he woohooed with Bella yet. We get Bella. T he has a thing for Tiffany Burb too. And then Gundren, that was right. Gundren, maybe he could get Gundren to come over. Olive Specter. Imagine an Olive Specter, and 
and <laughs> Daniel having a baby, and then Willow. She didn't want to come over. Ileana Langerak. That could be fun. Random lady. Michael Bachelor. <gasps> Wait, Michael Bachelor and Daniel? Should we make it should we make it as gay as possible here? Wait, I think I need to call him up. Ah, uh, we got his answering machine. We'll try again. We'll wait. We'll just wait and try again some other point. Anyway, Mary Sue's back, so he he doesn't want to kiss her, so why don't how about she goes here? Um let's just do a little little kiff. They remember they've never made out before. It's tricky to find us uh us the fans are so loyal. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's also true. Like, I think there's also just, like, a lot of people who are very dedicated to their particular type of Sims 2 gameplay, and sometimes it's... I don't know if they want to watch anything other than that, if that makes sense almost. But I don't know. Praying for you to know the, the chaos of another set of twins. Oh, God. I don't want any more babies in this household. Oh, oh, oh. Did they knock? Did they kiss? What, she, but then he complimented her, and she said, no, screw off. Okay. Interesting. You're driving him away, Mary Sue. You're driving him away. What does she want? A bird cage. Why do you want a bird cage? Is this also facing the wrong way? Yeah, it is. There we go. <laughs> I'm gonna let Automon push that one through. You can kiss me, but keep your horror mouth quiet. <laughs> okay. Hello, Automod. Good to see you. <laughs> you're, you're, that's just a, a check to make sure that Automod is awake, you know? Is she a grouchy? She might be. Yeah, she's pretty grouchy. She's only got three points here. And she's pretty serious. Oh, wait. Did I... Wait, I fixed it. Didn't I fix it? Yeah, okay. That was just like a delayed response. He's pretty sleepy. Um, did you eat? I don't know if you ate. Just come eat. Bella's eating all of our salad. This poor girl. She's been wandering. <laughs> Automod might be a grouchy sim too. Yes. Yeah, I think... D did we give... We didn't give her perfectionist, did we? Maybe instead of star quality, I'll do perfectionist. Also, like, does unlucky work for her? Let's see, perfectionist is the one with like a one of those that triangle, like here it is, yeah. Measuring tools. Hmm. My stupid chair, sorry. If you can hear like weird noises. Is that leaves? I love leaves. <laughs> but it's like I've I've not I've been wandering the sands of <laughs> Strange Town for eons. I love I have not seen a leaf. What if she's hot headed? I feel like Mary Sue could be a little hot-headed since she's grouchy. Or maybe just, like, grumpy. Like, why not just grumpy? Yeah, she got the whole package. I like I like tweaking things over time as we kind of see fit. Oops. There we go. She wants to buy a sculpture. Wants to invite someone over. Oh, I forgot. We gotta do the private school thing, too. Maybe we'll have her go ahead and call invite headmaster. Or I'm guessing it'd be, like, tomorrow is when he'd show up. <laughs> yeah, so... Unlucky works in the sense that she gets screwed over in the preset story mode and Daniel, but otherwise, eh, yeah. I feel like she's so, like, anal and, like, very very like everything must be organized that like unlucky maybe doesn't happen for her you know i think it over how pretty this game is oh lilith on the brink of recovery okay that's good um yeah we'll do this hey no. <laughs> <Not a lot. laughs> okay so tomorrow 5 p.m daniel's like you know what one time i got arrested i met a lot of cool guys in the in the jail cell and Bella's like, yeah, me too. <laughs> Beth. <laughs> Bella's like, yeah, I like meeting new people. I wander around all the time meeting new people. I like the sun. It is nice. Oh, he didn't, he didn't agree. He says, I hate the sun. 
I hate the, look. <laughs> I hate the sun actually. It's terrible, and I hope that it, it explodes. But I like having best friends. <laughs> they just love this salad. She's like, yes. Also, friends are good. Friends, friends, good. Yes. Where's where is you? Oh, apparently the game. The game has this is our <laughs> okay. We got the random gender preferences of our headmaster. He's he's a straighty. He's a breeder. Look at, look at these people just scarfing down salad. I think I already read that. Van Dibben. What does imposter Bella know about friends? <laughs> True. True. Is it effing what? You know what I said. <laughs> there you see the, the type... <laughs> <laughs> the type to make her whole family go on a diet. Salad checks it. Yeah, true. True. What are you doing, Miss Mary Sue? She needs fun. Okay. Thanks for letting you for letting us know, have headmaster. I'm happy for you or sorry you're going through that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Bella's back over here. What if, like, we fooled around with Bella, like, what? Oh, oh, okay. Bella was happy to poop in front of... She has a lot of trust in this man. <laughs> I don't know. I think Coral has given him a little bit of love. He needs more attention, though. Aw, <laughs> uh, to be... To be... To be... Pooping in the same room as Herb Oldie. <laughs> With the energy <laughs> that we've created in the studio today. Oh. He naked. He just, he is obsessed with, he's always in his underwear. She's like, oh, he's so hot. She's just obsessed with, he, it, Coral has no idea. Coral is oblivious. Coral is too innocent. He just will not wear anything but his undies. He will not wear anything but his undies. <laughs> yeah, right in front of his face. And you know what? He's he's probably into it. He said it's stinky in here now. Yeah. <laughs> he said, I like it. He likes it like that, probably. He's he's a freak. He's a freak like that. Lilith Pleasant is unpleasant right now. Let's see. She wants to what does she want? An easel. Coral asexual confirmed. <laughs> Maybe we can get a little easel in here, down here somewhere. Mm -hmm. I'll put this here and we'll put it like. <laughs> Inappropriate Sims will always change their undies after bathing. Yeah, yeah, it's funny though. It's just so funny. I haven't really had an inappropriate sim right now. So like, it's just, it's, it's a fun experience. <laughs> and I love it for, for Herb, trying to make it like a Herb thing. Um, wait, child painting? Oh, there's something called child painting on this easel. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, he's clipping. Oh yeah, I know, Herb and his undies. I feel like he's gonna go, he, oh, he's, he's cooking dogs in his undies. He's cooking dogs in his undies. Oh, the way that the way they flip back around on their own. Okay, watch they. Oh, I didn't didn't do it that time. <laughs> oh, I gotta run a dumb ad again. He cooking wieners with his wiener out. I hate that. <laughs> you better be careful. We had a couple. Um, and they're always walking around in their undies, randomly showing up at their friend's house un unannounced. That's cool. I do like that. Wait, I like that for him, so that when we're playing other households, he's just going to show up. I like that. In his undies. <laughs> That'd be funny. Boxes with hearts. Needs an, need an embarrassing trait. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. What was I going to do? Oh, I got to run dumb ads again. It's just, it's just kind of... I'll make sure not to do anything important behind these stupid ads. Cringe trait from The Sims 4. True. Okay, Mary Sue's doing her thing. 
Nurse is doing her thing. You know what I did download also was I up, I downloaded like the updated mods for like these traits where like if a sim has the nobility thing, it means they like don't do cleaning or something. Um I think maybe this I think like these upper class ones, they don't like do any cleaning or cooking in the house. Yeah, there is a socially awkward trait. I don't know if I'd want to give it to her because I think that means doesn't that mean that he fails more? I mean, I guess inappropriate means he does too. I'm gonna give her this and just see how it works. Yeah, I need to give it to the goths too. That was I think that's what it was brought up last. So she's gonna have that in there too. Hopefully that'll help. She wants a sculpture. I guess I could buy her a sculpture. She needs a sculpture. We don't have a ton of money. I mean, like, we don't have a lot, but she wants a 1500 sculpture. Maybe we'll put it, like, out here somewhere. What's she gonna... What's Mary Sue getting for a sculpture? Um... Hmm. <laughs> uh... Haunts. This is a unicorn. How much does this cost? 500. That's not expensive enough. I need more expensive. What's this? That's 2k. That's This guy's 1500. Oh, he's so small. He's a little philosopher. Alien spaceship. Bonehilda. 199.99. For one easy installment of 199.99. You, you too can have Bonehilda at your house. 1500. This one's not bad. This one could be like here. 1300. Okay, so it seems like we don't have a lot of. This one's 1500 too. This one's a little basic. Are you 1500? This guy's 1500. <laughs> wait, wait. What if this has to do with her political campaigns? What if she's just got like this out here because of her like politics? She's, like, trying to get passerbys to, like, have her propaganda. <laughs> How about a slab of tree? I don't know where you'd actually put it, though. Just, like, in the way of the car. <laughs> in the way of the car. Mary Sue's propaganda. Are there, are there any recolors? Oh, there are. Oh, I can't get over there. There we go. <laughs> Sims vote on their property. Yep. There you go. Oh, she wants a promo. She just put it, pulled it out of the trunk. Yeah. There you go. Now she wants a game costing three grand. You don't even have that. Daddy boy's sleeping. This room. Auto lights. This room. Okay, she's painting. Angela's zonked out over here. I actually would like for Angela to maybe get up here and, like, go take a... Oh, I guess she's gotta go to the bathroom. And sleep. You are thinking too high here. She is. She's thinking way too high. I know. The comfort... The, the, the comfort of sleeping on Grandma's couch. Look at her pointy shoes. That, that Those are for kicking men. <laughs> those are for kicking men where the sun don't shine. What's she thinking? She's thinking about Danny Boy. For <laughs> kicking Daniel and his pee pee. <laughs> that's, maybe, that's, maybe that's what she's into. <laughs> she's into causing pain. <laughs> I feel like Mary Sue is 100% <laughs> man kicking boots. <laughs> Also, Bella, like, can I help you? She's just here. Oh, there's hot dogs. Oh, you know what? I'm going to have her Angela come and eat because she's more hungry than she is tired. I, I, Bella's just chilling. Are you just chilling too, buddy? What are you doing? Lounge? You're going to just, you're just going to lay here and stare at your wife? Like, sir? Okay. Um, oh, Danny Boy's healthy. I don't know. What's he want? He wants a hot tub. Oh, buddy. 
He wants to meet someone new. He still wants to be besties with Bella, too. I really need him to, like, maybe just, like, take advantage of, like, joking and, like, hang out, maybe. They could do, like, a hangout. Just sit there and talk a while. Coral sleeping in a suspicious wet spot. Not this. For a second, I was like, wait, what? There's wet here? No. <laughs> Not that. Okay, you're sleeping. I guess I'll fast forward the night a little bit. Letting them do their stuff. Letting them do Does Bella live here? Damn, I know. Mary Sue available? No. Okay, Bella finally left. Bella finally left. Okay. Oh, she's excited to have a music and dance activity? Okay, we're 3 a.m. on a Monday dancing with Grandma. I feel like this might be an issue. Oh, she's chugging, yeah. <laughs> My fast forward is chugs. Oh, the cat is hungry, yeah. <laughs> Indigo, you are on a psychic level with this cat. Because just as you said that, it popped up. <laughs> I you give some of the weirder symptoms love to, like nut and herb. <laughs> I love them, I do. Number six will be very important for you in the next 24 hours. What could that mean? Well, she wants to sew a project. Mary Sue, the fact that Mary Sue's pajamas is that full body suit says everything you need to know about Miss Mary Sue. I kind of want to put two doors on this. And lock it so that only Mary Sue and Daniel can come in, you know? Like, I feel like they sh people shouldn't be coming and going in their little space. Do they have a... They do have... Well, I'm gonna get rid of this and put this here, because it matches her little thing. Oh, there's stuff in the way there, too, but that's okay. I wish that the mod that gives Sims, like, keys for doors actually worked, because I, I can't ever get it to work. I guess that's fine. Maybe just get rid of this. Okay, who's right there? Who are you? Go here. Go out. Leave, child. Okay, you're supposed to- did you come in- oh, you came and filled it. Okay, where's the baby? Um... You can feed her a treat? Does that help us at all? This will just limit a little bit of... stuff going on. I mean, it, if, if Danny ever has any, any lady friends here... You know. No, I saw the uh, some uh, cat thumbnails background. It turned red. Yeah, no, that's what I figured. <laughs> it's the amount of nuts Mary Sue is gonna stomp. Oh, six. Okay, I was like, <laughs> okay, <clears throat> that's six. Okay. So she's holding the cat hostage. Put him down. <laughs> watch, just watch your brain buffer again. Yeah. I was like, um... You wanna, like, clean up? Oh, oh, oh. They're having a moment. Okay, okay, please. Oh. <laughs> We're having a cat moment. There we go. A little baby tiger is causing issues. Okay, she's going up. What are you doing in here? How did you get so disgusting? What are you trying to do? Can you just, like... How about you clean up some of these messes over here? And just, like, come use this bathroom. All of the kids are going to be so tired. Is Petunia not eating? Petunia's eating. You need to go to sleep. It's literally 5 a.m. and the kids have not slept. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, that's true. The cat trying to trip her is very accurate. It's very accurate. Alright, you're gonna go. He's walking out in his undies to the... to go use the toilet. What are you trying to do? Read to? She's trying to read to somebody. In bed? Oh, are you reading to Lilith? Oh, wait, this is wholesome. 
She's walking around in her nighty. She's sleeping. Let her sleep. Just let her sleep. <laughs> just let her sleep. That was cute, but just let her sleep. Okay, we get it. Also, they haven't claimed these desks yet. I'll have her claim desk when she gets up. Hopefully that doesn't wake her up. She's literally so tired. I might have to, like, bump their energy just a little bit when they go to school. There we go. They're, like, literally about... The bus is about to come as she's laying in bed. Yeah, it's just kind of messed up. Ooh, Mary Sue has a day off today. Interesting. She's dreaming about love. Mr. Jacked Daniel. Jack Daniels. You gotta work today. Hi, Jean. How are you doing? How you going? D what is... Why, why is Herb just, like, standing around? Like, what is that about? Why did he purse his lippies like that? I don't know. He just... He got, he got a little excited. He was imagining kissing all of his lovers. Herbal. What are you trying, Herbal? Buddy, old pal. Are you, are you trying to interact with the kitten? Is the kitten here? The kitten's sleeping in his bed. Leave him alone. He wants to go on a date with somebody. How about you just come out here and, like, work on body? I don't know. I don't know. <gasps> oh, she's having a nightmare. Oh my god. <laughs> Even there's a kitten around just staring. Daniel's now now bothering the cat. Daniel, how about you work out before work? Can he get to this? Actually, I didn't see to make sure that he could actually get onto this thing. Oh, he can. Okay. He's fine. <laughs> yeah, Mary Sue is having a nightmare. Oh, look, this is like got spikies. Meeting someone new? Is she dreaming about Daniel cheating? Maybe she's having intuition that Daniel is cheating. <laughs> is the kitten in the room with us? <laughs> yeah, she's orange. Her needs are bad. She's hungry and her social's bad. Yeah, she's having nightmares about Daniel. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's why. I don't know. It's, it's, oh, the, the bus, you got always gotta get to the bus, you gotta get to the bus. I'm gonna fill their energy, I don't care. Girlies, you gotta go before gram grandma's gonna have to drive you to school if you don't hurry up. Oh, they just both simultaneously changed. <laughs> she knows something, yeah, she, yeah, Mary Sue has, has intuition, she's got, she knows. She knows, and she doesn't, I feel like she doesn't want to admit it to herself. Oh, she just got up. She's so hungry. Just hit H and have her. The girls are running off. The girls are running away. There is a lot of space over here for activities if we need it. I didn't pay attention to this space. It's H. Immediately goes to the kitten. <laughs> Mary Sue. What a pain in the butt. Oh, she wants to write a, 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 a novel. An award-winning novel writer, Mary Sue. Let me adjust my chair. <laughs> Who's walking on by? I think that was Skip. This is Mr. Skip Broke. I'm excited to check out the Broke household, too. Oh, Lilith is healthy. Okay, I think pretty much everybody in this household is healthy now. I think, I think. Oh, there's another cat here. Bailey. Bailey. Ma'am? I'm gonna make her not tired, because it seems weird that she's tired. Can we clean that up? Have, I don't know, have like a little omelet? Uh, the twins made over, do they have unnecessary ski slope noses? They seem to be, like, genetically correct. I think they are genetically correct characters. They, they look more Mary Sue to me. They look like they've got more of, like, Mary Sue's very round face and, like, more gentle kind of nose. I mean, Daniel's nose is pretty gentle, too. 
it's kind of weird how yeah i think yeah oh here comes our maid yeah i thought that the oh mary sue's like having a meltdown mary sue is struggling where's danny boy oh he's at work what if she goes is she gonna go like sit and talk to her mommy I'm going to have her get dressed because I don't think she'd be walking around like this unless she's really having a meltdown. Oh, Coral, where are you going? Or would she call somebody? Does she have any friends? She's besties with her mom. Oh, she's friends with Darlene Dreamer and Eileen Langerak. Okay. Are you going to take a bath? I guess you can go take a bath. Maybe she could call over like one of her girly buddies girly buddies her girly buddies is that what the is that what the, the ladies call it <laughs> is it my girly buddy their butt flap out yeah so i think i i so like in my strange view i downloaded like gen genetically correct sims um that one of the the start of like them being genetically correct was based on the creator wanted to make mary sue closer to her beta appearance Gal pals is good. That's true. She's going to get a social bunny. Um, but they attempted to make her closer to like how she looked in like the beta or whatever, which she looked like she had a much bigger nose. And I always thought that was interesting. I think that I wondered if Angela and Lilith actually had like the genetic appearance connected to like their original mother's appearance and not like sh the final Mary Sue appearance. And that's where the nose came from. That's what I always assumed. Um, but I don't know that for sure. Yeah, I know. I think he, I think Social Bunny's on his way. I think Social Bunny's got to be on his way. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got a yellow one. I haven't had a yellow one in a while. I usually get pink. Um, oh, somebody calling for Herb? Yeah, sure. I think I read somewhere that was the case. Okay. We got a piss bunny. Look at this guy. Isn't he pretty great? Social bunny. About the beta appearance. Yeah. Yeah. Also, I'm glad that you're good. Uh, just to start an, uh, j I just started a new family, The Sims 4, now before I go to bed. Oh, very fun. Oh, Mary Sue. She immediately said, I'm kicking his ass. <laughs> She's like, intruder alert. Oh my god. That was that she did that on her own. Um <laughs> She's taking out a rage. She's taking out a rage. <laughs> he is bright with the reshade. He, you're right. Um oh my goodness. But um that's cool. I'm glad you're doing good, Jean. And I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Mary Sue chose violence. I need a I need a mod that allows Sims to like kill other Sims, like a murderer mod. That would be so fun, and then we could have like certain Sims that are like serial killers, and it like actually identifies them as having murdered somebody, like a custom memory, and then Mary Sue cracks and becomes like a serial killer of, of Pleasant View. <laughs> I think that would be nice. I think that'd be fun. Looking at you, Olive. Yeah, Mary Sue and Olive win. Mary Sue and Olive win. Not oil! <laughs> not the oil! No, not nuttle! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know what you meant. <laughs> it's funny that that also works, olive oil. Okay, I guess this is her way of bonding with the bunny. Mary Sue's having a meltdown in her bathroom. Come answer the phone, Mary Sue. Go to CP oil. Extreme violence mod for Sims 2. I don't know if that exists. Yeah, I wish it did. <laughs> I wish something like that did. I don't know if there's like a CC gun where Sims can like shoot each other. I just think that would be, I just need more, I need more like random unhinged violence among my Sims, you know? <laughs> I think that would just be fun. Oh, somebody's calling for Daniel. Daniel's not here. I think this is Zelda May. Interesting. Okay, you need to come here and eat. Oh, I think we're out of food. Because it says, oh, it won't let me cook anything. A sword that can kill people. Oh. We're going to call delivery. Okay. 
I'm clicking the link. Okay. Okay. This is a sword that can kill folks? The warrior sword? Pick up and drop sword. <laughs> Demonstrate skills. Look at him. He's straight out of one of them Final Fantasy games. He's like a little anime boy. Oh, her arm going right through him. Fight Sim. Commit- <laughs> Oh! Kill a Sim. Okay. Intriguing. Intriguing. Okay. We're gonna order some groceries. Oh, you got that one for Veronaville. That's fun. We'll top her off there. Rip to Mercutio concert, Patricio, and many others. Oh my. <laughs> Sewer slide. Uh, I've seen Sims have guns. I don't know if it works. Yeah, I've seen it as a prop for Machinima. Oh, not me. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> my, the, the, mach the, I don't know if you guys saw that. Does it pop up? I don't even know. This keeps popping up on my screen. Proxy. <laughs> I don't think it showed up on the, <laughs> anyway. This nut was ahead of its time for ordering Groshna. It's true. She just keeps fighting. She just take but but here's the thing is that makes her look, that made her interaction level go up. Like she gets she's happy about fighting him. Oh. Also, yeah, they're kind of ahead of their time for the groceries delivery. Oh. Uh these two have arrived? Uh, sorry, what is Yep, delivery? Read everyone. Where's you? I just heard the cat yowling. She's just swooning. She's like, damn, my man's hot. She goes, damn, look at them, them little heart undies I bought for you, honey. I look great. Also, I didn't change her into her outfit that she, she sewed for herself. There we go. I'm still lurking, but yeah, you could use uh, guns to kill Sims. Okay. Makes the repo gun sound. Oh my goodness. Now imagine if they were like, uh, oh, wait, oh, I can't, wait. I don't see it in here. This one's cute with little booties. Oh. Okay, I don't know. Is it in her inventory? That's so weird. Do I have to like take- Oh! Okay. And the little bear. The bear's cute. The bear should probably go to one of the girls, but I kind of just want to like put it in here. Look how cute this little bear is. I really like the little patchwork bear. Add to wardrobe. Okay. And then plan outfit every day. Okay. Cool. There we go. She's got her little sewn outfit. Look at her little outfit. Her little outfit. When they do negative social interaction with the social media gets up. Just learned this from a YouTuber. Oh, okay. That, that's cool. That, that makes sense. Um, I'm gonna have her just like resume making what she was working on. Oh, you're carrying that all the way in here? Not the social bunny. Oh god, look at this. It's just following her. It's just following her. Maybe she needs to just, like, chat with Herb. Daniel wants to bring Laura Sue Cole home from work. Is that okay? It's your ass, not mine, Danny boy. Take hey, whoever you want. Oh, hi, Laura Sue Cole. What's up? Why you got these braids on your head, Laura Sue Cole? <laughs> Sammy choosing violence. You never know. You never know. Okay, there. <laughs> we know. <laughs> we always know. <laughs> Um, Sophie the Puffin's aspirations. Oh, the B versions. Oh, public enemy for grouchy, grouchy popularity. Okay. Oh, somebody did greet Morty. Okay, this is not good. Mortimer's face is stuck and it is kind of horrific. I kind of, I think, I think Mortimer has been cursed. 
What's going on in the Malfi zone? <laughs> His dentures are glotched. <laughs> I think his yeah, I think his dentures are lodged in and he's kinda got it he's just like stuck. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know the bat box can fix them. They're funny though. He's just there. He's just there. Oh, okay, it doesn't it's uh, doesn't seem to have fixed it, but the fact that it's like one side's down, maybe. Oh, if she's really tired and hungry, I'm gonna up her energy just because she's just going through it. Why can't she serve? Wait, she put the food in. Why can't she? Did he get cheated on? He he did. Mr. Mortimer did. Back when we were playing him. Why is she not allowed to make food? Why is it like broken for her? Do I need to reset her? Let me try. Yeah, let me save. Oh, I think you're writing to go. Oh, that's annoying. She only lets other people make food for her. You're right. She won't make food herself. So, like, I gotta get, like, like Coral to make it for her. Coral's gonna come here and serve dinner. Or serve lunch, I guess. I feel like I'm gonna be- I'm gonna- How do y'all feel about me giving Coral more cooking skill? Like, at this point, like, how is she, like, high sewing and gardening, being, like, a perfect housewifey, and she doesn't have very high cooking? I'm gonna give her higher cooking and cleaning. I'm making the executive decision. Her trait that I gave her is is called Nouveau... I don't know if I'm going to say this right. Nouveau Riche or Riche? Rich? 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 The Nouveau Rich uh, consists of those who ha whose wealth has been acquired within their own generation rather than by familial inheritance. From self-made business magnates to successful rock stars, these sims have money but not the pedigree. Um, and it's, I have a mod that makes it riche. Okay, thank you. <laughs> um, I have a mod that makes it so that sims that are, have this, they're like seen as like high class and they don't cook or clean for themselves. Okay, I'll give her all the points she deserves. Mary Sue is so melt, on, on, in such meltdown mode, she's literally using her dad's hookah. Like, Okay. That's a nut one. That's a nut one. Okay, no, you gotta sit here and wait for food from your mommy. You gotta let- Oh, I didn't see what she was trying to do with Danny Boy. Oh, he wants to be friends with Laura Sue. Oh. Maybe we'll lock that in. We'll just lock in the date one. Where did Laura Sue- da This poor man. Poor Mortimer. I cannot seem to- Where is Ms. Ms. Laura Sue? Where have you gone today? Herb is sleeping in his underwear. Oh, she's out here swamming. I need him to go out here. Can I, like... Oh, he running. Call over. Come on out. I may have fallen asleep. Woke up to hear Social Bunny come, and that's where new traits added, and that there's new traits added. <laughs> well, hope you had a good sleep. Okay, we need to leave this goddamn cat alone. I'm gonna do macro socialize friendly. Maybe we, maybe the girlies need to pay attention. The cat's sleeping. The cat's enjoying himself. Where are you? Oh, look at the girlies just doing that. Why are they all lined up trying to, like, what? The girlies are just like doing their thing. <laughs> this this could like I feel like this could be some kind of clickbait pro thumbnail picture. <laughs> Mortimer just looks 
Mary Sue has committed crime. Mortimer has seen. Yeah, and then Lilith. Oh, let me go back down. Lilith's like, can I help you guys? Okay, guys. Okay. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. You don't believe what Mortimer saw. <laughs> Why are they lining up to worship the twins? That's a good question. I don't know what they're trying to do. She's just, like, desperate. Okay, she's going to eat. Mommy made food. Mommy Coralina made food. Mommy Coraline. Kids stink is what he thinks, yeah. Are you not going to eat it? She's waiting to be served. Wait for food. She says, Mommy, please bring the food to me. You're calling the Catholic Church? <laughs> Hold on, let me just ring the Vatican. Let me just ring the Vatican. Oh, the headmaster's here! Oh! Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Headmaster. And she's having a meltdown. What a terrible day for this. Let's have... How, can we have the kids... Morty's trying to chat. Let's have her come out here. No, she can't greet. Ms. Mary Sue, I'm going to make her a little less hungry. She waited all this time. Can she not greet him either? Is he leaving? <gasps> I think he's leaving. Oh, the headmaster does not think that this is the kind of family that should be associated with such as <laughs> kind of association. Oh, no. He said it wasn't good. <laughs> Everything starts going to pieces, I know. He's like, he, he, he could hear it happening. Oh, Mary Sue, just eat. Just eat, goddammit. We'll try another day. This is a bad day for Mary Sue. She's going through it. She's going through it. Danny's out here chatting it up with some little young blonde cutie. Nut womp. <laughs> Wait, nut. <laughs> nut womp. <laughs> Can I get a- can I get a nut womp? <laughs> Make it worse, get her pregnant. <laughs> I want- I want somebody else to have Daniel's baby. Ooh, he wants to flirt with Laura Sue. Oh, she is disgusted. She is disgusted. Nut. <laughs> butt spot. It's funny how butt spot chooses a particular chatter and just like spams them for a couple seconds, like a couple minutes or a couple messages. <laughs> like, why? <laughs> the, the private school is prejudiced against merfolk. I think you're right. They they smelt it from the outside. This, this place smells like fish. This place smells like fish. We cannot allow that. Okay. Classic dance. Oh, a crush? Ooh, a crush has happened? The most beautiful creation. Um... I hope Mary Sue doesn't step outside. Where is she? She's gonna go chat with Morty? Poor Morty. I don't even know why Mortimer's still here. Oh my god, the tiny- that cat is so tiny. <laughs> it could be Daniel or Herb. <laughs> You're right. You're right. <laughs> yeah, his face is very stuck. And I chose the fixed faces, but I don't know. <laughs> Stupid expressions, and it didn't really fix him. Bro, what are you trying to do? Family kiss. Curl's like, my daughter needs a kiss. Oh, she stopped. She wants to be friends with Kaylin. She wants to be friends with Lilith. Where's Lilith? Lilith's in here on the pewter doing degenerate things on the internet. Okay, she okay, they both did they both didn't put their homework down, but let's I want Coral to come and like interact with her. She wants to be friends with Lilith. She's like, Lilith is struggling. Um Oh, she can't talk about music to her though. Family Kiv. Encourage niceness. Lilith's on AOL Messenger. She is She's on AOL Messenger. <laughs> she got it. She got an online boyfriend. 
She's in she's in she's in RuneScape as asking if anybody will be her boyfriend. <laughs> Encourage the hug. There we go. <laughs> Neo pets. Torsera reset might work. Okay, yeah, I could try that. Where is he? Oh, did he leave? Oh no, I think I hear his voice. No, that's these two. Oh, his face is back. He fixed. He's fixed. Mortimer. I love little Morty. I like little Morty a lot. I'm lurking. I have to pick my pick up pick up mom up from work and get some dinner. Okay, have a good time. Uh, drive safe. I assume you're driving. <laughs> so drive safe. <laughs> Mary Sue's just standing in the corner. I think she was trying to interact with the cat. Why don't you fill up Mary Sue before you go to bed? I'm listening because I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3. Ooh, very fun. Hi, Casey. I've, I've returned from grocery shopping. Got back just in time because the snow is really picking up. Oof. We're supposed to get storm soon, too. Thank you for a safe game. I will do that. That's a good idea. I'm not driving, just busy. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, you're fine. That's a fine. Uh-oh. Herbie's got a cold. Goddamn, Herb. Where are you? You gremlin. How dare you? I kind of want Herbie to get with the other Bella, too. He's got three bolts with OG Bella. Real Bella? What if we had a Bella Herb baby? We need Bella Herb baby. We need it now. The drama. Let's call Sim. Let's just let's just go chat. Maybe they'll go on a date to like the Strange Town Saloon together. Interesting. Uh uh. -uh. That's that's Clone Bella. We already are in love with Clone Bella. Let's call this one. Uh let's just talk for now and build up a relationship with her. <laughs> Baby, 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 baby. Okay, you're all. Oh, look at you playing your little ballet. Why is this like my lights goof sometimes? She's up here. She didn't really. Oh, she made friends with Grandma. That's good. That's good. Grandma's thinking about adoption. Okay. Ooh, I got a wicked headache, Foreman. Behind one eye. Oh, what do you want? Oh, she wants to eat a grilled cheese. I'm gonna eat. That's true. Lilith's bonding with the fish. She's trying to understand her sister's kind. She's trying to understand her sister's folks. She's like, is do any of you know my sister? She's a mermaid. I'm gonna get an eye patch. I'm gonna be like Hank. I'll get an eye patch. Is Hank no Hank doesn't have an eye patch. The other the other butler has an eye patch. <laughs> yeah, if anybody fixed that stupid light glitch, they'd be my hair. Yeah, that one's annoying. It's really annoying. Okay. You want to, like, go play video games or something? Or not video games. Play, like... Oh, you could come eat, but I think all the adults are eating for you. I like that everybody's just sitting here talking so much. They're talking so much that they're eating very slowly, but... I'm just kind of chilling. There's a lot going on in this household. It's literally only Monday in this household. <laughs> like, I, pl I play till Wednesdays usually, so we've got like, I mean, we've got like two more days in this household. I don't know if we'll finish it tonight. We might. I don't know. Because we're going, we're getting on to just about five hours. We'll see how it, how it goes. Danny, I'm afraid Danny's gonna pull something right here. I'm not telling him. He's interacting with her freely. He's he's like one second away from. Uh oh, everything just got filthy. What if we have her? Um. Oh, I can't influence. Why can't I influence? Interesting. 
boy has got that locked jaw. Is his lock? Is his jaw fixed? You're not playing with that goddamn dollhouse. Oh, that was quite a water effect that just happened there. Why don't I have him get in? How about you go swimming too? I'm surprised they don't have a hot tub. Like, that'd be good if they had a hot tub. You know? Yeah, how many points does she have? How do I look again? <laughs> These two. These two. <laughs> like, mother, like, daughter, apparently. <laughs> how many points does she have? I feel like Paula Nutchin, Mary Nut, would, should have Nut. <laughs> Okay. Congratulate? She's congratulating her mom on completing one of her college years. <laughs> She's like, congratulations on completing your freshman year, mom. I heard about that. <laughs> I know it's been like 50 years, but like, good, good on you. That stuff's hard, you know? Okay. Oh, repair? Oh, no. You're, she doesn't repair. I'm gonna call service. We'll call a repair technician. Also, probably should get a gardener. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! I didn't know that- wait, Mary Oh! <laughs> Which, hey, Mary Sue, would you like to join our conversation? Yes. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Herb is still talking to Bella over here. That's what I didn't realize. <laughs> so she opened up to call and then- <laughs> Like, you wanna join in? <laughs> She's sneaking in on the on the con though. Okay, she did did oh he's not friends with Belly yet though, but three freaking bolts, dude. Yeah, that that was a bonding moment between between Coral and, and Mary Sue. Oh Mary Sue hung up. She's like, I'm I'm over this. I need you to clean up Mary Sue uh Coral. That's your purpose here. You're tired though. You need to go to sleep in here. Phone is ringing. These two are swamming. Okay, but he got pretty close to this random Laura girly. I'll go try and get the phone. Yeah, that's awkward. <laughs> Herb trying to booty call. <laughs> and his daughter on the line. Yeah, oh, Morty's out here. Oh, wait, his face is back. His face looks like... Is his face broken again? It wasn't when he was at the table. Yeah, it's broken again. It snapped back. Mortimer. <laughs> I know, Danny Boy's hairstyle. I think eventually it might change, but it's so stupid. But it, like, it looks like he's... You know what I do like about it? I was considering changing it. But now that I've, like, it's grown on me, is Coral- I don't think we're gonna do that. But now that I've, like, it's- I've had it here, um... Excuse me. Um... I think it kind of, like... It works because it looks like he's trying so hard. You know what I mean? Like, that's- like, he's- it's like, he's one of those guys that just, like, doesn't know what to do with his hair, but wants to be cool, and he tries so hard, so he just, like, spikes it, and it just looks so stupid. You know what I- like, that's- <laughs> like, he's just trying so hard to stay young and fresh, and hide that he's got a receding hairline, you know, instead of just accepting that he is a mature man. <laughs> like, and he- he wants to try and please the ladies. <laughs> the household barely keeping themselves together. There's a lot going on. I feel like Angela and Lilith are a little bit in the back burner. Like, there's not a ton going on with them. Like, we're, I mean, there's stuff, but... Yeah. I think next step is... Oh, these two transcending to... They're, they're flying together. But yeah, he's got some... He's got some lovers. Yeah, he hasn't wooed with, with... See, what's gonna be broken, what's gonna be really broken is if Herbie somehow gets Bella, the, the OG Bella, to come 
over, right? And um and so like Herbie's fooling around with her and they woohoo. And then ne- next thing you know, Daniel and Bella are woohooing too, and they're just like trading Bellas. Like they're just swapping Bella back and forth between the two of them because both of them are <laughs> it's just gonna be so cursed and so ridiculous. You know that's gonna happen at some point. To be fair, they're the most interesting when they're angry teenagers, yeah. Where's Coral? Coral's sleeping. Wait, where's Herbie then? I thought that was Herb in the bed. Oh. He's making Skeddy. He's making Skeddy. She really gotta get up and go to the bathroom, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward a little bit. Okay, little little baby Ms. Angela. But yeah, I'm thinking like who what other kids are in their generation right now? Um I'm not sure who I know a lot of the like Willow and Creon's kids. Obviously Dustin. Who's this? Dustin. Um yeah, I'm just trying to think of all the kids they could be buddies with or have connections with in some way from Strange Town as well. Same with the teenagers. There's quite a bit of teenagers right now. Okay, buddy. Can you, like, you might need to, like, go to bed and get ready for, like, work tomorrow. Actually, I don't think he works today. Oh my god, I have the hiccups. <gasps> 3 a.m. Angela's up here. Look at the time. I better go. Yeah, I think you should, buddy. And while... I, th I'm, I think Laura's gonna freeze to death out here. I don't know. I'd really like to get him a hot tub. I think maybe... Um... Yeah. Oh, Tanklin? Tanklin? Tanklin. Yes, yes. I might sell this dumb car. Just because I don't really... I don't really care about that for Mr. Herbie. I'd rather have... A hot tub. How much do hot tubs cost? Oh. Oh. Hot tubs cost like eight grand. This one's six grand. I like this one. It's got wood. I guess we're gonna have to save up. Mary Sue, you gotta get some promotions so that Danny can have his hot tub and he can fool around with all of his lovers in the hot tub. What What is it showing me out here? I don't know what it's showing me something, but I don't know. Oh, you're right, the Aspiration Reward. I forgot about that one. And that one's cool because I have a default for it. In here. Oh, he's got so many points. I forgot about that. I got a little default for it that makes it this... Like this. I kind of want it to be on the concrete, though. Maybe it should be here. I don't know, that's a weird... Is that, like, a weird spot? I feel like that works. Obviously, I want to move these chairs. Uh, what? Cannot use chair? Oh, can't delete objects in reward mode. I thought it was trying to tell me it was in use. I'm like, what? I don't know if I love the placement. Maybe I can... I kind of want to get rid of this dumb thing, but... Maybe this can just go over here. We don't really have anything hiding over here. I'll just reset Daniel afterwards. And then I can make like a little a little strip here. There we go. Then maybe some lights. Hopefully we'll have enough. Oops. I guess it's technically a little bit Is that gonna let me still I don't think that'll let me still. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> I might need a bigger square.
Bum, 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 bum. There we go. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna have you get up anyway because you need to get the heck up. There you go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you for that idea because that's that's good. That's good for us. The spaghetti did. Oh, Herb was making sketty. Oh, did that accomplish his want for a pot tub? Also, where are you? I think Daddy Herbie is having a, a touch of Alzheimer's because he made spaghetti, put it out here on the sidewalk, and then went to sleep in his granddaughter's bed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know. I like maybe we'll leave these lights on because that's kind of nice to have. Okay. Well, you know what? Maybe the cat will eat that. Maybe the cat will like it. Maybe these should go over here. Poor little herbal. Poor little herbal. You know, that would be an interesting thing to decide is that, like, when certain elders, like, get up there, like, maybe, like, halfway through their age, you give them the absent-minded trait because of their age. You know what I mean? Like, that's kind of interesting. Or, like, any trait that might make them seem either forgetful or just kind of a little disoriented or something. That'd be kind of interesting to do as sort of a elder thing. Yeah, we got... I think... I. Oh, I didn't have her call the repair man because I didn't, uh, th th they were on the phone with the other, other lady. I just finished my work while I watched this stream. I gotta go to sleep now. It has been chaotic and such fun to hang out with you guys. Thank you for hanging out, Indigo. I'm glad you're able to get your stuff done. Have a good night. Have a good night. And have a, have a good day tomorrow. Yeah, we gotta fix this darn thing. I'm hearing giggling. Who's giggling about what? Oh, you're you maybe? Yeah. She's hungry. Come down here and find something to eat. Okay. You're waking up. Oh, she wants to do homework. You know what? Do your homework. I forgot about that. She wants an A+. Plus. Does Angela? Angela doesn't care. Maybe she won't do her homework. I don't know. I feel like Mary Sue would force them, though. Like, I feel like Mary Sue would be very on it. I think I have... Okay, that. Oh, yeah, the study with the little computer in there. It's true. It does have that the right vibe to it, and it's got, they got like a little TV here. You know what they need is like a little game system. Can I afford that right now? Oh wait, I had it open. Yeah, they need this here. That'd be fun. I also forgot about these. Danny boy needs to put these on. Yeah, like the whole the whole setup and like this this whole set here too. Yeah, the beige and the yeah I, I get that yeah. It's a cool house. It's very well done. I really like the way that's been um, set up. I like these. Oh, <laughs> Lilith went out and got herself some some floor sketty. Lilith, gra Lilith just grabbed some sketty from this. <laughs> Luckily, it wasn't it wasn't bad yet. So, okay. So Danny boy has a day off, which seems dangerous to leave him alone. He doesn't have to work, and uh, uh, Mary Sue does. Took me a couple times to say the right name. Um, she still wants to buy sculptures and all that crap. How are you doing, ma'am? Have you real? You seem pretty happy. You seem like you're doing pretty good. Um, I'm gonna have you call service repair person. She didn't want Grandpa Herbie to feel bad. Mm, poor Skitty. Poor Skitty. 
Did I? Oh, a pear man. Why are there books in the bathroom? Okay, so she's gonna go to work today. The kids are going to school. I feel like Angela will probably do her homework. Oh, they didn't finish their homework. You gotta finish it, girlies. Quick. Quick. Did you stop playing? Go do your homework. Go do your homework. Oh, what was that sound? Was that you? Oh, it was her playing. <laughs> Mary Sue. Go to go to work, Mary Sue. <laughs> go to work, Mary Sue. I didn't ask for this. Okay, they're trying to get their homework done. The girlie's gotta get it done. There they go. They're both look at that, just in time. Saved by the bell. Not 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 quite, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Mary Sue's only real chance to control a perfect family. <laughs> the era where Mary Sue suddenly becomes an addicted simmer. <laughs> Plays the Sims 4 so she can have a perfectly controlled family. <laughs> okay, she's at work. It doesn't really show her at work, which is where there you go. Oh uh, <laughs> Coral. This is an outfit. Look at this look. Look at that look. That's a that's a look right there. That's fashion. That's fashion. <laughs> she can play Sims 3 on a computer. Go. Do I have to have her go buy it at the thing? At the stand? Look at them slides. Look at the slides. And she got some trunks on. An old jersey. Look at her eyelashes. <laughs> Look at her eyelashes. <laughs> Coral said comfort. Coral said comfort. Oh, she wants to be friends with B Clone Bella. We're gonna have you go sew something. Oh, Herbie's healthy. That's good. Resume quilt. I need you to keep making this darn quilt. Okay, so should we go on an adventure with Danny Boy? Yeah, she's cool. I like Miss Coral. I like being able to have something more for her to do here. That's that's one thing I guess that's nice about having them. This house is like they have. She's got more going on. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> have we murdered anybody yet? No, unfortunately not. We haven't even really had a crazy drama. We kind of need more, a little bit more chaos. She's so in love with Herbie. Um, he's sleeping. I kind of want Herbie to meet up with Bella at a lot somewhere. Did he turn on- oh, he turned on the music. He's eating. Did he end up befriending Bella? No, he didn't even befriend her, which is weird. They have high- they have 87 over 26, but they didn't earn friendship. <laughs> yeah, I know. Twin girls. Rum. Red rum. Red rum. Exactly. Maybe that's it. Maybe the twins will become murderers. <laughs> okay, somebody has got to answer this phone. Oh, we got our, our, our mans here. Darcy Rollins. Come play with us, Danny. <laughs> Come play with us, Danny. Uh, oh, it's little Dirk calling for Lilith. Dirk, why aren't you at school, buddy? I wish Lilith was here to talk to you, but no, I'm sorry. Oh, Laura Sue is still here, ma'am. See you later. Yeah, bye. Bye, Laura. Uh, look at how cool. Okay, look at Laura's cool outfit, though. Okay, see? Okay, Laura. Um, ooh, also Bella said yes to our date. Oh. Where are we gonna take her? Maybe Strange Town? To the saloon? Let's try the saloon. 
Maybe that's the safe place to go. Come play with us, Danny. Okay, she, Coral finished the quilt. He's like, are you going to run over that, buddy? I think he's just going to despawn. Oh, he ran right over it. <laughs> he ran right through it. Her also, Herb just got in his, in his PJs. Oh, no. <laughs> I just realized he drove off in his PJs. He's going to be on a date in his PJs. I love Herb's new era of I don't give a crap. You're going to you're going to you, I'm going to show up the way I show up. <laughs> I got to show up the way I show up. If you don't like my PJs, then you can go buy me a nice suit. <laughs> That's what Herb said. Now that you uh, mentioned really adding trace rollers, it got me thinking about adding a sixth trait once. Yeah, that, that'd that be cool. And like, I don't know if you'd decide like if it could only be certain kind of traits. Or I guess, it, I don't know. I don't know. Thank you for the follow. Soupy Shan. <laughs> Super Shan. Bang, bang, bang. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Look at Bella shows up in oh <laughs> our boy. Our our baby. Little emo Vidkin Curious is here. <laughs> Goth e e Vidkin Curious. Look at this queen. Look at this queen. Hi, Soupy Shan. How are you? You have arrived. <laughs> To show growth in their personality. Yes, that's true. I mean, you could even do that like midway through their adulthood, even if you wanted to, or toward the end of their adulthood, you know? Like you said, to show growth in their personality, they're not the same th sim as they were at 18. Yeah. I think that's cool. What is she? What is the po? What is her walk? Oh. She thinks he's hot. Okay. Okay. Um, well, we could do a little smooth talk. Him in, I just, him in his pajamas and her in her full gown. <laughs> Standing in the road at Strange Town Saloon. At the, the local saloon at Strange Town. She loves his PJs, I guess so. What? Let's ask her what turns her on. Turns you on. Beard. Okay, beards. Interesting. Beard? Okay, if I ask her again, will she tell me the other one? Just beard. Okay. Just beard. Okay, so Herbie's gonna put on a fake beard real quick. I do kind of want him to go out. I, I want to keep this vacation island. Maybe next Maybe next round they, he can go on a vacation. Maybe there'll be a big family vacation. That'd be fun. Have a pillow fight. Be tickled. She's playful. Uh, pillow. Oh, I just hit kicky bag, didn't I? Yeah. We'll fight. <laughs> She's about to put aside the razor. Yeah, he says, all right. The once in my life, I will grow a, a beard. Oh, hello, folks? Earth to, Earth to the Sims. <laughs> Tell a dirty joke. Do you think she likes dirty jokes? Probably not. Play cards. We'll lock in the eat out. Maybe they'll go... Well, actually, they can't eat out on this lot, so why don't I just forget about that for right now? Wow, that took care of three wants of his. Dang, he wants to dance. Let's go inside. Let's get him inside. Okay, we'll come turn this on and dance in front of this. <laughs> this random lady swooning over Herbie and his... <laughs> this old man in his, in his PJs. I want to give him different PJs. Maybe he needs more goofy PJs. <laughs> um, yeah, I like the traits so far. I think they're fun. Take some time to comb through and download it all, but it adds a lot to the game, yeah. Okay, did the music not turn on? Oh, I guess... I guess it did. It's just taking a minute. Where's the dance? There was Dance Together. I don't know if Dance Together works. Okay, it's starting. There we go. That's That counts. I didn't know if I had to do, like, classic dance. Herbie with a porn stash! <gasps> you're right. You're, very, you're so right. 
he's gonna grow it right now with his mystical powers. Okay, I like this girly. Cassandra Howard, she seems cool. She seems cool. She's into Bella. Well, anyway. I actually came here on my own time and remembered to move this stupid dart board that was just like floating over here for the longest time. Who's over here? Who's there? We got little V, Hunter, Cooper, and Junie. Okay. Oh, look at these folks dancing. Everybody's dancing. Okay, we can stop dancing for a minute. Not her immediately turning around and goofing at them. Like, okay. All right, here, here it comes. Get, hold on to your seat belts. <laughs> get your get your seat belts locked in. We're we're about to see porn stash Herbie. What's what's the best one? Oh my god, that's a fake mustache. Ooh, wait, the one with the little curl at the end. <laughs> Oh god, not the disc- the tape down. Do you think he glued those on? Oh god, that's probably what his beard actually looks like if he grows it. That's probably what it really looks like. But this is also fun. A little bit of that, a little bit of this. Biker Herbie. I kind of like the little, the little swoop. Is there a different- there's this one. I feel like I'm missing one. Oh, this one. I think this is the one Mortimer has. Is that a coffee Mortimer? Herbie in this is that a disguise? You you might be right, Bobby. <laughs> I feel like <laughs> this one looks fake, and I love that. I think that's I think he's gonna try and impress Bella with his fake mustache. He's like Bella, I have grown a mustache for you. My love for you is so strong. I grew a mustache in the last five seconds. Come here, kiss me, kiss me. She, oh, he wants to slow dance with her. Uh, slow dance. I'll just do a quick slow dance. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Alright. <laughs> I just can't get over his stupid pajamas. <laughs> Alright. Is, uh, is Miss Crumblebottom coming at us? No, I guess not. He turned around, pulled out his pocket, and taped it into his upper lip. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Like, this little one is ten times too beautiful for you, Herbie. How dare you? How dare you? Make out. She'll definitely suck her face. See, what's fun about this is we have a secret basement down here. There's just some lady watching TV down here. Okay. Um, so there are some options for these two. When it comes to that. You have a back rub. He is really punching above his weight here. <laughs> and he's he's also playing with fire because Mortimer, like the mad scientist, like messing with Mortimer. You know? We still haven't really figured out how Mortimer feels. Because the thing that was weird a little bit, though, is... So Mortimer caught Daniel fooling around with Bella. So like, but then just a little while ago, Be Daniel... uh. Mortimer was hanging out at Daniel's house for friggin' ever, so like, what was that about? Maybe that was suspicious. Maybe Mortimer's trying to get on Daniel's good side so that he can then pull something, like he's trying to do something. He's gonna he's gonna slip poison in Daniel's drink or something. Trying to befriend Daniel. Yeah, Mortimer might become our serial killer it, to protect his beloved Bella. Um, what am I doing? I'm like, <laughs> I'm all over the place. Back rub, flirt... What's it? A suggestion? Oh, he wants to woohoo in bed. Oh boy, she wants to woohoo with three different sims. So, um, so d shall we? Now, what if? Imagine, imagine a world. Uh, speaking hypothetically here, imagine a world where I were to instruct these two to lay on the bed and try for baby. Imagine if that were to actually happen in this. Like that'd be kind of crazy. Imagine. <laughs> Wasn't Marty going to feed Dina to the cow plant stranger? Yes, he did. He did. <laughs> oh, I like those two emotes together. Come on in. The water's fine. Oh, the lady's not watching TV anymore. That's good. Oh, him watching television from the bed, sir? 
uh, sir, you are literally an iPad kid. He's an iPad kid. Now, actually, are they able to do it? I don't know if they're actually able to do it. I, I mean, they're oh, they're not in love. Oh, oh, oh my! Why she got no legs? Her legs just like stop at the bottom of the dress. <laughs> okay, I cannot unsee. I cannot unsee. Do you roll or anything? See if bug is I. I don't. I don't really. I, I'm terrible about remembering to do it, so I don't. I don't ever bother. <laughs> Most of the time, I like it when I can find a way for the game to do it for me. Oops. Like if I make her select a. Oh, oh, I don't know. I just hit. Like maybe that'll help. I don't know. I actually don't know if they'll. I think they'll. Yeah. Unfortunately, I think they actually cannot do it yet. They can kiss. Oh, yeah, I guess they can woohoo. Why don't we just do a risky woohoo? Um, yeah, I think it's supposed to make selectable. Risky woohoo makes selectable. Oh, get in a moment. Get in a moment. Yeah, I don't know. I do have, like, when it comes to the memory of offing Sims, I don't know if you'd be able to, like, use another memory in place of that. I don't know what you would use to, like, represent that you've killed a sim, you know? Um, and then add it through custom means. Also, welcome back, Dreamy. Sorry, I didn't see your message. <laughs> welcome back. We got a lot going on here. I don't hear a baby well. I might have to try a few more times. Yeah, custom memories time. These two. Now Mortimer. Now Mortimer. <laughs> Herbie is in his full form. He's He's got his undies out. Um, oops, I got her selected. I'm trying to kiss her, and she's... Okay. Oh my god, I'm just trying to cl click him. There we go. I'll just keep her selectable for now. We'll just, we'll just go at it. We'll see if we can get these two to fall in love down here. Oh! <laughs> this mosaic coming through. I think somebody's showering. Oh my, who are you? Who is that? Oh, that's Cassandra Howard. Oh. Cassandra broke in. Unless they want hug Bella. It's not even a a, a a dream date yet. He wants a she wants a back rub. Or she wants to give one, but I guess we can give one. Be flirted with by her. Maybe we'll just Um I want a serenade. <laughs> I know, poor Coral. Coral doesn't know. Coral is is, is innocent. I might do some digging. Sorry for being weirdly morbid today. Oh, you're fine. I'm just I was the same earlier. I was like, hmm. I need I need murder mods, thanks. I just like that option. You know what I mean? Oh god, he wants to woohoo again. We can do that. I'm I'm gonna try and get him to fall in love so that we can guarantee a possible baby. <gasps> oh she rejected our caress? Uh, I don't know what it is about the caress that people the Sims just freak out about. Hello, police. This red one broke into my house and started showering? <laughs> well, the reality is, is they are in the basement of the saloon. <laughs> so, uh... I, you know. C Coral either willfully ignores it or just... I feel like, you know, maybe... Coral and Mary Sue are similar in that they... They, like... They don't want to accept it, kind of thing, because they want to save face or keep things the way they wish they would be. Kind of, they don't. I don't know. They don't want to like come to terms with it or something. A few questions. Okay. <laughs> my eyes are getting dry. Oh my goodness. Now, now my eyes are blurry. Why is there a bed in the salon? Wait, salon. <laughs> uh. So yeah, this this lot was designed after one of the one of the console games, Strange Town, version like the console version of Strange Town. And um, I'm just gonna clean my glasses. And like, I guess it was designed for somebody to live there and run it. So they had like a bed downstairs and stuff. But I edited it to be a little bit better with like the ladder because it was set up a little different and it was kind of weird. Um, 
So yeah, and I th- thought it was just kind of a fun, trashy saloon feature, you know. I cannot see at, at all what chat's saying right now. If I squint real hard, I can't. I still can't. I gotta finish. But that's the technical reason. <laughs> that's the technical reason. Drinkers get stinky. True. True. Okay. These two. I love Herbie's new stash. Oh, he wants to buy love potion? Just have him make out some more. Maybe do a smooth talk. I'm just trying to get him to fall in love. She's kind of hard to get to fall in love. <laughs> yeah, tell your secrets while Sammy can't see. <laughs> I love how many spin-offs game Strange Town has. Sims team really uh, showed what their favorite town was with that. Yeah. That's true. That's really... That is true. It's kind of neat. And it's funny how I feel like so much of the Sims fan base is very Pleasant View coded. Like, they really like the Pleasant View Sims. I mean, Strange Town is like the second favorite. And then it's like Pleasant View and Strange Town. And then somewhere down below is Veronaville, you know? But... Yeah. Um, okay, she wants to woohoo again, too. Um, but I'm not... Oh, I also turned the volume down because of the... I guess they could try and woohoo again. I kind of want them to do a try for baby. Yeah, I guess maybe because of Pleasant Sims. Maybe that's the influence that, that pushed it there. I guess I can just keep keep grinding their relationship a little bit. Um, I just like Vernable until I played it with more of a Shakespearean twist in mind, plus a Triku family to mix as, uh, as a neutral family. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, and I think she played a lot of Pleasant View anyway. Vernable sweep. Yeah, I've been... Vernable grew on me a lot. That's why I was thinking about having another series be Vernable. Uh, Bella not a cove for now. Okay. Yeah, I've heard. I've I haven't actually played the drive-by embarrassment. I did. There's somebody walked by. <laughs> They're like, "Ooh, God, it's taken us a long time to fall in love." I'm just gonna spam it. I don't care. I think make out is like one of the highest level, and then this. We're just gonna be gone all day. I just really want him to like try for baby. I don't think it's going to happen, though. I think I am going to have them try it. After they're done here, I'm going to have them casual. Woohoo. Time's running out. Yeah. In bed. <laughs> Breathing heavily. Takudio, my, my OTP. Breathing heavily. <laughs> Takuchio, not Takudio. Takudio? <laughs> yeah. Mega storylines in the, the caps are always fun to me. Yeah, I, I, that's where I'm like leaning really heavily towards my, my, uh, new Let's Play series being the Veronaville one. I also really like Berry Berry. <laughs> Berry Berry is really cool. So, all right, they're fooling around again. <laughs> you drew him so much. You <laughs> Daikudio is a good, oh, I see. Daikudio is a good pairing. Yeah, they're fun. I have, I've only done it once, because I've only really played Veronaville once. So, maybe that's why I kind of want to start start fresh. Okay. Oh, they didn't, like... Oh, God. You tried! <laughs> you tried to... You tried to make it. <laughs> oh, okay. No, don't go! Don't go, Queen Bella! Actually, I've got her selectable, so she cannot leave. She cannot leave. Here, let's relax. Maybe they're besties now. Rain decided to hyperfocus on Taikushio and Loki Cersei. My art very much reflects that. Yeah, oh, that's all right. Yeah, you got me once earlier. Oh, here we go. Um. Well, I guess we'll just do a casual woohoo because we still can't try for baby. That's okay. Okay. Ooh, he wants more public woohoo. 
Okay, we gotta get him to go home. I don't think we had any baby happen that time. I'll make her unselectable. Unfortunate. Let's go home. He really has a type. <laughs> Loving how this guy has two things with two different Bellas, yeah. He's got a real Bella thing. Not Bella just walking up in her undies. The one time that he's he's fully dressed and she's in his undies. She's in his undies? She's in her undies. <laughs> oh, she teleported out here. What the hell? Ma'am? Bella? <laughs> she's really into this guy? Interesting. All right, we're going to go home. No, baby. These two need jobs. <laughs> I've had two sims get risky woohoo pregnant recently. Mine's only set at 15%. I don't- I think mine might be 15 also. She's in his undies? <laughs> well, you know. Maybe those are his. You never know. Yes, the Night Owl Saloon from PSP. Didn't know it had a basement. Yeah, I don't know if it, like, is supposed to in the game. Or if it's just something somebody made for the sake of it working here. I don't know. I wonder who was the first person to realize that they could, like, make a basement in The Sims 2. Are there any, like, Maxis builds with basements? Okay. So we got ten hours away, Mr. Herbal Oldie. What if- here's a concept. What if Herbie only wears his mustache when he's out on a date so nobody can recognize him? Because <laughs> he thinks that's how it'll work. Okay, I kind of want you to... How about you make many... I don't know. Make a, another teddy bear. Oh, she made this thing. I kind of wanted her to sell it for money, but it's really neat. I kind of want her to put it up somewhere. I'm going to delete this one. There we go. House of Fallen Trees. Oh, there's a basement in the Pleasant View downtown. In Pleasant View downtown with a cough in it. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. Also, the that's true. Straight the Beaker's house. Oh, yes, you're right. Also, the 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 um. That's right. The yeah, I know what one you're talking about. The I have a I had AJ living in it. Um. Yeah, it's that, that weird shaped one that's like always annoying to try and live in. Like in, in this hood, I have uh, Glarn Curious living there. Yeah. Now Danny Boy's also here alone. He wants to befriend Clone Bella. Maybe maybe while, while Herb is away dating <laughs> real Bella... <laughs> He'll call up Clone Bella. Because <laughs> I can tell that this is Clone Bella in the picture. Maybe I'll lock in date. I don't know if she'll come over, though. Oh, he's, she's right there. He's got two bolts with her. Because he's already in love with the other one. <laughs> this household in their Bellas. He's, oh, count me out, really out. Oof. Ouch. Let's try again, buddy. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. Okay. He, we can't call. I'd love to call her over, but she's technically busy. Oh, Zelda May called him earlier. Um, Zelda's at work, working. The spaced out period. Space, space, space. Let's see who else we can call. Um, oh, Gundren might come over. I'm here with Gundren. I know, the romance of is going feral. My psychic advisor! <laughs> this is- look at his- he's got- count me out, really out. Zelda is at work, working. My psychic advisor has forbidden me from leaving the house today. I'm afraid I must comply. Nobody wants Danny Boy. Nobody wants Danny Boy. Maybe Bjorn- do you think Bjorn wants Danny Boy? See, now his lifetime wish has to do with lovers. Not just woohoo. And he's not in love with Bjorn. Maybe he needs to work on that. Oh, butt spot. Nut spot? 
Do they have harvest nut from growable cow nut? Let's call our boy Bjorn. He might be working. Bjorn might be at work right now. Oh. Maybe not. Imagine if the the one time that Mary Sue finally catches him is when he's with a man. That'd be kind of wild. Oh, Coral already finished. I wish I could just have, like, mess around, like, not just have to make stuff, you know? Mm, I don't know, make another quilt. It's kind of, we don't, it's just that it's taken a lot of money. I guess we got some cash back. Um, maybe I'll have her, st oh, I didn't mean to do that. Maybe I'll have her, like, study. Study cooking. Just get better at cooking, I guess. Do some stuff. Do some stuff and things. We're waiting for our buddy to come over. Oh, he is here. He is here. Who's <laughs> me screenshot that bunch shot? You think so? I can I can do it. Save directly. I know you weren't straight, you know. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh not say goodbye, greet Bjorn. Your one true love. Yes, put the hot dogs on the floor. Thank you. I'm hearing something outside. Oh. <laughs> okay, the intimacy? Okay. Got some intimacy happening? Okay. <laughs> I can imagine real life Daniel just sitting on his house phone, flipping through pages of phone book <laughs> with all these women. Yeah. He's just like, hmm, how about this one? How about this one? Okay. How's about ask on date? Uh oh, the kitty's hungry. I need to get one of those other pet feeders that last longer. I always, I just, I always need to end up getting those. They're a little more expensive. I don't know what color. A clean, clean color. Mary Sue wants it bright and clean. Oh, don't fall down the stairs, buddy. Bjorn came over just in time. The hot dogs are hot, steamy, and ready for consumption. Um, grab a plate. Kind of bad timing, though, because our, our date's gonna be wasted while you're eating a dog, you know? What does he want to do? He does want to dine out, which I don't think we're gonna do. He wants to dance. We could dance. Um, I guess he's gotta be... Okay, you ate some dog. Get up. That's enough. That's enough for you. Oh, that's true. I should have called him over. Yeah. That's okay. We'll just... Here, we'll call him over here. Get him to dance with us. Alright, Mr. Beyond. Oh, we got Herbie's pension check at the very least. Oh, there it was. Come dance with me. Are you not- you're not gonna- what- what are we doing? There we go. I didn't count? Oh, counted. Okay. Oh, Lilith is doing extremely well in school. Oh, Lilith is doing good. She got a- she got an A+. Plus. Oh my gosh. Angela, what is wrong with you? Sells the time foreplay. <laughs> I'll, I'll allow it. <laughs> it didn't like the word foreplay. Oop, autonomous Danny boy. Also, wait, I don't know if I, I used all of Danny's points. Oh, I gotta use Danny boy's points. What should he? I usually do like secondary fortune or popularity. Maybe popularity. 
What's a good secondary for Danny? Like fortune or popularity? <laughs> no foreplay in this Christian, only foreplay. <laughs> yes, of course. Salsa time four nut. Salsa time four nut. Maybe popularity. <laughs> or four nut, apparently. <laughs> I think I'm going to do, I think before I've done fortune, but I think I'll do that. I'll just do that. That's fine. Anyway. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't mean to grab him. <laughs> I'm grabbing Bjorn. Now we can smooth talk. Do you think the girls are going to come in? Oh, God. This is weird. <laughs> Wait, I need a picture. <laughs> Miss Lollygag, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. This this picture says everything. <laughs> this picture says it all. He's handing a rose to his lover as his daughter is, is cheering about school. Oop, I need I need ceilings on. It's a must. He's taking screenshots. <laughs> Loki gonna have a stepdad nut. <laughs> and oh, imagine if... See, now, last time we were playing the Beakers, Gundren got mad about Loki's things. I don't remember exactly who it was. <gasps> Ooh, the love has happened. What if I uh, casually unlock a door and these two just kind of, you know... Also, I forgot about their hot tub. Okay, he wants five loves. That's what he really wants is loves. He loves loves. Daniel's priorities. Oh, they just went naked. Oh, hi. <laughs> Darcy is unfazed. Darcy's seen it all. Darcy has seen it all. What is happening? Got cold feet? What? You guys already did it once. Oops, not will I. Woohoo. Also, you can probably talk me into that? Okay. Yeah, I don't think Lilith... Maybe Lilith doesn't understand what she was seeing. <laughs> She's like, oh, Daddy's just being nice to, f to Mr. Loki. No, Mr. Loki. Mr. Bjorn. <laughs> yeah, let's save. Oh, I can hear Angela snoring. Maybe we need them to have some friends come over. They need, like, Dirk and Dustin to come over and hang out. We can also do her homework. She wants creativity skill. I guess she could she could practice. Is that oh <laughs> oh poor girly <laughs> poor little Angela little mermaid girl. <laughs> All right, are they? Oh no, they're woohooing in the other bedroom. No, not this Danny boy. Not this, Danny boy. Not you getting naked on your, your father-in-law's and your mother-in-law's bed. <laughs> Where's Coral? Coral's just reading it. Oh, God, Coral's here. She's reading in the other room. She's like, hey, I uh, I got a... He's like, I got a kitten. <laughs> he's talking about his pets. You think he's... Is he calling Loki his kitten? Oh, God. <laughs> is he like that guy from that machinima? <laughs> Okay, this girlie is struggling. Wake up, sleep. I know, the freshly pressed blankets. <laughs> Oof. I don't know, did Lilith didn't like recognize... Oh, they received a bad memory from being rejected from private school. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you won't defile his marriage bed, but his in-laws are free game. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> well, all right then. Imagine if there's bells, if there's baby bells, I would cry. Because <laughs> I have the same sex bear. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have the same sex pregnancy in. Well, it happened. They did their thing. 
I might have him just end date to stay safe. Because we did our thing. We did our stuff. We had a good time. It's all right. I feel like up next is Clone Bella and this Laura Sue chicky. Oh, dang. They didn't deserve the Headmaster Sally. Well, <laughs> yeah, the Headmaster kind of got forgotten. Mary Sue was having a breakdown. Look at these boys being guys. Look at these guys being dudes. Mary, Mary Sue was having a meltdown that day. <laughs> she was having a bad... Menti B, you know, and she kind of never greeted him at the door, and he left and said, "Y'all are our failures. I'm never inviting you to our head, our establishment." So that happened. Oh, Mary Sue just got home. Oh, she got promotion. She got earn intern level two. Okay, so she isn't even at level at beyond level two yet. So level two is like when she gets fired traditionally in the game. Also, what? somebody left their homework out here. I don't know why they're not putting them on the desk. <laughs> I read this as Headmaster Salad. <laughs> she's having a blast. Look how she's having a blast with this. I love little, little, little. Oh God, I can't say that. Little Lilith's outfit. Okay. <laughs> playing playing around in the bedroom, y'all. Y'all are weird. Y'all are weirdos. She's she's having fun though. She's having a good time. She's having a good time. She still wants a sculpture. Go fishing? Maybe Grandma can serve dinner. Grandma's come for soup. Bon appetit, Koya. Cor Koya. <laughs> Coral. <laughs> okay. Ma'am, you can stop doing that. These two these two little boys giggling away. Okay, guys. Coral and Mary Sue, co-presidents of the Head in, in the Sand Club. You're correct. That's really true. <laughs> Say I love Lilith's little clothes five times fast. Uh, my husband told me he liked the name Lilith recently, and I went into the pleasant household lore about Angela, Angel, Angel, Lilith, Demon, and the entire family dynamic. Yeah, that's funny. That's that's cool though <laughs> that you're able to go into that. She's just dancing away. This household probably could use a butler, too. I don't know if I actually want to. I don't think they have quite enough money yet. I'm back for my nap. Welcome back, Dante. Hope you had a good nap. <laughs> good awakening. <laughs> Your husband just... <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh my god, it's almost six hours. I'm supposed to roll ads. Let me roll an ad for right now. We're probably gonna... I don't know, we might... I might try to finish this last day. Oh no, but you're still dying. I'm sorry. Oh, she's gonna go potty. I need you to go to the bathroom, ma'am. I might come and eat. Oh, awkward that just like Loki's here. Loki's just casually here. Thank you for save save a game, a game, a game, a game, a game. I can't say words. Your game looks so tasty. <laughs> it's it's like you could just you could just eat it up. You could just eat it up. No, I think I think the 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 saturation boost for me is like a must. The the reshade cuz like this is no reshade and it just looks so dull to me because I'm so used to the reshade. Your game has the flavor of graham crackers. Okay. 
Okay, interesting. Oh, Coral's on the run. God, it just looks like I'm not looking. It looks, looks like I'm looking through a screen. Oh no, she she peed on the way. Coral. No, I want you to just go over to your own little housey over here. Your own little housey. Poor little Coral. Okay, who's... I unlocked one of the doors, I don't remember... Oops. There you go. To be honest, that's realistic. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. She did it in the privacy of the bathroom. Mm -hmm. All the adults just... I feel like Daniel just says, Oh, Mary Sue, this is Bjorn. This is Mr. Beaker. He's, uh... Why are you zooming in on it? I was just my brain was like over here. <laughs> my brain was just over here. <laughs> Trying to expose her. <laughs> my brain my brain said, look, look at what we're talking about. Um No, but the I feel like Mary's I feel like Daniel's like Yeah, I know. I don't know. I'm I'm torn about the LOP mod. <laughs> I do have the rainbow vomit mod. Oh, <laughs> Herb just comes walking in with his fake mustache and his uh, and his PJs. He's been in all day. His feet are covered in dirt. <laughs> his feet are covered in dirt from traversing Strange Town. Hello, everybody. Hello, family. <laughs> what are you doing? What? Oh, this? No, I grew it myself. <laughs> okay, buddy. But I feel like I feel like Daniel told Mary Sue that this is like a colleague of his that <laughs> reeks. <laughs> oh, he says yes. I hate ghosts. Ghosts are not real. Storms, however, Mother Nature, yes, she is very real. <laughs> Everybody's joining in on the convo. Are you not gonna eat? She's sleeping. I kind of wanted Lilith to come and eat real quick before she sleeps. She also needs to take a little shower. <laughs> Daniel and Bjorn, the gall of these two. Yeah, I know. They're kind of, they're kind of. Are they like, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they just woohooed. Daniel and Bjorn, they're in a, they're in a relationship, a situation ship. They woohooed in Coral and Herb's bed. The, I, you know, it's just a little, uh, well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> They're just a little, you know. <laughs> I was not here yet. You know, they're okay. No, I get it. Yeah, they they fooled around. The, the relationship actually started when we were playing Bjorn. Um, and then we kind of finalized it over here. Because Danny has wants to. His, his lifetime wish is 20 simultaneous lovers. So he wants... He, he so we we made sure they were in love fully which they weren't before what is the sound i'm hearing over here i guess it's just somebody eating lots of food oh god what is herb what what knowledge is herb imparting on the children she's talking about books do i want to know he says yes i liked books yes i looks just they're just dudes being bros i let him stay home that day. He was on his way to school in the morning when it happened. It got a bubble bath instead. Oh, your sim got struck by lightning on the way to the school bus, then run to the bathroom and pee himself in front of the toilet. Oh, no. He says, yes, one day you will grow up, grow old and die, children. Yes, yes. He says, oh, yeah, I hope, I hope I grow up one day. <laughs> I hope I do. And fall in love. <laughs> okay, Coral, are you okay? She's just like sitting in here. She wants to sell a masterpiece. Why aren't you sleeping, Coral? <laughs> she the way she just turned. 
Sounds like it's time for Harvey's bedtime. Yeah, I think so. Actually, he's not very tired, but... I, I kind of enjoy Mr. Mustache Herb. Mr. Mustache Herb. Oh, you had a sim die of a lightning strike once. Okay. Um, Dusty up. I'm gonna... I'm gonna look and see what other PJ options we have, because I swear I have some different... I think I have ones that have woohoo prints on them. They have, like, little woohoo hearts on them, and I think he needs that. If he's gonna be living in his PJs and undies. Here we go. Oh, woohoo prints? No. There we go. See, these are all little woohoos. <laughs> we have that one. Then there's this one, which has got the romance sim symbol on the top. He could also just have a robe. I don't know what his sign is. I don't know what Mr. Herbal's sign is. Oh, this is also pretty good, too. Silk robe, but I think that's too high class for Herbal. I think he needs... Yeah, I think we're going to go with Woohoo Hearts. So we do just full Woohoo Hearts? Let me see what that looks like. Oh, oh, okay. He's giving us a show. I think that's it. I think that's it. <laughs> I think that's it. Herb Hefner. <laughs> Herbie Hefner. <laughs> That's so funny. He shall one day own the greatest brothel in all of Pleasant View and Strange Town combined. He wants to freestyle for tips. <laughs> Not this. <laughs> you know it's true. Coral's trying to sleep. Well, meanwhile, this this weirdo is in here doing this. Okay, she's sleeping. Oh, she's filthy. Oh, she's just thinking about how much she hated the 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 love tub. She thinks it's horrific. She thinks it's ugly. Okay. Um, I think you need to come up here. Oh my god. Okay, somehow she's... I'm gonna tweak her energy just because her energy is just all over the place lately. Oh my god, this little little beast. Uh-oh, they're gonna fight now. Okay, well now you gotta wait. Just wait here. I know. You gotta wait for your sister to be done. Or, yeah, you could use that one. That works too. Uh, so you know that there's a user been sending messages to one, um, those are, who are yours? Yes, yeah, we have an ongoing issue with it. Um, at least I said Amir was weird AF, yeah. Yeah, definitely block and report. It's a, it's an ongoing issue. It's somebody who's really salty about being banned. Um, okay, she's using the bathroom. The, they just kind of come up with all kinds of bullshit that... To, I don't know. I don't. I don't think. I don't. <laughs> it's a very long story. <laughs> a new hand touches the beacon. <laughs> they can eat my ass. <laughs> Did I just see somebody walk out here? I guess not. They kind of come into my R two, but the best one can do is block and move on. Yeah. They're, they just, I don't know. Yeah, they're just not worth even talking about. That's my home for someone new who gets roped into this mess. <laughs> okay, you're just staying up watching stuff. You want to, like, sleep, buddy? Mary Sue, I'm going to have you get up and, like, take a goddamn shower. Didn't the repair person come? Or this one must have broke after the fact. <laughs> oh, joke. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know if maybe I was misreading it. <laughs> I'd like to report it. Yeah, definitely. That's that's the best thing to do. <laughs> Social bunny wallpaper watching while they sleep. Yes. Of course. Oh, she's out here playing. How about you sleep? How about you sleep? Just kind of juggling some needs here. This poor cat is ignored. We shouldn't have gotten a cat because it's just too chaotic in this household. Okay. 
She, what are her need? Okay, she doesn't even need any more skills for her, her new job. Okay. Well, I'm gonna still have her just like play logic, play logic, play chess. The cat's name is Petunia. Hello, Petunia. Could you look into the eyes of the wallpaper social bunny? Could you look into the eyes of the wallpaper social bunny? I suppose. They are quite beady and strange. <laughs> is that what you wanted? <laughs> okay, I see. I see what you were doing there. <laughs> dun dun. <laughs> the other day I left my Sims for like 20 minutes without intervention and one was fine and the other almost died because I, it was snowing and he got stuck in the it's snowing action. Oh no. <laughs> you find him staring back at your stole. <laughs> You stare into the void long enough and it stares back. Okay. Hi, Herbie Derby. What are you trying to do to my cat, Herb? He wants to influence someone to surf. He wants to play computer games. Come on up here and play your, your second life. He's got to check in on his second life family. He, runs a, he probably runs like a, a brothel in second life, you know? <laughs> Dead-eyed Movo. <laughs> I volunteer at a cat shelter, and honestly, kittens are able to live with a lot of chaos. It's primarily older cats that have uh, more of a manual. True. I guess I could see that. I don't know how long till our cat ages up, though. At uh, one day. Okay, so he's gonna be grown soon. He's gonna be grown soon. I mean, he seems pretty happy. The The maid's been cleaning his little litter box and stuff. Now he's got his nice auto feeder that lasts longer. He's just kind of doing his thing. I gotta drive. I'll see y'all next stream. Okay, thank you for hanging out, Dreamy. Have a good, have a safe drive and good night. Have a good one. Um, let me do this. It's weird having a maid that isn't absolutely unhinged. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. He's just kind of chill. He's just kind of chill. This is our last day with this family. What an, it reminds me of my teachers once told me that turkeys will literally drown from rain because they stare at it. Yes, turkeys are very not the smartest of of creatures. <laughs> we used to we used to sell turkeys at the store where I worked during the springtime. We'd have like all kinds of all kinds of poultry for sale, and baby turkeys were one of them. And yeah, they are just, they're very strange creatures. <laughs> they're very bizarre little creatures. They are not, they're, the, the term we used to use for them is allergic to life. They were just allergic to life, allergic to everything. <laughs> you know, not, uh, you know, <laughs> everything s killed them. <laughs> because they were just so, they're just not. Okay, ma'am, you gotta get up. You're gonna have to go to work too, right? No, he's off today. Okay. Let's get another day off. Another day with Danny Boy. Where's Herbal? Oh, he's up here. He's still playing Second Life. Okay. Okay. What is, wait, what's the what would be the Sims equivalent of Second Life though? Instead of Second Life, maybe it's like Second or I don't know. <laughs> I have wild turkeys who walk around my area, and there is one who is a, there is one that is a narcissist. They just keep staring at the reflection that they could see in, in this tombstone. Oh, <laughs> oh, third life. <laughs> That's true. Lifeception. <laughs> um, but that's kind of creepy that they can see their reflection in a tombstone. Yeah, I think that's common. They probably, you know, he was probably challenging the other turkey. It was probably that he was. I, I, I don't know if it, if it was a tom turkey. Second plum bob is good. Um, but if it was a tom turkey, he was probably challenge. He was so dumb he thought it was another turkey challenging him. But I don't know. Depends on the turkey. <laughs> oh, the baby grew up in front of the litter box. Oh, he's like a little skinny guy. Oh, he looks like some kind of wild cat. He's a little skinny guy. Look at him. 
Okay, or her. I think it's a her. Turkeys are goofy. Oh, I did not know. Tell <laughs> I think I think ladies are just called hens, like chickens. I think I might be wrong though. Yeah, it's, I think it's toms and hens. <laughs> yeah, Petunia's a lovely lady. Drew, that's kind of have angry eyebrows. Yeah, because then and then, what is it? I it was ducks. Males are called drakes. I forget what the females are called. Um, yeah, and then of course it's a rooster and hen. Stuff like that. Snoodles. <laughs> yeah, the peacocks and the peahens, because technically, technically their type is pea fowl. They call they'll call them pea fowl, and then there's a peacock or a peahen. Drakes and snoodles. Are they actually called snoodles, or are you just <laughs> goofing on something? I, I've never heard snoodle. Um, Coral? I don't think Coral's available. I think Coral looks like she needs help. <laughs> I think you're being a troll, Komi. <laughs> Guess we'll never know. <laughs> I think Komi's being a troll. And then, isn't it? I think it's donkeys. Donkeys are called Jacks and Jills. I'm pretty sure. Jacks and Jennies? Maybe Jacks and Jennies or Jacks and Jills. It depends. Um, they're also called hens according to Google. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. My friend had a, a peacock and a harem of peahens. The peacock would wander off their property and up and down the road by their house all the time. Oh. Yeah, we I've had people we had a we had a peacock show up once years ago and they make they make awful sounds so it's like very startling to hear this creature just like making really intense sounds outside all of a sudden um okay you're doing your thing i don't know what we're gonna do today with these guys um maybe we'll have somebody come over who else could come over maybe he can try and just talk to See, I notice he's not actually friends with this Bella. Lightning striking. Oh boy. Yes, worst noise. He'd shriek and go roost in a tree. Oh no. Herb's fursona would totally be a peacock. <laughs> You're right. What's Daniel's fursona? Bird sona? That's true. Feather sona? <laughs> what would Daniel's be? Daniels is a wolf because he's not creative. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's mean. <laughs> Foul Sona? Fox? Yeah, the red fox. I need you to just stop playing the goddamn... Let's call a sim. Let's try and gain some relationship with somebody. You're in love with her. You need to talk to Bella. Just, just, just talk. We'll, we'll just try and befriend her. That's where we gotta start. This is take my corgi to doggy care. At a, uh, a place that had a bunch of animals, and there was an old crotchety turkey who would come over and vibrate with anger and run after the car and shit. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I like the vibrate with anger. Because <laughs> I, can, I can see that. Um, oh. Oh, we're gonna get a promotion thanks to Bella. Okay. Alright. I think Herbie needs to take it easy today. You know, he's an old guy. He's gotta he's gotta pace himself. What's Coral up to? Her social's really bad. Oh. Here, how about she plays with the kitty? That should help social. Come here, kitty cat. Angela got money from drum lessons. Um, there was some retirement home a while back that had throngs of turkeys terrorizing. <laughs> Ooh, sorry, I keep yawning. I'm like, ugh. <laughs> That's funny. There's folks that used to come in and buy 
giant bags of corn because they were feeding wild turkeys, which you're not really supposed to do, but they just have, they have tons of turkeys that would show up. Neighbors, my parents' neighborhood gets those turkey buzzard things. Oh, and they jump on people's roofs. Yeah, the, I mean, like, like turkey vultures or, because we have turkey vultures around here. It's always creepy because, like, the, what'll happen is, like, you'll hear the coyotes singing really loudly at night, like, and being really excited, which means that, like, they, they've got a kill. Like, usually it means that they've got, like, a kill and they're all excited and they're all yipping and sounding like a bunch of hyenas. And then the next morning, you'll just see, like, turkey vultures everywhere with full bellies. <laughs> and it's like, oh, oh, <laughs> okay. Somebody had a bad night, and a lot of people had a really good night. <laughs> a lot of critters had a really good night, and somebody had a really bad night. <laughs> yeah, I remember doing that. When I was walking Olive one day, one morning, because I take Olive for a walk every morning, and they'll sit in these, like, dead pine trees, and we walk, like, down it in, like, a, a wooded area, and they'll just be, like, there's be a pine tree full of these, and they're big turkeys. Turkeys, they're big vultures. They're massive, and they'll just be, like, sitting there watching you. <laughs> I, I like how creepy they are, though. <laughs> I love them. But they're also, like, it's creepy. <laughs> I also like how creep. Oh, who is this child? Yeah, we'll save the game. Who is this? <laughs> this child's face. Child? Okay, sit video game? Will Wright? Sending a request to Will Wright? Who are you, sir? Oh boy, look at his little face. <laughs> oh no, his arm. Sir? This is a Calicundian. Um, I don't know if they're- I don't think they're particularly hostile. I think they'd just fly away if you were to, like, chase them away. Um, to, the ones that I saw just kind of, like, sat there and stared at me because I was far enough away. He's doing his dance. There we go. He's dancing to the song. There you go. Thing is, nothing's on right now. His name? Oh, it's Orlando. Wait. Orlando Bertino. Oh, I got confused because we renamed that other kid Orlando. That's what I was thinking. I was like, that's not the kid that I named Orlando. It's a different Orlando. <laughs> and we have two Orlandos now. Different last names though. Okay, the girlies are doing good. I don't know what. I don't know who brought this kid home. The end is near. Make preparations. Okay. <laughs> three stream streak party! Yay! <laughs> Thank you for the street stream streak! People's planning murders. None of the certain birds just sit in their groups and judge everyone. Yeah, the crows are like that. We have ravens, which are, are different than crows, of course. They're they're bigger and they make different noises and they I think they, they, they act kind of similarly, but I think there's a little bit of difference between the two in their behaviors, and I really like the ravens, and they'll also sit in, like, the same... It's There's one big dead pine tree that they really like to sit in. They'll all just sit there, and they'll be, like, talking and, like, playing amongst each other. Yeah, they're like jumbo crows. <laughs> they're like jumbo crows. I just remember one time... Oh, Angela? Angela? Never more. <laughs> um, I saw... I remember looking out, I don't remember if I was sitting on the porch or whatever, my neighbor has a ton of cats, and they're always outside. And... This cat had, like, had gotten a mouse or something, some little thing, it was, it had its mouth. And he, it had, like, it had it between its paws or whatever, and it was out in, like, sort of, like, the driveway area. Like, we're on, like, a dirt road, it was kind of, like... And... The cat had the like some some little thing, and all of a sudden a raven lands right next to it, and the raven is like towering over the cat because it's like the raven's like at least twice the cat's size, if not more. Like they're just massive <laughs> compared to this little kitty, and the cat just like froze and backed away, and the raven just grabbed the thing and flew off whatever he had. <laughs> He's like, "It's mine now." And the cat's like, "Okay, <laughs> yes, yes, sir." <laughs> uh, d oh, okay. Mortimer wants to talk to Mary Sue. Okay, Mary Sue's sleeping though. What do you think Mortimer's gonna tell Mary Sue? We gotta watch Mary Sue's interaction. 
<laughs> a teacher in high school argued with me whether ravens live where we are. They clearly do and are part of the local indigenous lore. And I was like, my dude, the bird I saw that was half the height of my garbage can was not a crow, I assure you. Yeah. <laughs> they're big. I love them. I think they're so cool. I have that's what that's what these are. These are some of my raven feathers from the raven set. I find them underneath the tree where they sit. I have them. They're you can see how I mean you could just see how big they are from these feathers. Like <laughs> they're huge. <laughs> these are just like a wing feather or probably a tail feather. I'm not quite sure. It's hello daydreamer. <laughs> hello, hello. Hello nutters. Hello nutters. Oh. Oh, I missed what she said to him. Damn it, I got distracted. I got distracted. Big boy feathers. Big boy feathers. Hello, daydreamer. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> not the pink flashing. Not the pink. Not the pink flashing sandwiches. It's because daydreamer's here. It's because daydreamer's here. <laughs> daydreamer, why did you have to do that? <laughs> pink lunch. You heard you, now, you've heard about pink soup. Now get ready for pink sandwich. <laughs> pink pink sandwich. Well, I brought the pink soup. Uh oh, he made the cat throw up. Daniel. Daniel. All right. So you've come just in time, dreamer, for us to uh be almost done with this household and then. Watch a machinima before I'm done. Because <laughs> we're past six hours. The saves are out of order. Which, what's, what save? What do you mean the saves are out of order? <laughs> I'm going to complete that. Love the coat of the kitty. Yeah, it's interesting. I think it's actually the, the wrinkly cat skin with the fur, like, patterns all out, out, all over it. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, it's supposed to be, like, wrinkly cat skin. I guess it's just the color. Oh, that's on cooldown. I see. Uh, Bjorn is calling for Danny boy. And Angela answered. Where's Angela? Oh, up here. Uh oh. Everybody's calling. Pacino, baby. <laughs> no, you. I get really tired today, so I've been sleeping until now. Glad I didn't miss Machinima, though. Yes, we did watch one Machinima midway. Who's stealing? Is somebody yelling? Oh, Bella's here. Queen Bella. Hello, Queen. Oh my god. Uh, should we greet Bella? She's yelling at Tiffany Burb, who's just stole our newspaper. He just hung up on Loki and s or on Bjorn. Yeah, you did miss one. You missed one, and it was the yeah, the third episode of my life series. It was only four minutes long or something. Then we got another one to watch. That's what I think we're going to watch next. Watch at least one, maybe maybe two, depending. Okay, they are into each other. I think they need to, like, just go woohoo in the hot tub. <laughs> I think that would be fun. Who's going to get to have a baby first with, with Bella? Herb or, or him? <laughs> or Danny? Because both Herb and Danny have been fooling around with Bella. Both the Bellas. <laughs> so, actually, Danny hasn't quite earned his place with Bella clone. He needs to get with her more. But he's got it going on with original Bella. And everybody knows that she's really the one that matters, you know. You know. They fooling around. He says, you know, I was almost a doctor once. <laughs> she's like, no, you weren't. <laughs> he's like, yeah, no, I wasn't. <laughs> I lied. I could make her, yeah, I could make her selectable. Dun dun dun! Poor baby chins. Look at the time, I'd better go. Okay, bye Orlando. See you around, bud. Yes, I like this hot tub replacement. Um, it default replaces the aspiration tub. Oh, oh, Danny boy! Oh, 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 oh. oh. Are they <laughs> make okay? 
I don't know. Spoiler alert, Derek is not a, a trustworthy secondary character. <laughs> I think that was established. Okay, they're finally going at it. Mary Sue is home. She's asleep. Oh, she wants a promo. I also gotta get the girlies in private school. Angela seems to really like playing games. I love how self-sufficient the girlies are up here. They're just doing their thing. They do need to do homework, though. I'm gonna just make them do their homework. They got two days worth of homework sitting here. Oh. I got, oh, that's right. These two have not wooed yet. It's more like Darek. Darek. <laughs> yeah, if I do have a, I think I have a mod that makes it so that there's a little bit of a different, the way that like the upset happens with like cheating, it makes, it changes it a little bit. So it's not like just if it happens on the lot at all, they'll get upset. I don't remember exactly, but I don't, I don't know. We'll see. It says Mary Sue. Mary Sue seems to not realize she's happily asleep. I think she'd have, I think she has to be awake and in the vicinity for it to count or something. <laughs> He's so cursed with that jaw, Chadnall. Chadnall. I didn't hear baby bells. <laughs> he makes his, yeah. <laughs> we were saying that that's his whole purpose. This hair, I didn't choose this hair. It ended up on him um, just by like defaults or whatever. Um, but we were saying it looks like he, he's trying so hard to look like younger and not accept that he's middle-aged. <laughs> you know? We should we give... I didn't realize he's actually almost middle-aged. What if... What if I gave him, like, a minor wrinkle? Also, I turned the volume way down for that. Let me turn it back up. I can't even hear. In Spanish, we would call that... Pe I'm gonna try it. <laughs> Pendevejo? I don't know if I said that. Penda Vijo? Um, I wouldn't say happily, but she's de he's, she's definitely asleep. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> My phone is at five percent battery. I have and I have two animals sleeping on me. Oh no! You're playing a, a nasty, tricky game right now. What if he's just got like a little bit going on? Like yeah, like a light. I don't know about the face. Maybe. Mm, I don't think. I was thinking like, I wish there was a little bit more subtle one of these. Maybe I'll have to look and see if I found there's more. Maybe we'll just give him some eye bags. We'll just give him a little bit of a light eye bag. He's getting a little bit. It's like a mix of being old and child. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, some last minute drama. Got some last minute drama happening. Okay. Kirby said we we need some final words. And he's literally about to kiss lightly. <laughs> this is gonna be a mess because Daniel's gonna kiss her. And then they're gonna get upset and it's gonna be a it's gonna be a whole mess. Oh. Uh oh. See, this is about to happen, and then he's gonna- somebody else is gonna get upset. Somebody else? No, maybe not. Maybe Herbie doesn't care. Uh-oh, Coral's so mad at Miss Bella. <laughs> Herb just turns on the music. He's like, let's just forget about this. He just turns on some smooth jazz. Not these two boys sharing Bella right now. I told you this is going to happen. They're taking turns. I hate it. <laughs> They're taking turns. Pearl cannot believe what she's seeing. She's too tons son to speak. <laughs> taking I hate it. <laughs> it's gross. Coral's just sitting in here. She can't help it. She's just like... She doesn't even have any wants. I wish that they'd get more like wants related to it maybe they maybe we need to if we encourage more arguing i'm gonna have her like yell at him and stuff we'll have him like do more 
She's like, what are you doing sitting here just continuing to dance with her in my space? I feel like she should be mad at Daniel, too. Oh, there he goes his. She's gonna shove Daniel and say, what the hell's wrong with you? My, my, my daughter's husband. Is there, here we go, argue. You gotta try and get him to be like proper enemies or something for him to get wants, you know, for... Not little Angela! Oh no! Angela, where are you doing awake? Oh no! <laughs> Bella needs all the love. Bella is a needy lady. This city is full of cheating. It is. It is. Come on, Coral, attack Bella. That's true. Bella, that's true. I could do that. My custom Sims 2 is also full of cheating. To be honest, if there's a romance sim in the hood, there's bound to be some cheating. Yeah, I know. It's kind of my favorite part, though. <laughs> it's kind of my favorite part. Argue. We'll, we'll argue. They're arguing. I wish that, like, a sim could tell, like, another, like, she, like, Coral is, I mean, a Coral would 100% tell Mary Sue, you know what I mean? I don't know if that's possible. Bella now's the reason to be abducted by it, you're right. She's gonna move to Strange Town or something. Purple just leaving. Does gossiping do that? Maybe? We could try. Does it? Yes? Is that yes to... Is that yes to the alien abducted by aliens, or... It does so... Okay. <laughs> I, I can see what you're saying. <laughs> I can translate. I can translate typos. <laughs> Goosby Bob, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I'm, I'm like two followers away from 800, y'all. I think they can allegedly discover- No, you're right. <laughs> I, I assumed you were really excited to share. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> they allegedly discover cheating through gossip. Okay. I'll have to give it a try. She's gonna go argue- She's autonomously arguing. Oh, Bella's just playing with, with, with Angela? How could you? It's Thursday. We're supposed to be done with this household, but there's- It's juicy. It's juicy. I think she's- What if she wakes up- If she, let's try. I'm gonna unlock the door. I might as well just not have these doors locked because all I'm doing is unlocking them constantly. She's just she's sleeping about rats or dreaming about rats. Coral's got some burning hot news for you. Let's see. Let's gossip. See if it happens. Oh, uh, one sec. I'm gonna. Daniel would ask her not to, and Coral may hold it over Danny. That's true. That's true. Daniel would black. Yeah, Coral would blackmail. All right, Daniel. Yeah, that's true. Coral would blackmail Danny. I don't know what. Like, what she get out of it though? I feel like Coral's so innocent. Hmm. Let's just see if I have him do it like a couple times. She's gossiping about Tiffany right now, so that's not it. Oh, she's talking about Bella. She's talking about a Bella. Talk about Danny. Well, it doesn't seem to have affected anything. Should I, like, make it happen? I feel like, I think we could just count that. Like, I could make it happen, right? I could make them... Like, we could do... Yeah, Mary Sue has to process, but I can do make furious, right? No, that's remove. I feel like set enemies would be good. Set to, like, I could do set to negative 20. Maybe. Is that this Bella? I don't... Where is she? Negative 20. I'm not sure. A contemplative poop, yes. <laughs> I think I will count it for the plot. Let's see, set remove. 
Is there just like dislike? I guess it's enemies. I think it would make sense that she'd call her an enemy. Also, I, did I did I read? I missed your message, Daydreamer. Uh, I have a sim part of my legacy who got teen pregnant, ended up marrying the guy she had a kid with when they were adults. He then got secondary romance aspirations, cheated on her a lot. She found out on her birthday and kicked him out. She then found a townie man, fell in love with the townie, and he cheated on her too. Oh no. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> Let's see. I think she'd be mad at- do you think she's mad at her- her father to- well, yeah, her father? I don't know if- I, can I set Furious? I can remove Furious, but I can't. Oh, that's right, I gotta also do, like, top and bottom, so short term. Yeah, pink grill. We have pink grilled cheesies. We have some pink grilled cheesies in the in the house here. Um, let's see. What what's okay? Can I? Can I use this one? Furious state. Hmm. Shift click, you're right. Shift, that's what it is. I'm making it too complicated. So how do I... Do I have to shift click on him to make Furious? Make Furious with the Sim. Yes. Thank you. Yes, yes. I think she'd be mad at her dad, too. I could just have been dragging these two, you know? I don't need to be setting things, but... Maybe we'll do, like, really mad at these two. I feel like there's a chance she'll have a little more bias towards her father, you know? There we go. And then make... Make Furious with Bella. Oh, a love has spawned between these two. I think we're gonna ask Bella to leave. Everybody's upset about this place. Ask to leave partner? No, we just need you to literally- we need her to literally leave. Oh, I have her made selectable, that's the issue. Say goodbye. There we go. Yeah, it's also the cat. The cat's the least of our worries right now. <laughs> the cat is the least of our worries. Alright, well this is gonna leave us with a juicy little issue for next time. I'm gonna just get Bella to leave. <laughs> She's wondering how her life has become this, yeah. Strawberry girl chi. <laughs> Stinky pink sandwich. Stinky pink sandwich. Okay. Yeah, that was that was that was quite an ending to our time with this household. I will save. I think that um next time next round that will leave us with some chaos and some maybe if it'll pop up and show up in other uh households, I'm sure too. Um, okay. I'm going to edit- e exit the video game. We're gonna watch- I'm gonna watch one more machinima. Oh, I already have the- the thing. Bye, Dreamy! Have a good night! Have a good one. You didn't- you did not miss all the chaos. Honestly, if anything, you- you- you caught the most important part. Oh. Oh. There we go. Is that showing up correctly? No, it is not. Do this way. Thank you for hanging out, Dreamy. Have a good night. Okay. We're gonna watch episode three. No, this is the one we already watched. We gotta go to the next one. You know. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Episode four. Life is hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I gotta get going too. Have fun. Okay, thank you, Kaylee, for hanging out. Have a very good night. Have a good one. Okay, we'll just watch this one. I had to it split episode five into three parts. So instead of just looking for episode five, search for episode five, part one, part one third, or just click the annotation at the end of the video. Okay. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> these, these are very fascinating. 
Okay, uh, I got the wrong sound source. Okay, let's go. <laughs> the same intro every time. I love how crunchy it is. <laughs> we were living the best times. We didn't know we were making memories. <laughs> Oh, you even have some very old Sims 3 machinimas of yourself? That's funny. <laughs> well, I'm going to leave, too. Have funny. Okay, thank you, Dante. Have a good night. We're pretty much done here, too. I'm just going to watch this, and we'll be done. Swinger Chris. Fang. Fang. Fang and Raven. Wait, who's that girly? That's a new girly. She's new. Vita? Oh, she's got them cool checker pants. The emo kid pants. Oh, the, the cut of the music. I'm gonna- wait. Sorry. Life is hard. I'm gonna take a walk. <laughs> okay, this is Roxy. Be careful out there. Okay, but they were just- okay, so last time she got kidnapped, and then they got her back. Yeah, very hard to read. <laughs> Uh, so it, it happened when she was walking by herself at night and then her boyfriend here, who I think is named Connor, he's apparently super protective of her, but now she's like, okay, I'm going to go take a walk by myself. Bye. And he's like, yeah, okay, have fun. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> she just gets hit, casually gets hit by a car. Okay. They're starting out good. This what what is Roxy has bad luck. <laughs> Roxy has some bad luck. <laughs> let's re let's let's recap. Be careful out there. Don't get don't get kidnapped again, wifey. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the way they popped the roof up. Well, the, they went up and the roof they, they forgot that the roof wasn't up <laughs> that's me taking screenshots <laughs> who is it oh my gosh somebody help please or please help It was a car accident, and I ran over some girl. You idiot, she's pregnant. How did he... Okay, okay. <laughs> when I came back, then Roxy is in some shit again. Main character... Yeah, she just got hit by a car in the first five seconds of the episode. <laughs> she just walked outside. I'm so sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Just please help her. Wait, what's this little emo boy supposed to do? You're the, you're the grown adult that drives. I don't think this emo boy even has a driver's license. Yeah, like, she also got hurt. Like, <laughs> like, please help her. What do you mean? You're the one who has the cell phone. Of course I'm gonna help her. What's he gonna- he's gonna drag her inside on the car. Oh god, he had the Mortimer face for a sec. She's over here. Don't pick her up and move her. <laughs> You're gonna screw up her neck or something. Uh, okay, we- okay. We're at the- Roxy just- I think Roxy likes the attention. I'm gonna say it. <laughs> I think Roxy enjoys this. <laughs> She's just sleeping. It's okay. <laughs> the She's in a coma. Everybody's leaving. Okay. <laughs> this this dramatic song <laughs> with this. Did this button just use teens? Like, there's no. I think I don't know. I you might. They might have. I couldn't- I don't know if that- the Derek guy was an adult. That guy, I guess, the kid that was yelling- that ran over looked like maybe a teen. This- this hospital room. I, you know what's funny? I think it looks like the way the door turned to, like, blue. I think that's usually what happens either when it's just, like, a big, empty, dark space outside this area, or... It's just like, this is a random room in the middle of an empty lot at night. <laughs> and it just, I don't know why. That, I think that's what that does. That's why it turns blue like that. So I just, I'm imagining just this 
this little little uh house just this little room drawn in the middle of, of an empty big lot <laughs> this part kills me oh god well she's not looking too good however is she gonna live what about the baby roxy is probably gonna live but but what the baby may not make it <laughs> Wasn't the wasn't she only just barely pregnant? Like she's still like not even showing. No, <laughs> the way I used to sob at these the concrete angel one. Oh, Dr Dreamer shared the we haven't watched the concrete angel one. I don't think I will, but <laughs> so funny. Sucks to be you, baby. No, the baby is going to live. You'll see it will. <laughs> what Connor? Connor? Connor has a complex. <laughs> Connor has a little bit of a complex. <laughs> oh god. Please, oh please, please save them. I can't lose them. They are my world. You gotta save them. I'll do anything. Connor's gonna start a satanic ritual. Okay. Let me get what I want this time. I will do I will see what I can do. <laughs> do they have that same default that we see in let's see, I don't know if they do. In every single machinima there's a default that makes this this is the reward object or like that that uh career reward, that like surgery one that's like Cersei Beaker has. There's the default replacement that makes it like look like a real purse, like a skin person with skin on the table. <laughs> Let's see if they got that. <laughs> or is he just gotta not show it? Oh. Nope, nope. It's that's the blue dummy. <laughs> just the blue dummy. <laughs> Why was it just like a picture of her sleeping? <laughs> He's like doing surgery. <laughs> okay. Doctor was just like, sir, please. <laughs> like it's just the dummy. Roxy's so blue. Look, they're trying to not show it. Ooh, his arms are goofed. What's his arms doing? Oh, maybe that's what it's supposed to do. Got quiet. Yes. They're holding steady, and... They're going to be okay? I swear to God, if, if, if a full full-grown baby appears... <laughs> she wasn't even showing. Like, they will be okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, I don't know. The doctor got his long hair. Did you hear that, Roxy? You're going to be okay. Oh. When can she come home? <laughs> Sir, is that your worry? She kept the baby zipped up in that corset shirt. <laughs> doctor is so dramatic. Saying all that, then he could have helped them to be good with. Yeah. As soon as she wakes up, you guys are free to go. <laughs> she just had major surgery, it seems, which I don't even know what supposed major surgery we had also is this i think he looks like the speaking of like are they all teenagers i think the the doctor looks like an adult maybe <laughs> go ahead walk home bitch <laughs> <laughs> all right watch them actually be walking home the trees these dramatic tree shots <laughs> just like it like <laughs> Thank you for hanging out, party. Have a good one. Have a good night. Oh, she just gets up. Roxy. Oh my god. Oh, not you might you might pop a suture, buddy. Don't do that. <laughs> You're gonna hurt her. I'm so happy to see your beautiful blue eyes again. Her little sporty nighty, yeah. <laughs> yes, is the baby gonna be all right? Yep. I just can't believe it. I know, one second here, next thing, so we have to accept... We have to accept these hard things in life. <laughs> Fang's, Fang's really spitting truth right here. 
that we have to accept these hard things in life. <laughs> yeah, no, no parental involvement. Nobody got called. No parents got called. Yeah. Connor, guess who's here? Ta-da! Oh, she got herself a new... They stopped at the Hot Topic on the way home. They stopped at the mall and got a new outfit. Got her hair did. Hey, Roxy, glad to see you're okay. Why are you guys so bummed out? We're thrilled to see Roxy alive. It's just... <laughs> we kind of hated her. Like, we were kind of glad she was dead? No. It's just... Yeah, welcome home, Roxy. What? It's just what? <laughs> Something happened. What is it, you guys? The song just ended really quick. <laughs> like, glad you're okay, Roxy, but you're annoying. <laughs> they had to vacuum seal her outfit and decompress the pregnant belly, yeah. Why is it quiet? Oh. Well, Raven and Kendra were killed in a fire during a college party. Oh. <laughs> oh. What in the- okay, I need to know, like, what- like, these kids must- what- what Ouija board, like, where did- what did they- they must have been goofing with some kind of rituals at- at their creepy cult here. Like, what- what- what curse did they bring upon themselves? <laughs> this person said, I straight up don't want these characters anymore. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, lips? No way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's impossible. Why did you have to walk away? You're lying. They can't die. You're lying. Uh, Takuya's plot armor. <laughs> That's impossible. I was supposed to die, not them. <laughs> okay. Don't cry, Roxy. I'm sure they're in a better place now. Please don't cry. It makes me sad to feel your pain. Sir? He said, I'm an empath. He said, hi, my name's Connor, and I'm an empath. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't even talked about Raven says that, yeah, I know. Oh, I missed what it, what it said. Wait. Everything will be okay, I promise. The sudden whiplash? Is this when that new chick gets introduced? Because there was a new chick in the intro. Is this the new chick? She's going to come in and be like, Hey, everybody, I'm replacing your friends. <laughs> Doorbell rings. Vita. Veta? Yep, that's her. <laughs> oh, I'm Veta. Sorry to bother you, but I'm kind of looking for a place to live. And if it's okay if you say no, because I'm just some stranger. And... Raven? Oh my gosh, have you been crying? You okay? Oh, they, they said all the emo girls look the same. All the goth dark girls look the same. They said they're all the same. You must be Raven. <laughs> Beto was hiding in the shadows waiting for some occupancy on the family lot, yeah. What's, I want to know what her shirt says, too. I'm sorry you just remind me of someone who passed away recently. Oh. I've got mad ninja skills. Oh, that's what her shirt says. I've got mad ninja skills. Or I've got... I think it says either mad ninja skill. I Yeah, I've got mad ninja skills. Okay. You can move in. No problem. You'll make a friend in no time. Really? Thanks. Oh, oh, Connor just did some teleportation. <laughs> she lit the fire. <gasps> she did. It's her. <laughs> like in spin-off games, this is literally just how the main character moves into places sometimes. Yeah. Rad ninja skills, maybe. Either rad or mad. Not the tuxedo t-shirt. Everyone, this is Veda. She's moving in with us. Chris, hey, I'm Chris. Nice to meet you. Not that. <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm the basic brunette. I'm the diversity hire. 
I'm Alex. Welcome to your new home. You'll love it here. I'm Connor. <laughs> I'm also Roxy's boyfriend. Hee <laughs> hee. Ew. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> and this is Fang. His real name is Daniel, <laughs> but he prefers to be called Fang. <laughs> okay, we got some lore. We got some lore. <laughs> I'm the PDA with this, right? Oh, it's the love story. Uh, new lore unlocked. Fag is Daniel Pleasant. <gasps> Daniel Pleasant. Oh, he said, he said bye. <laughs> yeah, he had kind of the colors in his hair. Interesting choice. Don't worry. Usually when he does that, it means he likes you. He's just too shy to meet you. Yeah, I know. Their butts are like this is hanging out under the long shirts. Yeah, it's like it's like this girly here. Like that's that belt is across the cheeks. Like her belt is on the cheeks. The middle of the cheeks. <laughs> Watching face. Oh, what what did we just transition to? <laughs> Who is he? Oh, is this the guy in prison? Uh, this is the kind of CC kids made. Yeah, you're right. It's it, it's like it's like they're um sort of like they're exaggerating like their little ideal fashions and stuff with the really low pants and the yeah. And we live here without any parental supervision, and I'm the main character. You will die when you no longer are relevant, and or you will help me live when I die again, when I almost die again, but I will never die because I am the main character. <laughs> Impossible beauty standards. Okay, stupid. <laughs> stupid cop. That's the character's name. <laughs> stupid cop. Okay, your time up. I think. It's either you or um Dylan. Just get out. <laughs> the way he's seductively laying on the floor over here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he's just he's just on the floor. Nut god. Derek is out for revenge. <laughs> Not the nut god. I gotta take a nut god photo. Wait, let me <laughs> gotta take a nut god photo. There we go. Yeah, this creator said a cab. Okay, this is the creep that kidnapped her. To be continued. Okay. All right. <laughs> Interesting. We'll give him a thumbs up. I need to do that with more of these. Eight-year-old message. I love how she is smiling when telling Roxy that Kendra and Vampire Chick died. OMFG, I would have started laughing so hard if Connor had said to Roxy, be careful out there, that she replied with, what am I going to do, get hit by a car? LMFAO. That'd be hilarious. 11-year-old <laughs> comment. I just love how Alex is smiling when she... Oh. Okay. 10-year. Cried at the part when she ran into the bathroom crying. Still crying now. Wow, emotions hit me like, like the car that hit Roxy. <laughs> oh, wait. That was kind of funny. <laughs> The, the emotions hit me like the car that hit Roxy. <laughs> Beta is a reincarnation of Raven. That's my theory. Okay. I'm looking for old comments. The driver is a kind person because he didn't just run away like some dumb arse when he ran over. He got help. Okay. When Roxy was in the hospital, it was probably like this. Fang, ugh, I'm leaving. Chris, I'm getting late. I think I'm gonna, it's, I'm gonna leave. Alex crying, please, Roxy, be okay. Please, leaves. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, dumb arse. Connor, be careful, Roxy. I'll be fine. Gets hit by car. <laughs> These are kind of funny. These comments are kind of funny. <laughs> Natalie, I heart your episode. Love them. <laughs> Doing this. Okay. I don't know what everyone else thinks, but I love this series. Roxy can't step out of the house to leave Connor once, can she? Ounce <laughs> once. Okay. Why doesn't Raven get to do much? She's my favorite person. She's dead now, Loop Chan. She's dead now. Sorry. 
<laughs> Sorry, Luke Chan. And you, I would love to say Maddie or Ryan has the worst life. Okay. Connor, be careful out there. Roxy, yeah, I will. Next minute. Hit by car. I know I'm not funny. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think we I think we get the picture. <laughs> I think we get the picture. Oh my god. The comment of Roxy being a walking danger magnet. <laughs> That's true. I missed that one. That's funny. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Once again, it is, is six hours and 56 minutes. We are at almost seven hours. <laughs> How does this keep happening? <laughs> How do we keep ending up here? What did, what did we do to deserve this? <laughs> it was fun. <laughs> yeah, thank you for seven hour stream. Yeah, I enjoyed, I enjoyed, uh, Dan, the household. <laughs> there was a lot going on in that household. Um, but yeah, I'll be back Saturday with um, Calicundia, our little custom hood, Mr. Calicundia. Mr. Calicundia? Mrs. Calicundia, perhaps? Um, yeah, seven hours, man. Six hours and 56 minutes, technically. We also enjoyed Dan. Dan and Herbal Oldie. Herbal Old Spice. <laughs> Danny, Danny Pleasant and Herbal Old Spice. Um, yeah, I'll be back Calicundia. And then, depending on how things go... I'm thinking of trying out a Sunday stream with the uh, PSP console emulator. I'm going to goof around with that, maybe. Have, like, a little stream on Sunday. Experimenting with that. Um, yeah, and then I'll have a, also have a video out probably either Sunday or Monday, depending. Um, but that's it for now. I'm going to get up some music here. Hopefully it'll let me play the song. I guess we're just going to replay the same song. <laughs> yes, PSP goodness. PSP goodness. Okay, I'm going to go now. Thank you very much. Goodbye.